Well, hey everybody, it's Josh with Resort TV One, and I am live here at Disney's Animal Kingdom for the beginning of our epic four park all day live stream. Welcome everybody. And if you are new to the channel, just joining us, definitely be sure to hit the subscribe button right below the video. Also, hit the notification bell to be notified every time we go live or have a new video and follow us on social media. We are Resort TV One on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, and now Threads. So check it out on all the things. So let's do this. And today is going to be very special because most of the time people have to wait till 2 p.m. to park hop. But because Jen and I are an awesome team and we work together, Jenna is going to start the day at Epcot today. I'm starting the day at Animal Kingdom. I think Dad's going to join me a little bit later and Mom's with Jenna. And so we are going to be switching it back and forth throughout the morning. And then when it's time to park hop, Jenna's going to go to Magic Kingdom and I will go to Hollywood Studios. And then I will eventually meet everybody at Magic for a magical evening of rides and fireworks to end this epic day. So welcome everybody and thanks for being up early. We're going to, of course, do the safari because it's beautiful in the morning. I never get here this early and animals are more active this early. All right. So let me say hi to some people. If you already said hi to me, sorry, I was walking real fast. You can say it again. Bella, Jane, Vicky Cross, Croft, Lady Jamers. Hello. Welcome and good morning. Kaylee. Yes, making it as efficient as possible. We make a great team. We sure do. <laughs> and I say that because I appreciate having somebody to be part of a team. And yeah, it is awesome that mom and dad join us. We celebrated mom's birthday with the whole family yesterday. Liam and Steph and everybody came over. And then, um, having fun today too. Hi Tanina, hi Dan, hey Brad. Hello 2000, Dan LB, Susan J, Dancing Princess, Cat in the Kingdom, hello, hello. If I miss your message at any point, you can repost because we're gonna be here for a long time. Hey Darth Mommy, Aurora, Disney, Kelly, Max, here we are. Safari time. Oh yeah, for sure, Jeffrey, uh, J Mercedes. Hey Jeffrey Pop, hey Alicia, or Alessia, Eli, Kayla, Disney Fanatic, Christine, Halloween dad, hello, hello. It says 20, so that's not too bad. Hopefully we can get on there pretty quick. Hi, Corey Ruprecht, Safari, early in the morning. That's the plan, that is the plan. All right, Stephen Cook, Danielle, welcome, welcome. Thanks for being here, everybody. Danger Mouse Dean, five pounds. Uh, Hi everyone. Hello, Danger Mouse Dean. Hello and welcome. All right. Thanks for the super chat. First one of the day. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Michelle. Hey, Scott. Minnie Mouse number one fan. Kinsey. Carly Nelson. Safari's back open. Everest still down. Oh no. Was Safari was closed? When was that? Yesterday? Am I doing Kali? We'll see. Probably not because I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to uh, be wet all day. So yeah, probably no on that one. Hey, Kaylee. Hey, Felix. Hi Tony, Tara, Rico, Herbie, DPB, Sarah, Susan, Bespoke, Amber, Timothy, Bill, Crazy Guy, David, Cameron, Craig's Robotics, Joey's World. Joey's World always used to join us for the all day streams, part of the all day crew. Boy, that lined up faster than I thought. That, that escalated quickly. It's alright, we're good. All right, this is as early as I could get here. Hey, K Pepper. Hey, Jack. Yeah, stay cool. We're gonna stay cool. Hello, Nettie's Garden. Dan P says Jumbo. Hey, Rico. Should go quickly because there are probably not as many lightning lanes right now. Hello, Honora. No, we don't have Genie Plus. We we won't need it. We will have a lot going on today. We decided we didn't want to um, didn't want to get it every time. So I, I had it last Saturday. All right. Hey, Karen. Hey, Amy loves Disney. I'm booking it, yep. <laughs> this morning, Safari and Everest were down. My family's there today. Oh yeah, come say hi, Carly, for sure. I'm sure Everest will be up soon. Hey, Patrick. No lag so far, good. We'll keep it that way, hopefully. Jack. Yeah, we're headed to Safari, that's right, Lauren. 
looks like it might all day park hopping might return in January. I hope. I hope. That was fast. Yeah, Christopher. Yeah, there's really no reason, honestly, for the not having all day park hopping. Even if they made it like at 11 or noon, it would be better. You were fine last time. That's true, Phil. That's true. But I'm not going to take the chance. I'm not going to take the chance. So, Christopher Black, thanks for being here. Hey, Dave. Hey, Karen. Metallica Live. Jay Owens. Jack. TTA Ken. Chad. Jacob. Big guy. Get your ears on. Nora. Dave. Yeah, it's so expensive to get Genie Plus every trip. Man, we come a lot, so that's why I don't usually do it. It does add up. Hey, Matthew. Hey, Jerry. Hey, Amy. Arnell. Alexa. Scott. Shelby. Jamie. T-Town, Mary Ellen. Beth. Corey Rupert. The Yeti might be sleeping in. True. He might be grumpy today. Nobody likes to see a grumpy Yeti in the morning, that's for sure. <laughs> Hi, Plymouth Rock. GG. Hello. Good morning. Hi Dusty. Hi Jack. Got plenty of shade in here. It's, it's actually not a bad place to wait except for no air moves. I say Todd and Leslie, Lee and Robin, Patrick Resort Hopper, Madeline, Amy Loves Disney, Rebecca. Great. Like, the, the overseas hoppers get to watch the stream not past their bedtime. That's true. Hey Brad. Uh, Cameron, 99 cents, always love your shows. But I'm sorry, I'm, I said that wrong. Can't read. 9.99 pounds, 10 pounds, always love your shows. Thanks, Cameron. Going ninja. No worries, Christopher, we'll see you after church. Have a great service. Hey, Stacy. Hi, Bill. Yeah, we're, we're looking forward to it. Jenna and I are very excited about today. <clears throat> and we're not trying to, you know, we're not trying to break any records or... Um, you know, trying to do a challenge this time. Sometimes in the past we've done a park hopping challenge of some kind, but we're not going to do that. We're just going to, our challenge today is to visit all four parks uh, on the stream. Now, Jen and I both each won't have visited four parks, but the stream will have visited four parks. And we just thought that might make it more interesting because we won't be waiting around here till 2 o'clock. So. Oh, book the buffet? Yeah, that'd be cool. Hey, Isabel. Hey, Disney. Yeah, that gets expensive, too, afterwards. Well, or every once in a while. Hey, Stephen. Hey, Disney. Sarah. Hey, Rico. Hey, Jack. Leo's mom. Yeah, the buffet. those buffets are really good, though, for sure. Yep, I got my water, and I have my electrolyte packets, too. Um, my wife buys these Tom Brady electrolyte packets. And I, hashtag not a sponsor. But, you know, anyway, I don't know. She says they're really good, and I'm going to try them again today. Between the British Open and Resort TV One, I'm becoming a morning person. Nice. Uh, Tony, it's not too bad yet. Uh, it's 79, according to my watch. My car said 82, 82 driving in, so I don't know which one you choose to believe. The car usually says it's warmer than the, uh, than the app does. I usually believe the car. When it comes to safaris, we go Hey Linda, hey Jinjo, hey Richard, hey Dana, hey Kelly. All right, Hanora, we're hoping to visit all four in a day come November um, for the next family trip. One roller coaster from each park. Nice. That'll be cool. We could technically do that, but I don't think Jen is going to get a Guardian's Pass for today. She doesn't like to hold the camera on the roller coasters. So, um, but yeah, it's only. You only have one shot in Epcot for a roller coaster, and that's uh, Guardians. Hello, Mr. Cheez-Its. Hello, Jean. Nemo with glasses. And, of course, maybe a non-starter today if they don't get Everest up. <laughs> that's the only one here. But yeah, I love it. I love it. If Tom Brady was a sponsor, you could physically visit Disney World and Disneyland on the same day. That is true. That is true. <laughs> hey, Tony. Hey, Rebecca. Hey, Shelby. Jumbo, everyone. And welcome to Kilimanjaro Safaris. After this ride, Jenna take over. No, not quite. Not quite, Shelby. Uh, I'm going to do a few rides here, and then Jenna's going to take over a little later. I let her let her sleep in a little bit. Not really. She didn't really sleep in, but I let her. She had to. She has to go um, pick up mom and everything, and so it takes a little longer for them. So, and I'm really, um, I'm really fast in the morning. So, hi from behind you, Martin says hello, Teresa. Miss Flipper, it was a Tom, Tom Brady one, so, yeah. Hello. <laughs> it's funny because 
sometimes people will do that but not actually be there. And so I'm like, is there really somebody behind me? Yes, there is. That's cool. <laughs> do you guys usually watch or did you just find it? We just watched it. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, sure. Information. Absolutely. Yeah, we usually do live streams and all kinds of things. So yeah, when you yeah. when you get back home, you can yeah, check, check it out for yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> if it stays like this all day, we'll be good. But <laughs> I have a feeling it won't. <laughs> Hard to stay cool in Animal King. Yeah, it is. That's why I brought my brought my water. And we are moving pretty good, guys. We are getting really close. This is not going to be 20 minutes for sure. I didn't figure it would. There's very very few lightning lanes coming in. You see Mickey. It's a uh, Resort TV One. Resort TV One. Yeah, on YouTube. The, on YouTube yeah, the, the number one. Yep. Yeah. Just like my hat. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> yeah, it's moving real quick, Carly. Good morning from Indiana. Hello, Alessa. Hello, Annette. Sorry if I say like hi to people twice in a row. Sometimes I. Get a little spacey. <laughs> when does summer band camp start? We don't have one. <laughs> and I like that. Don't get me wrong. I love marching band. We did hardcore marching band for six years. Went to state. Got the t-shirt. Had my name on the big screen. My kids did amazing. But after that, <laughs> after six years, I was I was good to go. Morning, Jumbo. So yeah, no, but um, so we don't have a summer band. We just start right when school starts. And it's awesome. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> they were both about the same. Oh, Jack, I'm looking forward to it too. Hey, Disney Boiler, good to see you. So, no, great memories doing marching band, but it's nice to have the whole summer now. If there were animals in the safari in the chat, what would they be saying? Uh, that's a good question. Making a lot of new friends. Yes, Kali River. Not today, I don't think. I don't want to be wet all day. Okay. One? Just one, I said we've got two. Road two? Okay. Alright. Hey, Craig. At one time at band camp, that's right. Hey, Kathy. My son starts band camp tomorrow and he's dreading the heat. Yeah, Craig. Tell them to stay safe, and he, uh, you already know this, probably, but hydrate before camp starts. It's important. A lot of people don't know that, but you have to hydrate yourself before you get out in the heat. By the time you're already hot, it's too late. Here they come. Fast and furious safari trucks. We did it. And you got to take marching man seriously. Yep. Well, and I was. This was in Florida, but yeah, I was in. I, I was on staff in several marching bands in Indiana, and we went to state in Indiana too. I never. Um, when I was in school, and I was actually in band, we never went to state. But then I, you know, kind of you kind of figure out what it takes, and it takes a lot of work, but you get there. All right. Karaguni does be welcome. So welcome aboard, everyone. Go ahead and slide all the way to the left. I do recommend little ones take the outside seat on the left hand side. All right, guys. It'll give them the best view of most of the animals Let's do out this. there. Now, if your entire party does not fit, you'll be on the next truck just wait behind that yellow line. On the right, wash those hands, arms, feet, and legs. Doors are sliding close. Enjoy, guys. Sunday sauna warden. Now, as we like to say here in Harambe, Twin Day, which means let's go. Jumbo, everyone, and welcome to Kilimanjaro Safaris. My name is Mallory, and I'm going to be your safari guide today here on the Harambe Wildlife Reserve. Now, before we head out, I do have a few important safety reminders. Be sure to remain seated. Keep those hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the truck at all times. Now, this does include little ones as well. They need to be either on your lap or in the seat next to you. There is no standing or lifting of anyone in the safari or anyone in the air on the safari. The road can get quite bumpy, so this is not only for our safety but for the safety of the animals as well. And we also be sure not to make any noises to the animals as we are just visitors in their homes, so we don't want to call out to them or whistle at them. And we want to be sure to keep our voices low for them. Those in Inside voices while we're inside the reserve. 
Now you want to keep a tight grip on those personal belongings. I cannot stop at any point to retrieve them. So if you do drop something, just let me know at the end of the safari. We'll do our best to get it back to you. Although those animals are pretty curious out there, so I can't guarantee it'll be in the same condition you left it. And that being said, I do recommend if you're taking pictures to put your phones or cameras on a sports mode, action mode, live setting. I can't stop for every animal, and every animal certainly will not stop for us. So I'll help you better capture those photos. Now, we're just hanging out right here while we wait for the warden's clearance. In the meantime, you want to take a look at the animal spotting guide above your head. That'll help you identify some of the friends you may see out there. But it looks like we got that clearance, so we're going to head on in. And we're first entering into the Little Aturi Forest. Now, a lot of the animals in the forest like to use different shades of browns and stripes as a way to camouflage in their surroundings. So they are experts at hide and seek in that forest environment. Oh, you're, you're good. <laughs> but I do see some coming up on the left with the saddle billed stork. It's this cute couple over here, black and white birds with colorful bill. That's the largest stork in Africa with quite the impressive wingspan of about nine feet, which is nearly the width of the canopy above your head. Now, I can tell that the one on our left is the female, and the one to the right of that one is the male because of the color of their eyes. They must have yellow eyes, males have brown eyes. If you look on the right, in the top left corner, there's no copy up there. You can just barely see her. She's hanging out behind that bush. Now, the copy looks a little like a deer wearing zebra party pants, but they're actually the only <laughs> one relative to the giraffe. Now, we know this partially because of their long prehensile tongue and the fact that the males have ossicones. They're kind of like little horns on top of their head. It's actually part of their skull structure. Now we know the okapi came first, the giraffe evolved from them, and not the other way around. But despite this, they were actually believed to be a myth in the Western world until about 1901. On our left, there is a black rhino. There's going to be another one coming up ahead though, so we're going to stop and check out him. Now the black rhino is the smallest of the African rhinos, weighing at about 3,000 pounds. You'll see our next one on top of the hill to our left. Now, unfortunately, they are critically endangered. There's less than 5,000 of them in the wild. But good news is, is that those numbers are on the rise, thanks to conservation efforts. Looks like I do spot some antelope coming up ahead. Looks like they're going to be crossing the road. But these are the greater kudu. The greater kudu stand about 5 feet tall, weigh up to 750 pounds. And a group of them is called a forkel. Now, we know those forkle are all females because they don't have horns. Only the males do. And those horns can reach lengths of about six feet, but on average will stay at about four feet. And we can also tell that these are females because they're even in a group. The males are very solitary. You typically find them by themselves, while the females will stay in those groups of two or three. Now, we're going to make our way out of the forest and into the Safi River. Now the Safi River is home to much more aquatic animals, so I always recommend to keep your eyes filled on the waters below. That's typically where they like to hang out during the day. Looks like I see our first ones coming up on the right. We're going to spot some large white birds. They're the pink backed pelicans. And they get their name because during mating season their skin turns pink. And they do mate for life just like the sow build stork, but they're also colonial nesters. So out in the wild you can spot groups of about 20 to 500 pairs all together. Their wingspan is slightly smaller than that of the stork, it's about seven to nine feet. There is a Nile hippopotamus beneath the water on the right, but we've got some more coming up on the left as well. So they're enjoying a little snack over here on the left. Now it's pretty cool to see them having a little snack over here. They're technically nocturnal, you can hold their breath for up to eight minutes. Usually during the day you find them asleep in the water. Because when they venture outside of it, traveling up to six miles in search of food. There's another one coming up on our left. Now hippos stand at about 5 feet tall, 11 feet long, and 5,500 pounds. So while they can swim, they typically choose not to. They don't really like to lug all that weight around while they do. So instead you find them walking along the floor of the river. It's how they conserve their energy. But when they are on land, they can go pretty fast. They can run at about 30 miles an hour. Coming up on our left is the Nile crocodile. Now they are the second largest of the crocodilian species, just yeah, behind the like, American crocodile, at about 16 feet long and weighing on average 500 pounds. Oh, wow. well, that was huge. Now you may have noticed they were all very still. This is because crocs have really slow metabolisms. So they have to conserve as much energy as possible by staying still. 
and Nile crocodiles are also ectothermic or cold blooded, meaning they can't regulate their own body temperature. So in order to stay warm, they'll hang out in the sun, but if they get too warm, they'll just open their mouth and help them to release any excess heat they may have. So it's a little like panting that a domesticated dog may do. Coming up on the right, this really large tree is the baobab tree. That looks a little like it's upside down, almost like roots are growing out on top. Because for nine months out of the year, there aren't any leaves on it. Instead, any water that it does receive will be stored in the trunk, and that trunk can hold about 30,000 gallons in it. So in case water ever does get scarce, both locals and animals can tap into the trunk and use it as a resource. So it's incredibly important to the ecosystem out there, and it's also how it gets the nickname the Tree of Life. Now the next stop on our safari is the savanna. You'll notice that the savanna is much more open. There's a lot less places for animals to camouflage or hide. So you'll typically find faster ones than you would in the forest or the river. It did already look like I see our first savanna animals coming up immediately to our right. There was a confusion of wildebeest in the Tower of Maasai Giraffe. As for the wildebeest, they're part of one of the largest migrations in the world. About 1.5 million of them will migrate around 1,000 miles every year, reaching speeds of about 50 miles an hour. Now, this is called the Great Migration, and for a few years, they were kicking up so much dust as they ran, that that dust cloud was able to be seen from space. And so many wildebeest do participate in the Great Migration, like I said, about 1.5 million of them, because they are the second most densely populated mammal on the planet, just behind humans. Now we're going to see if we can find any predators coming up on the left. Sometimes they like to hang out over here. I'm not sure that they're out this morning, so we're actually going to go catch up with some of the zebras up ahead. There's the Hartman's Mountain zebras on the reserve. They're going to be coming up on our left. There are three subspecies of zebras. Now these ones are excellent climbers, so they have smaller hooves and bigger hearts just for that. And if we're lucky, we might be able to see some of the newest residents. If they're, there they are, the two babies over there. Over your left shoulder, they were both born about two months ago. They're about a week apart. Now they're also hanging out with some sable antelope over there. They're the official emblem of the Harambe Wildlife Reserve as they're one of the only prey that'll fight back against their predators. So they're incredibly strong. But as for the zebras back there, you can tell that the Hartmans because of their stripe pattern. They have thicker stripes in their hind legs and then one stripe down the middle of their stomach. But they're also the only zebra with a dewlap. It's a skin full of their neck and that helps them with regulating their body temperature. Now, zebras in general have thicker teeth and a better digestive system than a lot of the other animals out on the savanna, so they're able to eat a much wider variety of vegetation. And they actually work together with wildebeest during the Great Migration. So while wildebeest are better at detecting when the rain is coming and where it's coming from, zebras are better at remembering that migration route. So they're able to work together in order to find that water source. Now earlier we had spotted some Maasai giraffe. I'm not I'm seeing just watching the live stream. The Maasai is the tallest subspecies of giraffe, and the group of them is called a tower because they quite literally tower over every other animal in the world, standing at about 16, 18 feet tall. Looks like they're all kind of hiding in the back over there by those bushes. We might find some more later on if we're lucky. Now, giraffes spend most of their day eating around 12 hours of the day, and this is because they're what's known as ruminants meaning they have four stomach chambers. So they'll eat their food and digest it, and then they'll digest it again and again and again. Now because they spend most of their day eating, their tongue is vital to them. It's about 18 inches long and prehensile. A prehensile just means finger-like. There's one over to our right. So it can bend in many directions and easily grasp onto things, their favorite being acacia leaves in the trees. But it's also purple in color to prevent a sunburn. And because most of their day they're eating, only 30 minutes of the day is reserved for sleeping. And they won't do this all at once. They sleep in about two minute increments, standing up with their eyes open. So on our right, there is another wildebeest, actually a few more, but there's also some springbok on top of the hill to the right. Those really small ice slopes up there. There's two walking around. Now their name means springing buck after a jump they do called pronking. They'll jump six feet in the air, leap 13 feet across at the same time. Now they'll do this whenever they're nervous, excited, during mating season, or they just want to show off. Now they stand at a whopping two to three feet tall, but can reach speeds of about 55 to 60 miles an hour, making them one of the fastest land animals in the world. On our left is the eland. 
islands. Now, the, there's two of them up there. The eland is the largest, one of the largest antelopes in Africa. It seems to be about 2,000 pounds and six feet tall. Now, during mating season, the males will fashion a sort of flower crown on their head. They'll gather sticks, leaves, and even small trees to position in their horns as a way to rule the ladies. Now, you may have also seen that dewlap under their neck, just like the Hartman's Mountain Zebra, that skin fold that helps with regulating their body temperature. Now, a lot of the animals out on the savanna have to adapt to the conditions out there, especially those considered prey species. And one of the ways they do so is by learning how to walk very quickly after birth. So for giraffes, it takes them about an hour to start walking. For zebras, it takes them only 30 minutes, and for wildebeest, it takes them 15. Now, we just passed by some fallen over trees, which is often a sign that we'll be encountering some larger animals up ahead, eventually some that have knocked those trees down with their body weight, and you see him over to our right with the African elephant. Now you'll notice he's flapping his ears a little bit. This is how they cool themselves down. They can lower their body temperature by about 15 degrees doing that because there's so many blood vessels in their ears that by flapping them, it cools the blood down, which is then it recirculated throughout their body. That's really cool. We're gonna see if we can get a slightly better view up ahead. We might just be able to see his backside. <laughs> he likes to show it off. This is the African bush elephant. They're the largest land animal in the world. And this guy right here, he's actually the largest on the reserve. So he weighs about 13,000 pounds, eats about 300 pounds of food per day, which is pretty standard for the average African elephant. But he'll also be celebrating his 42nd birthday at the end of the year. Wow. Elephants will continue to grow until they're about 35 to 40, but their average lifespan is between 60 and 70 years. Oh. And like I said, the African bush elephant is the largest land animal in the world. There are also the largest of the three subspecies. Slightly smaller is the African forest elephant, and then smallest of all is the Asian elephant. Now we're actually going to make our way over to another yard where I know some other members of the herd like to hang out, so we'll see if they're out this morning. But before we get there, we're going to pass through some red clay pits. The red clay serves as a few different purposes for elephants. One is as a snack. They'll dig their tusks into the pit and eat it as a way to get in any extra minerals that they may lack in their diet. But that red clay can also be used as a sunscreen. Elephants have really sensitive skin, so they'll use that strong trunk of theirs. Hard to throw mud, red clay, sand, water, dirt, really anything they can find. Throw it on their back and it'll act like a natural skin protectant. Looks like I did spot a few more members of the herd up ahead to the left. I mentioned them having really strong trunks. Just like a giraffe's tongue, an elephant's trunk is prehensile or finger-like, but it's also made up of about 40,000 muscles, which for reference, we've only got about 600 in our entire bodies. And because there's so many muscles in their trunks, they are incredibly strong. They can actually hold about 700 pounds at a time. And you'll see them use that for many different purposes. It's made up of their upper lip and nose. Now on our left is what's known as a memory or a group of females. One of my favorite facts about elephants is that they're female led and female followed. Yeah. So when males reach maturity, which is usually at around 12 to 15 years old, they'll separate from that female family unit, but they're not going to get too far behind. They know that that matriarch knows where she's going during migration season, so they'll usually follow around a mile behind her, oftentimes forming a bachelor herd of their own. But the males are typically very solitary. You often find them by themselves. There we go. One last look at that spring buck over to our right. Bit of a better view of them. But we're gonna come up on their watering hole. Elephants drink quite a bit of water per day, up to 50 gallons, with each trunk full being about a gallon. Which is why there's a baobab tree in their yard on the left, as they're definitely one of those animals known to dig their tusks into the trunk. So we're gonna access that water in case it ever does get scarce out on the savannah. Now coming up ahead on our left is a plant point of greater flamingos. Now these are the largest type of flamingos, getting to be about five feet tall. It's also the lightest shade of pink. They get that pink from the beta carotene found in the brine shrimp they eat. Now when they first hatch, they have gray feathers. At around two years old, those feathers start to turn white. And then with the more brine shrimp they eat and the more beta carotene they consume, they'll turn more pink. Now, if you guys have a chance to stop by the Tree of Life later today, there's a flamboyance of lesser flamingos over there. So they'll be smaller and brighter pink, and they're usually found hanging out with the lappet faced vulture and the red kangaroo. Now, sometimes at the 
the left is where we can find white rhinos. I don't see them out right now, but we typically have pretty good luck as we continue throughout the savannah. They're often found hanging out in these mud pits to our left. It's just like elephants, they've got that sensitive skin, so they like to roll around in the mud. It's kind of like their natural sunscreen, but also scratch it up on a nearby tree. Any sort of insects or parasites off of them, it kind of works like natural bug repellent. Now keep a close look on the hills coming up on the left. Sometimes this is where we can find some cats hanging out. Although they typically blend in really well with their surroundings, so they're often a bit hard to spot, no pun intended. We'll see if we can find them this morning. I'm not sure that I'm seeing any in the first yard. We'll check out the second yard and see if they're up there. And it looks like the warden's in the second yard, so it's pretty likely we're not going to see those cats. So we're going to keep on moving, see if we can find more up ahead. a Kobe rock formation. This is a popular place for predators as it provides great shade throughout the savanna and a great vantage point for scoping out prey. So we'll see if we can find any of those predators. Looks like I do see him on our left. Oh, there he is. A lion taking a little cat nap over there. And right now he's doing what he does best. Lions are going to rest for around 16 to 20 hours of the day. At night is when they'll do their hunting. Their night vision is six times better than ours, and it's usually the females that do the hunting. Males will stay back and defend the pride. Typically because females are a bit more agile than those males, there is a female above the male on our left, on top of that rock. There's also a crash of white rhinos coming up ahead on the right. Even some of the baby white rhinos are out this morning, but we are going to kind of catch back up with them, make a little loop and see them once again. The lions on our left, they're also the most social of the big cats living in those family groups called prize. And this male right here is actually kind of a celebrity. When they were making the live-action Lion King, animators studied his mannerisms and his behaviors in order to model the CGI after him. It's kind of like a real-life Simba. Now we're gonna catch up with those white rhinos up ahead. Now they are the largest of the African rhinos, getting to be about 5,000 pounds. And a group of them is called a crash because they have such poor eyesight, they're often found crashing into each other. They can only clearly see about 10 feet in front of them, and they can run at about 30 So they have to rely on that great sense of smell and hearing or to understand their surroundings. I really want to see rhinos. You'll see them over on our right. Now, the difference between a black and a white rhino, it's not their color, they are both gray. So you'll see their mouth shape. So the black rhino has a smaller mouth with an upper lip in the shape of a V that's prehensile or finger-like. This helps them with grabbing leaves off of trees in the forest. Well, the white rhino has a wider mouth. It's more so in the shape of a U and it helps them with grazing along the savanna. They actually get their name for the Afrikaans word vite, which means wide. It was a mistranslation as to why they're the white rhino and not the wide mouthed rhino. What? On our right, there are some ostrich eggs on the ground over there. If you look to the right of that path, almost over your right shoulder. Now, there's only female ostrich on the reserve, so those aren't fertilized. However, if they were, it takes about 40 days for them to hatch, and each one weighs the same as about two dozen chicken eggs. Now, we know there's only females on the reserve, partly because of the color of their feathers. Females have gray feathers, while males have darker, almost black ones. Now, we do believe this is because of camouflage. So during the day, females will land yeah. the eggs, hence the lighter feathers. Well, and the males will land them. And we are approaching the warden's post up ahead, which is a sign that we're nearing the village of Harambe once again. But it looks like the warden has one last animal for us to see. On our left are the Nigerian horn goats. Now, they're the other domestic animal on the reserve. And they will get to see them. There's all boys out here, so they like to mess around with each other like that. Now, if you have the opportunity to pet these goats, head on over to Rafiki's Planet Watch. Take the train to Conservation Station. There is where you'll find the affection section, where you can pet the Nigerian dwarf goats, as well as some 
other domesticated animals like pigs, cows, donkeys, and sheep. And that first train does leave Harambe for Conservation Station in about 30 minutes at 9.30. Now it does look like our safari is coming to an end. Unfortunately, a lot of the animals that we saw out there today are facing habitat loss out in the wild. So if you want to get involved and help them out, one thing you can do is to recycle your old electronics. So inside them is a mineral called coltan, and coltan is currently being mined where a lot of our forest friends live, and it's forcing them out of their habitat. Now lucky for us, coltan is 100% recyclable. So if you have any old watches, laptops, phones, cameras lying around, I do urge you to take them into your local electronics store, turn them into recycle them, and you can do your burn saving these animals. Thank you all so much for riding my safari today. Again, my name is Mallory, and if you have any questions about the animals we saw out there, or you just want to say hi, tell me all about your favorite one, feel free to come to my window once we dock. It's quite literally always open, and I will do my best to answer any questions you may have. Now, I do hope you all get involved in additional conservation efforts. A big part of conservation is education, so I encourage you guys to continue to educate yourself on these animals, not only during your time here at the park, but also in your day-to-day -day life. Now, if I have any wilderness explorers on board, your CODIS Simbo 1, you'll get that badge after you disembark. Just follow the path, and it's going to be on page 14 of your booklet. My friends here in Harambe, we don't like to say goodbye. It's far too sad and far too final. So instead, we choose to say Quaharini, which means to go well. So, Quaharini, everyone, go well, go wild, go make a difference out there. Now, have a great rest of your day here at Disney's Animal Kingdom or wherever your next adventure may take you. On the right, watch the Zanzar Seat Light Stores are signing up. That's all this everyone. Thank you so much for riding with me. Have a great day and go find some more animals to see. All right. That was fun. There you go. Yep, Mallory, if you want to give her a cast compliment. Her name was Mallory. And uh, cool about the uh, the Lion King thing. I saw a lot of people saying they didn't know that. I did not know that either. So that's pretty cool about the uh, lion in there being... I don't think she said what his name was, but that the lion in there being one of the models for the live-action Lion King. Pretty cool. Great job with the camera. Thanks, Dan. It's hard, but Ken's got our zoom tweaked up pretty good, so... I know the zooms are kind of fast sometimes, but it's actually better. Oh, here's the gorilla. It's actually better to be faster like that sometimes. Rather than miss the shot. But thanks, guys. Can you film this tough to be a bug? Uh, Tanina, last time I was in there, um, um, I, I think you're allowed to film it, but I think there's no uh, signal. Yeah, so I see what you're asking. Thank you. Only a small blip? Good. Where was the blip? Dakari. Thank you, Cap. The lion's name is Dakari. Cool. Hello, DMB David. Gonna have to be ninja watching for a while while I work with Is on Math and Prepper for finals. No worries. Okay. Good morning. One of the things I think a lot of people don't appreciate is how beautiful this park is. Like, seriously. You know, I mean, I think one thing Disney does better than anybody, and you know, we can complain about rides and this and that and whatever, but I mean, come on. How many parks build the habitat for their animals like that? It was good to have your Zoom tweaked up. That's right. Hey, Donna. And you got to enjoy the backside of elephants, so that was fun. That was fun. So, yeah. Fun times. All right. Hey, Richard. Hey, have a good day, Jack. All right. So, let me see what... The lines are for the rides and then we'll we may come back to gorilla falls let's see what the lines are and see if everest is open yet and gorilla falls is opening and they talked about the the guide talked about the wilderness express opening later as well but boy safari's up to 40 now so yep i'm glad we did that early okay everest still down Dinosaur's 20. We could do that. Let me just look and see what we're what we're doing here. Kali River's not long. I don't know, guys. I don't want to get all my stuff wet. All right. Let me just have to go wait in line for something. Okay. 
I say we just go do dinosaur. Then maybe Everest will open. We could do the train. We can try it. It will not. Um, it's not open yet. It'll be open in about 20 minutes. So let's go do dinosaur and stuff. We can do the train. It's just going to lag. But everybody's okay with that. It will be okay once we get to... <clears throat> um, it'll be okay once we get to Rafiki's Planet Watch. It's just it lags on the way there. Um, and that's both AT&T and T-Mobile lag all the way there. So yeah, we can do it though. Well, you guys, you guys can survive a little lag. Can't wait to eat at Tusker's, yeah, for sure. Well, yeah, let's try a little Lion, or Lion King. <laughs> try a little, um... A little dinosaur. Well, it's one thing we can't do is Lion King. Uh, some streamers lately have gotten their streams blocked by Lion King, so we don't want to take that chance for our all-day stream. Look, it's so peaceful with no people. So yeah, we'll do that. We'll do we'll do that later when it's open. We can come back and do that. But yeah, no Lion King. I do not want to take the chance of it being the stream being taken down. And remember, like that Crankle Tuesday several weeks ago, uh, back in uh, at the beginning of June, I had to wait a month for it to be brought back because I had to dispute it, and it took a month. Hey Jessica, two nine five dancers going to Disneyland in twenty days. My love for Disney continues. Watching your live streams at home, awesome. Hey Gabrielle. Crazy, there are lions in the park, yeah, for sure. So beautiful this morning. I'm gonna probably turn up the bits a little bit now that we're outside the ride. I did have it up pretty high anyway, though. All right. Hey, Serrano. Triceratops spin, we could do that. For sure. Hey, Serrano. I said it again. Hey, Noel. Hey, Luke. Better not risk it, for sure, yep. So next time we do a Lion King, we'll just do it on a stream that's less than six hours. And that way I can uh, <clears throat> I can take it out if I need to. Pizza bot, hello. <laughs> Sunday morning coffee and an early park tour. Why not? Expecto bourbon, good morning. Quick watch before church, yep. Doesn't have boiler up, says no walls. Yeah, as long as it's not like Epcot, I think we're okay. <laughs> A lot of people don't know there's these little pathways back here too. It mostly just leads to this little shelter back here, but it's fun. Yeah, let's go down and do Dinosaur before it gets too long of a line, and then we'll see if maybe Everest has been sorted out yet. I'm sure they'll get it working. It might just be... It might just be uh, having a little trouble getting started. We'll be there next Saturday, and Animal Kingdom next Sunday. Nice. Hey, Amy. Hey, Perky. Hello, Clinton. Rebecca. That's right, Serrano. Hello, Kevin Sparrow. <clears throat> yeah, I'm glad you guys are sharing your excitement with your trips coming up that is really cool always always fun we might be able to do the bird show later so yeah so we're here the longest what's going to happen is i'm going to send it to jenna here in a little while after i do a couple rides and then i may go wait in line for something longer while she takes the stream i'll take it back maybe to do one more ride and then i'll probably send it back to her while she does lunch <clears throat> while i do lunch <clears throat> excuse me and then uh, I'll probably start heading to another park. Still in bed. Yeah, Brad, no worries. Wait, what did you say? Yep, so the, the plane with hopping, uh, I'm just talking a little bit, is I'm sending it back and forth to Jenna. So she's in Epcot right now, or she will be soon. Never seen that complaints. But I gotta see what it says now. We'll look at when the bird show is. That'll be fun. I've never seen that. I haven't seen it for a while. Complaints about elephants to be made at Anandapur Association for Animal Welfare. Hey, Zachary. They get to go to the fair tomorrow. I saw a lion at the zoo up close. He was laying on the window. Yeah, Liam and I saw a lion at the Pueblo Zoo when we were in Colorado, and we saw... <clears throat> um, we actually heard him roar, which was crazy. I'd never heard that. Maybe once before. But it's hard to hear... <clears throat> excuse me. It's hard to hear over the safari trucks here easier to hear when that's not going on i like the stream yeah keep hitting the like button everybody jenna just got to epcot okay that's all hold on okay period i'm headed to do dinosaur comma and then you can take it if you want
then maybe I'll go wait in line for a ride while you take it for a little while. <clears throat> we're gonna do some strolls around here too. We'll do rides of course, but we're gonna do some strolls. Yes, we can switch without the stream dropping. <clears throat> yep. And we were the first Disney streamers at least to figure out how to do that. And I know some other people can do that now, which is super cool. Um, but it was an accident. Britt, our West Coast crew, Britt and I were <clears throat> messing around with apps one night. And I was like, hey, if I pause on my end, can you resume on your end? And it was like, oh my gosh, it works. So that's pretty cool. We have 2,200 people watching. Welcome, good morning, Jumbo, everyone. And thank you for being here on this beautiful morning. An epic four park stream. And again, we don't have to wait till 2 p.m. to park hop like I do, but Jen is at Epcot. So we're gonna, we're gonna um, park hop through the magic of technology. It's not even really virtually. Um, <clears throat> it's actually real, real park hopping. But, uh, be super fun. There's a bird show going on. I'll probably go ahead and go to Dinosaur though before it gets too long. We can probably catch that later. All right. Coming into Dino Land. Are you seeing it? Hey Richard, hey uh, Kyle, Jennifer, Taylor Safari was the first ride of the day. You can rewind the stream to check it out. That's right. Taylor's got it down. <clears throat> oh, here comes, I hear, I hear a boat. <clears throat> the percussion boat, I should say. Let's check it out. Here it comes. Yes, you can park up to all four parks. You just can't start until two. Like you can leave a park like at one or one fifteen or something, and then get in like at two. That's the plan. Oh, uh, thanks, Quentin. That uh, sure is, and the music's great. Speaking of music, look how, look how uh, calm the water is. Fun job, yeah, it kind of would be. Probably be hot, but still fun. Yep. Uh, no, we're not gonna stay at Animal Kingdom. We're gonna we're gonna hop. This is a park hop and stream. <clears throat> so yeah, so that's the deal. Um, we're hoping next year sometime that the park hopping restrictions will be will be eased up, um, since there's really not much reason for them anymore. Um, just like in the in <laughs> in the old days, you know, the pre-COVID days, people tend to disperse themselves pretty evenly at the parks and also people have the access to the app the benefit of the app to see hey if you know if the lines are really short at animal kingdom say people are all over at magic and it's it's slammed they say hey let's go over to animal kingdom well now they can't do that so say they pick the wrong park or you go to hollywood and it's completely slammed and you're like oh my gosh animal kingdom or epcot there's nobody there well you can't go over there till two so i think it'll help ease things out a little bit and, you know, if you see something, you say, okay, well, let's just do one ride here at Hollywood, and then we're going to head over to Epcot. It's less crowded, you know, whatever. When does my regular job crank up again? Um, next, not this coming week, but the week after. So I've got another week of freedom, and then I'm back to school. But it's going to be a great year. I'm not too, I usually get really worried about it, but, you know, it's like going to be my 22nd year, so <laughs> I'm getting used to it. That's the only downside to having the summer off is having to go back, you know? So. Boom. 
Now you gotta trump it out. Yes, I'm gonna meet up, old Mr. Young Dude. Yep, we're gonna meet up later. So here's the plan again if you're just joining us. And moppers or anybody in the chat can fill people in as we go. Um, <clears throat> so I'm gonna be here until park hopping time. Jenna's gonna be at Epcot. We're gonna go back and forth. Um, and then um, when we can both hop around 1.30 or 2, I'll probably leave here about 1.15. Or so just to make sure I get to my next park with plenty of time, take my time getting back and forth, get through security and all that. Then, um, after this, I'm going to head to Hollywood Studios. Jenna's going to head to Magic. I'll do a couple rides at Studios, and then I'm going to meet Jenna at Magic and Mom and Dad at Magic. Dad's going to join me here later. So, yep. So I'm going to go to three parks. Jenna's going to go to two, but she's going to be really helpful in all my, all my hopping because she'll be over at Magic. The reason we did that is because she doesn't like to ride a lot of the rides at um, studios, like Tower and stuff. So she said, well, why don't you do that? And she can go to Magic and do some things. So, yep, that's the plan. We're going to have an epic day. And then we're going to end the day, of course, at Magic with Happily Ever After. And we'll be all together. 25. It's not too bad. And honestly, I don't think it's even that long. Thank you. The kids are in band camp next week. We've been gearing up with fight songs and marching show music. Oh, yeah, for sure. And... For sure. Yeah, we don't have a band camp, which is nice. We'll just get started during the school year, which is nice. I don't even know exactly who I'm going to have yet. I know the ones from last year, but I always get new ones. We're blipping. Okay, thanks, Jenna. All right, is that better? Am I unblipped? Well, no worries, old Mr. Young Dude. No worries. You're, you're totally fine. I'm glad, that, glad, to, glad to help. I just meant that when people, I'm happy to say I meant when people ask later, that way we can, because people will join throughout the day, so they might want to know the plan. So yeah, no, you're totally fine. Thank you for asking. I know I could have been a teacher. I'd never be stuck in a room with 30 kids all day would drive me nuts. a successful person. Yeah, for sure. Well, high school's a little different because we're not, you know, we're, we have different classes all day. So if you have a difficult class, they move on. But yeah, still. Is it better? Thanks for being patient through the blippies. <laughs> oh, this doesn't look bad at all. Let's go get that dino. But yeah, anyway, thanks for asking. If you happen to be on the skyline between 10 a.m. and noon from Riviera to Epcot, Reedy Creek pipes and drums will be practicing today. Really? Where's that? Ms. Disney fan says, working at school was too much, so I got another job. Well, yeah, no worries. It's not not for everyone, that's for sure. And it's good to know when to say when. If I was at my previous school, I would not be teaching anymore. Uh, it's just too difficult. So, but we won't go into all that. This is supposed to be a fun, happy day. <laughs> movie this ride's based on is also great. What movie is this based on? Time the safari out perfectly up to 50 minutes. Yeah, Carly, for sure. It has gone up quickly. Things escalate quickly in the morning. Quickly? <laughs> Can't talk. Hey, Kaylee, and Jenna's here. Yep. So, again, what we're going to be doing. Is send it, right after this, we'll send it to Jenna at Epcot and Mom. Bad to the bone, Bill Nye says. So cool. I can't imagine coming face to face with one of these guys. <laughs> Ninth year as a high school counselor and loving it. That's awesome. But yeah, we're going to be sending it to Jenna right after this. Then we shall. Then she'll send it back to me as I ride something else. Whatever. <laughs> and then um, we'll send it back and forth a little bit this morning. Then at 2 o'clock, we're both going to park off. She's going to go to Magic, and I'll go to Hollywood. And I'll meet, we'll meet at Magic. Yes, we get spoiled being off all summer. We do, we do, Julie, but we, we work pretty hard during the year, so I'd say we deserve it. And not the mama. I love it. Good old 80s show, or 90s, whatever it was. They switched the name from Countdown to Extinction to Dinosaur to promote the movie. I thought maybe it was just because the name was more simple. 
Uh, Dad might be here a little bit later. The school attendance counselor in the UK, nice. Now, Tiffany, uh, you have to let me know. Do you, um, in the UK, do you guys say take a registration? Because our um, student management program is written by a British company, and instead of take attendance, it says take a registration. Whereas in the US, we say take attendance when we take the role for class. So I guess in the UK, it's take a registration, which, which was like, what does that button do? But it's the attendance button. Hey, Allie. We need the time. Yes, we do. They still have the condiment pipes. Uh, I don't know. They might actually. We'll have to look. Eli Sluice, 199. We were there last week. Sorry, we missed you guys. Thanks, Eli. Yeah, hit the like, everybody. Hey, Renee. I'm also a teacher. I love it. I have different reading groups all day. That's very nice. Thank you. I've been working 27 years, Shadow Dragon. That's amazing. Registration. Yep, that's what I figured. Something something different, something new. It makes sense. Just I'd never heard it before. <laughs> Even in the same language, we have different uh, ways of saying things. Yeah, hold on, guys. Hopefully it doesn't lag in here. We'll turn it down. Great camera quality. Thanks. I get butterflies from the joy and love you and the Disney family and the family have for each other in Disney and how hard you work. Thanks, Corey. That's so kind. We take the register in England schools. Yeah, okay. Makes sense. Registration, yeah. Hello. I'm Dr. Marsh, director of the Dino Institute, and I hope you enjoyed those quaint exhibits in the old wing. That's how dinosaurs have been presented to the public since the study of fossils began over 150 years ago. Today, that bare bones approach is about to become extinct. In a perfect blending of science and technology, the Dino Institute has created the Time Broker, an amazing vehicle that will literally transport you to the age of the dinosaur. How? That's proprietary. But the result is a breathtaking journey through a prehistoric world where you'll witness the most spectacular creatures to ever walk the Earth. In a moment, you'll be going live to our control center for a comprehensive safety briefing, and then it's on to the tour that will convince you forever that the future is truly in the past. Yes. Hello there. <laughs> Welcome to our little trans-dimensional joyride, folks. I'm Dr. Seeger, your friendly controller and a heck of a paleontologist, if I do say so myself. But let's not talk about me, let's talk about you. And how you can help me make history today with the Time Rover. It's like this. If I can bring you back from the Cretaceous period, it stands to reason that I can bring back a live dinosaur with you. And not just any dinosaur. Take a look at this guy. He's an iguanodon. And I'm certain that he is the key to understanding these magnificent creatures. I tagged him with a locator during an unauthorized field trip. Otherwise, I'd be traveling with you. Right now, our dino should be about here, at the very end of the Cretaceous period. That's where you're going today. I've arrived, it seems, just in time to correct a little misstatement. Dr. Marsh. That is impossibly close to the giant asteroid impact that destroyed most life forms on Earth. Our tools are designed to take you to the early Cretaceous period. And I can assure you that all time rovers have been securely locked on those coordinates. That's right. See? Securely locked. Access denied. <laughs> Continue. Of course. We were just talking about seatbelts. Plug them in. Use them. It can get kind of choppy out there, so keep your hands and arms inside the vehicle at all times. Flash photography? I wouldn't. It alters the homing signal, and that's not good. Oh, and one more thing. Those locked coordinates? We're in. Now, here's the drill. You follow the homing signal to the iguanodon, then I'll enlarge the transport field, and boom, you're back with one additional passenger extra large. And don't worry about that asteroid. You'll be in and out of there before it even breaks the atmosphere. Trust me, what could go wrong? Hey, it's me again. Remember, only you guys are going on this special mission, so don't tell anyone, okay? Okay, we won't tell anybody. Yes.
All right, I fixed it. I was trying something new today, and I fixed it. So, um, yeah. So what I. Sorry about that. We're trying. It just died on its own a second there. So it's, it's definitely unstable, but we'll see. Hopefully it'll work. It worked the other day, but you never know. I mean, we are going millions of years in the past, so. <laughs> I put my hat in my uh, backpack so I don't lose it. I like this. Sorry about that. We'll get it working. One. Stay tuned, everybody. Jenna's going to be uh, at Epcot next with a, with a surprise ride. Yeah, it's a little rough down here, but we'll get it. So, um, yeah, Jenna's ready at, at My goodness, it was really glitchy, but we'll hopefully get it. I'm going to leave it alone for now. We'll not be able to fix it while we're on the ride because... Time travelers, place all loose items in the pouch in front of you, fasten your seatbelt, and remain seated with your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the time rover. And please watch children. Atención, guarden todos los artículos sueltos. Abróchense los cinturones y permanezcan sentados con las manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del vehículo. Oh yeah, mustard ketchup and pickle right there. I think we're good now. Is it stop lipping? Are we good? Commencing in T minus 10 seconds and counting. This is Seeker. Listen up. We've got to get in, grab the Iguanodon, and get out before the asteroid hits. Let's roll. Okay. Now, let's go get that dino. Computer, what are you tracking? Styracosaurus. Not our dino. Warning, meteor shower in range. Just little one. Oleoramus. Hadrosaur. Raptor. Time to get serious. Lucky autopilot on homing signal now. Hang on! A big dino on the scope. Could be ours. Computer, full stop. Identify. Carnivorous. Definitely not our dino. Go, go, go! Another big guy coming up. Computer. Slow and identify. Sauropod. Still not our dino, but at least this one's a vegetarian. Asteroid impact in 90 seconds. We better move it. Pterodactyl. Incoming! Asteroid impact in 60 seconds. We can't stop now. Keep going, keep going. 
Computer, what's happening? Loss of traction. Four-wheel drive, move it! Warning, meteor strike. Evasive maneuver! Their personal belongings from the pouch in front of you and remain seated until the rover comes to a complete stop. All right, that was fun. <laughs> yep, we made it. Yeah, I saw it light at the end, but when it's bouncing around. So, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Turn it back up just a little bit. Looks like it just lagged at the end, so that's not too bad. Very unpredictable. Let's we'll try it again. Maybe we'll try it again sometime. We'll try a different signal. All right, 2,000 people didn't make it. No, we're back. All right, we're gonna send it over to Jenna here in a second. That was still fun. I know I want it on as a pet. Yeah, where are we going to put it? Also, the food must be expensive. They go on it on time. But we're going to send it to Jenna here in just a second. Uh, glad you're all right. Yes, for sure. I was wondering. That Seeker, he's a little crazy. He's a little crazy guy. All right, I am going to send it to Jenna. All right. Thanks, Arnel. Okay. All right, we're gonna send this to Jenna. Okay, so let me go outside. We'll give you a view of the iguanodon that you know that we have now. I'm looking at everybody else in there. Okay. He's just a silly little guy. Yeah. All right. Everest is back up. Nice. We'll do that right after Jenna does her um, does her Epcot ride. Here we go, guys. So you're gonna go. We're gonna do a park hop over to Epcot with Jenna and Mom to do a ride. Guess what ride it is. There he is. It's all right. He'll fit. He'll fit in the house. He'll be fine. Super fun, guys. So, yep. Yeah. Enjoy Epcot, everybody. Oh, Jenna's meeting some hoppers, okay. We'll have to wait till Jenna's finished meeting the hoppers and then we'll, then we'll go. So, we'll just chat for just a minute longer. Get ready for Epcot time. Looks like it's only 10 minutes, so we might be able to try that again later with a regular connection and see what happens. All right, she's live. So here we go, never seen a live switch. You're about to see it. So we're gonna go from Animal Kingdom to Epcot. All of them will be completely 100% live. So here we go, park hopping, our second park of the day. Epcot, coming at you. We'll see you all at Epcot.
and then I'll go and maybe get ready to do Everest after she is uh, finished yeah. with her ride at Epcot. So, all right, guys, ready to park hop in three, two, and one. guys welcome to Epcot how's it going welcome in did you guys have fun at Animal Kingdom with Josh hope you had fun I'm sure you did um, look at this guys there's hardly a line for Spaceship Earth we're gonna go stream Spaceship Earth today I have never streamed this so everybody everybody wish me luck wish me luck I don't think it'll be bad so we'll do the best we can and if there's lag you guys know the drill you just rewind a little bit that'll help and refresh all the things come back as soon as we can but should be all good hi guys yeah food and wine festival starts on thursday so that'll be a lot of fun so we will be here live thursday morning for the opening day of food and wine can't wait for that but today is gonna be a fun all day four park stream just started at um animal as you guys know and now we're at Epcot. It's just gonna be awesome. Hi Carly, hi Honora. Yes, we're gonna design our future. Hi Timothy, hi Arnaud, theme parks, hello. Richard, Courtney, Brad, Eli, Diana, Dan. Yeah, we're gonna thank those Phoenicians. That is right, guys. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, you wanna see my ears? Okay, the perfect ears for today. You guys ready? Wait. I have my four park ears. There's mom. Everybody say hi, mom. So all four parks, since we're doing all four parks, I'm technically only doing two, but between Josh and I, we've got all four parks covered today, so I thought these were perfect. So yay. This is going to be awesome. Hi, Kelly. Hi, Cat in the Kingdom. Hi, Ken. Ali R is here. Yeah, Toby Mac. We can't wait to see Toby Mac. He's coming to town. He's going to be here at Epcot um, in September, I believe. Hi, Serrano. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Hi, Rosalie. The Florida Freaks. Hello. Matt. You're coming for food and wine? Hi, Shelby. Hi, Pamela. Angela. Vicky. Thank you, Carly. Hi, Cool Cat. Hi, Big Guy. Kelly. Sandra. This is going to be awesome. Everybody give me some good vibes and hopefully... The signal will hold. Hi, Gino. Hi, Tony. Thanks, Marsha. Hi, Sierra. It's a beautiful morning. The breeze, of course, under Spaceship Earth is amazing. It always is. Hi, Richard. Hi, Mari. Cindy, Susie, Matt, Brianna, Corey Ruprecht. Hello. Top five favorite ears. That's amazing. They're really cute. They did a great job. Oh, yeah, Tiffany. We'd love to say hello. Thanks, Amy. Hi, Vincent. Hi, Rosa. Hi, Wendy. Oh, awesome, Matthew. All right, guys, remember on the ride, we will not be chatting. We'll be enjoying the ride. Please take small children by the and watch your step on the moving platform. Right. Turn down the bits. Platform and your time machine vehicle are moving at useful speed. The sliding doors on your time machine is closed for your safety. Remain safe. Hands, arms, and legs inside the bag. Remain seated with your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the vehicle and 
and with them our dreams of the future.
And now I believe your future is just about ready. Let's take a look, shall we? Welcome to the future. Or should I say, <laughs> your future? <laughs> look, that's not even you. That's not even you. Your future, getting away on vacation is a breeze. That's funny. It's your suitcase knows where you're going and what you need. Ladies and gentlemen, our time travel have been momentarily delayed. Please remain seated. Your time machine vehicle will begin moving again at any moment. Please remain seated. We'll resume our journey shortly. Thank you. Ultra powerful, totally networked family car that can take you anywhere. Yeah, that is definitely not you. No, it's Hotels, check. Restaurants, check. Guided tours, check. You'll never get bored on the journey because your car's holographic gaming technology keeps you connected to friends back home. You'll travel quickly and safely to places you can't imagine visiting today. <laughs> and the moment you arrive at your ultimate vacation, please remain seated. Your vehicle will begin moving on the vacation. Remain seated, please. Our travels are resuming now. The end, or should I say, the beginning of your future. <laughs> so here's to the next 30,000 years on Spaceship Earth. While no one knows for sure what we'll see or do, I do know it will be quite an adventure. An adventure that we'll take and make together. See you in the future. My very first stream. Now, how how'd it go? How was it? I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> how do we get out of here? All right, guys. Trying to turn it up. One second. There we go. All right. That was fun. Hi, Thorin. Welcome in, guys. How's it going? So, how was it? Let me know. I had the chat off most of the time because there were people right behind us and I didn't want to uh, ruin their ruin their ride so I was trying to keep the phone down and the screen as dark as possible okay so yeah how was it guys my very first time filming that 
streaming it. I filmed it, I guess. Streaming it. That was my first time. Okay. All right. Sounds like we're going to send you back to Josh um, to ride Everest. And then we're going to take it so he can eat lunch. Um, so you guys are going to head back to Animal Kingdom for some Everest fun. And then mom and I will take it for a while over here while he has lunch. So, all right, everybody. It was good. Was it all right? Great job. Thanks, guys. Barely any lag. Thanks, Florida Freaks. How are you, Al? Pretty good. Thanks, Josh. Ah, oh, thanks for subbing, cool cat. Good morning, Mardrette. All right, guys. Well, we are going to send you to Josh. Let me text him here real quick. And then you'll be back over here with me, and we'll see what other rides we can ride here at Epcot. And just enjoy some, you know, shopping and pin trading. We always love that. So, all right, let me tell him. David, that's so sweet of you. Yep, we'll see you guys in just a bit. I want to wait and hear from Josh to see when he is ready. The camera really adds a different face. I know, Mom. Mom's face was totally different. <laughs> Wasn't even Mom. All right, guys. We are going to send you to Josh. So heading back to Animal Kingdom, enjoy Everest. And we'll see you back at Epcot here in a little bit. Everybody. Not sure when you're gonna start seeing me, but here you go. Hey everybody, Everest beckons. <laughs> We're ready to tame the Yeti. Are you guys ready to tame the Yeti? Or not Yeti? <laughs> Love it. Alright, let's go ride this thing. So I hope you enjoyed Spaceship Worth with Jenna. She did a great job on her first time with that. It's always a challenge for sure. She doesn't have exactly the same uh, connection I do, but it's pretty close. And uh, it's just those couple little spots there where it, right, um, right by the, uh, the Phoenicians and the Romans, they get a little shy there. So there's not good signal there. And then, um, and then the other place is up at the top. But otherwise, it works pretty good. Thank you. Right. So single rider Everest, here we go. Oh, it's a little bit longer, but that's all right. Yeah, it was great. Always good to try new rides like that. You're in a giant Faraday cage. I'm surprised it works at all. It is pretty impressive. There is a tower right outside the park that I think works pretty well. So yeah, so that's part of it. Sorry, I should have gotten in line. It was short earlier, but all good. Lord of Freaks says I'm freaking out, man. In a good way, I hope. We're having a great day. So, let's see. Hey, this won't take long. We did get a very, very generous PayPal. Oh, wow. From old Mr. Young Dude. I don't know if you're still in the chat. Sorry, I read that. I, I didn't read it earlier. All right. So... Old Mr. Young Dude from Fudge Nuts and Popsicles sent a $100 PayPal. Stay cool. We will have you on Ninja Watching between chores and duties throughout the day. Thanks for all your dedication. Holding that gimbal isn't easy. Thanks again. Old Mr. Young Dude and Fudge Nuts and Popsicles. Man, that is really generous. Thank you so much, guys. Wow. And uh, I saw you earlier in the Red Before Dinosaur. But anyway, I'll say it again if I see you guys in the chat. But I want to make sure you heard me. 
um, about the uh, PayPal. It's very, very generous. So big thank you and hearts in the chat to old Mr. Young Dude and Fudge Nuts and Popsicles. We also had another one. Wow. A lot of generous, generous people today. Wow. Uh, so, so that one, uh, I'll just say was from Christopher Black, but he said we don't have to read it on the stream. <laughs> so I want to say thank you to him and say thank you that he was, uh, he was um, so generous. So thank you, Christopher Black, and thank you, old Mr. Young Dude. Hey, Michael. Hey, Sandra. Thanks, Noel. Noel's here. Always good to see Noel. So, yeah, big thank you to everybody. Remy says 25 minute wait. I don't know if she knows that or not. But hopefully, uh, but yeah, it probably wouldn't be 25 by the time she got there. <laughs> All right, hey CM, how are you? Yeah, Jenna and Mama are at Epcot right now. That's right. And guys, hit the like button for us. Subscribe if we're new. We're trying to get to 179K today, so that's going to be super awesome. So thanks for being here, everybody. The so dad's going to be here in just a bit. Yeah, stay hydrated. I will. I will. Right now I'm in the sun, but hopefully I won't be cool. <laughs> Just, just right there is all I need to get to to get in the sun or to get out of the sun. Yeah, Margaret, it's a beautiful, beautiful day. Sandra says, tell the chat the Main Street Electrical Parade announcement. Oh, Sandra, yeah, I don't, I don't, uh, I remember we met you guys the other day. That was so awesome. Uh, let's see here. I don't remember it by heart, though. You'll have to post it for me. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Walt Disney's. We now present Walt Disney's Main Street Electrical Parade, something like that. Hey, Joe. Hey, Allie. Glenn says, how is the attendance? You hear so much different information. Yeah, so the attendance is actually, um, the attendance is actually pretty steady. Um, it's not quite as much as a normal summer. <laughs> Excuse me. Not quite as much as a normal summer, but it's um, definitely not like slow, like they say. So, so I'd say it's just about average. Um, You'll see the rides are still pretty busy, but the walkways are not as much. So you'll see less people on the walkways, which leads to a lot of people saying, oh, it's not busy, but it's, it's you know, it seems about the same. So. If you guys could move up, we could get out of the sun. That'd be awesome. If you guys could move up, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> There we go. We got out of the sun. Florida freaks agrees. Yep, that's what it is. I mean, like I said, you, you can't believe a lot of what you hear online and etc. So, enjoy the retro video with the SSD. Thank you so much. Yeah, guys, I did post that yesterday on Retro TV One Tech. So definitely go and um, definitely go and uh, check that out. It wasn't uh, like I said. A lot of those videos aren't super popular because a lot of people are not as interested in that but you know if you want to go watch that later I'd appreciate it and I had an, a very helpful person comment in the in the uh, comment section and say that I could uh, take it apart and make it fit so I'm going to do that 
All right. Hey, Connie. I'm about to ride Everest, guys. Super excited. The single rider usually moves pretty quick on this one because, um, you know, you have to get even numbers. So it's harder to get even numbers. All right. Hey, cool cat. Hello, AR Glover. Hey, Wendy. Yeah, Everest is great. Hey, Trisha, how are you? Uh, Florida Freaks, I'm feeling great. Feeling great. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Allie, for posting my uh, retro channel. Guys, check that out. Yeah, the detail's great, Brad, for sure. Hey, lots of Wendy's. Hello all to all the Wendy's. Hey Michelle, hey Todd. All right, so let's see. Sorry, I was gonna try and look at the Main Street Electrical Parade thing, but I think I'm about to go, so. I was trying, hey Todd. All right, guys, here we go. 2,800 people watching. Tanina, yep, we're doing great. One, I'm the single. <laughs> That's my favorite coaster. Ah, uh, no, probably Rock and Roller Coaster is my favorite. Yeah. You won't be on the video at all. I have it face forward the whole time. Nobody, nobody, nobody will see you. Nobody will see you. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Everybody else will be too. Oh, you didn't see it? Okay, Allie, no worries. Yeah, she had it all typed out the other night, but... I don't remember it, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright guys, almost 3,000 people watching. Welcome everybody. Enjoy. Oh, and before we get on the ride, let's thank our first sponsor, MickeyTravels.com. If you want to book your next trip right here to Walt Disney World, check out MickeyTravels.com. That's MickeyTravels.com. Yeah, uh, Liam Go, that's really cool. Tron cast members separate the evens and the odds. They do the same thing at Guardians, so it's pretty fun. Hey, Rosalie, doing great. So yeah, guys, if you want to book your next trip right here to Walt Disney World, check out MickeyTravels.com. If you want to find out all the latest news, check out MickeyBlog.com. Para su seguridad, permanezcan sentados con las manos, brazos, pies 
y piernas dentro del tren. Y por favor, cuide a los niños. the thing but they stopped because it was not it was like not stable I guess so it used to be scary it used to scoop down and then it was like they thought he was gonna fall off so yeah oh yeah uh, that was a while ago no you're good <laughs> it's a roller coaster screaming perspective have a good day thank you Yep, it's a roller coaster. We expect the screaming. <laughs> Except for me, I don't usually. But I do, I do every once in a while I have a little fun. All right, every once in a while I have fun. No, I always have fun. Every once in a while I, I let a few, little few uh, woohoos out or screams or whatever. Dad's here. But I don't think he's here here yet. I'm going to try one more time, I think. Yeah, why not? It's not that long. Let's do one more time on Everest. And then we'll send it to Jenna. How's that, everybody? Yeah, yeah, it's not very long now, see? Much shorter now. So let's try Everest one more time and then we'll send it to Jenna because I like it so much I can't just do it once. All right. And we know we can do this one. We know it doesn't get like copyright claimed or whatever. Cool. So we have to be, I have to be here till, till like 1.30 and Jenna has to be, and mom had to be in Epcot till, um, till two. So yeah. So anyway. All right. Let's see. 
Oh, we're good. All right. So, fun times. Let's go get that Yeti. Let's <laughs> my little coach. Get the butterflies in check. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Yeah, this won't take long now. I was produced a big woo on Everest. Yes, for sure, Brad. It's involuntary. Just like when I go watch drum corps. I just start screaming. Because <laughs> it's cool. All right. So, anyway, definitely check out, guys, all of our awesome sponsors. We also have Resort TV One Homes. That's ResortTV1Homes.com. Uh, We're brokered by EXP Realty. And if you want to find your dream home here in Central Florida, go check out ResortTV1Homes.com. That's ResortTV1Homes.com. Broker by EXP Realty. All you have to do is go on there and click on the contact form. Click on the contact form and go ahead and um, put in your information. And one of our expert realtors will get back to you. We also have a YouTube channel, Resort TV One Homes on YouTube, and we're going to be going to check out uh, Bucky's this week, I think, on there. So that'll be fun. So I think Jen and Dale might go with us. So that'll be fun. So yeah, definitely check out ResortTV1Homes.com and Resort TV One Homes on YouTube. Jen and Dale's channel, also Adventures of Jen and Dale. They're going to be doing a vlog for that. So Adventures of Jenna and Dale. Can't ride due to vertigo. Yeah, uh, Kelly, I totally get that. We'll do this one more time. We'll send it back to Jenna. Thanks, Florida Freaks. I appreciate you guys being here. We're getting there. I always try really hard, like, if somebody's, you know, not... They see the camera and they're like, I don't want to be on camera. I was trying really hard to say, oh, you won't, you won't be. Because, <laughs> you know, let's be honest, it's on a ride. Nobody wants to see me anyway. So, so yeah. Put everybody's mind at ease because I think she was worried she was going to be on camera, was, you know, screaming, and she was very nice. So I'd rather say, speak up and say that than anybody be worried. And she's like, oh, but I'm going to be screaming. I'm like, that's fine. <laughs> so she was super nice. Yeah, any dinosaur today? Yeah, Caitlin, we did dinosaur earlier. I might try it again. We'll see. So again, here's the plan if you're just joining us. Um, we had, I'm going to be here at Animal Kingdom. I'm sending it back and forth to Jenna and Mom at Epcot. And then at 2 o'clock or 1.30 when we can park up, uh, I'm going to be heading to Hollywood Studios. Jenna and Mom are going to be heading to Magic Kingdom. We'll send it back and forth to there. And then when I do some rides at Hollywood Studios, probably not that many because it's usually pretty busy, then I will um, join them at Magic. That's the plan. And we'll have all four parks. And it won't be so much waiting around. You're one of the most respectful, respectful streamers. Thank you, Dan. I tried. I tried. We might try Dinosaur again. We'll see. Let's go Yeti Part 2. Hey, go Minnie. Be kind. Rewind. Hey, Ash. Hello, Chantel. Be at Upcap next Monday night. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Jenna's going to be live this Thursday. Uh, you're right here on Resort TV 1 for the first day of the Food and Wine Festival, Thursday morning. Bucky's has a good grilled cheese. Yeah, for sure. I haven't been there. I can't wait to go to Bucky's. Be my first time. Uh, Steph and Liam have been there because they went on a trip. When I had I had a school thing going on, I couldn't go. They went on a trip up to uh, Jacksonville and saw it. Or no, I take it back. That's when I was at Disneyland. Anywho, let's ride this thing one more time. And Resort TV One Homes is doing really great, by the way. Thanks for all the support, guys. We've got. Um, We've got like over 40 people who've signed up on there already, uh, which is just going to be amazing for them getting the best realtor in the in the whole area, um, or best you know, best real estate agent in the whole area, and then um, also uh, supporting our channel as well. So you get the best service, um, the best advice to find your dream home. You know, potty like a Bucky's potty. I love that. That's so cool. But anyway, yeah, Resort TV and Homes is doing great. Guys, will just help us and help you make all the dreams a reality. Hey, Jackie. We've already had uh, one closing, and we've got two more coming up. Hey, Mandy. And all of them, I here's the, the good thing. I don't sell the houses, but um, I actually have access to all the conversations. Um, so I can look on there and make sure everybody's doing all right. And if you want to talk to me, you can. Um, so I'm a licensed sales agent. Fun times. Oh, I should have told her about Joey. Yeah, I was going to, but I didn't want to overburden her with information. But yes, I thought of, I did think about it for sure. But I love Joey's screams. He's the best, man. He's the best. 
But he's pays their staff well. That's good to hear. That is good to hear. Hopefully, he motivates. You know, you get paid well and motivates you to do a good job. I agree with that. Retro TV One Tech is an awesome channel. Love adventures with Jenny Dale. Thanks, Glenn. Hey, Nick. Saying happy birthday wishes to my mom. It's her birthday today. Garfish. Sherry say I love Bucky's. Yes. It's so cool. Okay, guys, here we go. We're going to be in the second row. Yes. Okay. All right. Let's do this. The wait time's in two weeks. Andy, you are in luck. The wait times always go down at the beginning of August because people wait till the first Halloween party. So the last week of July, first week of August, generally pretty light. I think you'll see the crowds pick up again when the parties start and the heat dies down a little bit. Again, I don't think everybody's boycotting Disney or anything. I think it's, it's you know, I think it's expensive for people. I think that's a big concern. So I'll be Disney will continue to address that. But I think it's also hot and people want to wait until it's cooler. And I think people also did their COVID post COVID trip and they're waiting a little bit longer. Uh, no, I don't collect pens. Uh, JF gets them to Jenna and Mom do, and they can tell you all about it way more than I can. I, mean, I think they're cool. I'm just more interested in retro computers. I actually just. I won a new um, retro laptop last night, a really good one, uh, on eBay for uh, $9.99. So I was super, super proud of myself. Halloween party start on, uh, I almost said May, August 11th. Almost 3,000 people in the chat. Welcome, guys. We'll see you at the Yeti. That's all right, Jason. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. Uh, not an Apple TV, no, it's a, um, it's a Windows 98 laptop, but hey, 10 bucks and it works, you can't beat that. All right, here we go, do this. Stay tuned guys, we got all kinds of fun coming up. All right, Dad. Uh, um, I'll text you after I'm done, and we can go have lunch. Actually, Dad, if you're if you're able to hear me, uh, why don't why don't we meet at Restaurant Soros? Let's meet at Restaurant Soros so we can have lunch. How about that? Yeah, I love Windows 98. <laughs> That's so old school.
awesome. I'm glad you guys enjoyed that. I was laughing at the reactions of people behind me too. They were having fun. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right. We're going to send you back to Jenna at Epcot, guys. Jeff, first, going to stop real quick. There we go. All right. Perfect. Okay, guys. I'm going to send you to Epcot with Jenna. Don't go anywhere. Lots of fun. Lots of fun. All the park hopping. Oh, there he is. <laughs> His dad. Dad's right. got the seven seven dwarfs on. Yep, all the dwarfs. Yeah. Oh, I forgot here. I forgot too. I'm going to be wearing a different shirt at each park. I was I, oh. I was creative today for once. I'm not usually creative, but <laughs> hey. I was creative for once. Woo. Here we go. So I got my Animal Kingdom shirt on for Animal Kingdom. Yeah. So there you go. It's, and it's light colored. That's good. Yeah. Yes, yeah. light colored. Yep. Yeah. So I got a couple other shirts in the car yeah. for the other parks that we're going to. So. It was uh, really slow getting in today. I don't know why. Just everybody's, I think, slow motion Sunday morning, I guess. Could be. I, I yeah, no, know. Animal Kingdom can be slow getting in. Yeah. That's why I had to get here early. No worries. Hard, hard. It's hard, though. Yeah. Hello. Oh, hi. Well, thank you so much for doing this. Oh, you're very welcome. My pleasure. Oh, that was cute. <laughs> I guess let's so walk towards we the, do, well, well, let's walk towards the restaurant there. Uh, oh, she's, okay, okay. She's almost. Yeti? Yep. <laughs> no, that's all right. All right, you get cooled off in there. You want to go to? Let's go to restaurant stores. Yeah, we'll start walking that way. Yep. Jenna says she's almost ready. All right. So guys, yeah, we see Dad's shirt. Yep, here, see Dad's shirt. They have cheeky, Grandpa, happy, old guy, whistly, snoozy, and Opie. <laughs> Opie, Kenopi. I like that. Dopey is Opie. <laughs> Opie. Opie, like on. Uh, on that what? Um, um, Griffith. Andy Griffith, yeah. yeah, yeah. Went fishing with his dad. They went down to the <laughs> yes. opening scene. Yeah. Have you done any extra enchantments at Animal Kingdom? Not sure uh, what you mean okay, by that, but I love Animal yeah. Kingdom. Okay, I'm going to tell Jenna to go live. Um, so we're going to send it over to Jenna. So we'll see you guys in a bit. We're going to have some lunch. And we'll see you guys in just a bit. Yeah. So thanks for joining us, guys. We'll see you in just a bit. I'm going to get a shot of Everest here, and Jenna's going live. Here we go. All right, everybody. It is. Yeah, and if you if you um, go all the way to follow that river down, if you look at a map, it goes all the way up to Western Way, which is kind of cool. Because you can see Everest from Western Way. All the way out there. Yep, pretty cool. Oh, you're very welcome, guys. Yep, all four parks today. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you're hitting the like and all the things. All right, we'll send you over to Jenna in three, two, and one. Alright, how's it going? Um, so, we thought we'd head in here and uh, check the pin board real quick because, you know, they always change. And then we're going to go ride some rides. Yes, pins. Hi, Diamond Diva. How are you? Hi, Amelia. Let's see what they have. Ooh, I see one I might need. Hi, how are you? I think I need that one. Mom, do you want that one? It goes with your um, Chippendale flag. Can you just get two off of here and I'll give you another one yes, later? Yes. Yeah. 
Thank you so much. I have them in my bag, but I can't get to them. I'll pay you back, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> I know where you live. She does oh, know where I live. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm your mom, and I wouldn't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right. And, and then, then we need one more. Yeah. Yep. yep. So I'll take Oswald. Oh, I have to you No, know she's one. going to. Yep. Yes, I'm yep. Yep. Take she's like just I'm getting another me. one. Yes. Okay. And then mom will take Pluto. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's awesome. You too. Hi guys, welcome in. It is Shark Week, and yes, we're pen trading, guys. Pen trading. All right, I'm gonna put little Oswald in my pocket for now. Okay, so guys, they do still have my stitchy pen that I need. Haven't got them yet, but I'm gonna get them. Gonna get them. Yes, <laughs> we're doing some pen trading. Yeah, there were some cute ones over there. I really like this one. It's mine train, but it's, yeah, it's dopey. And is it grumpy? Dad might need this one, right, for the dwarfs? <laughs> I found another pen for Dad. Because it's his dwarfs. Oh, it is. <laughs> we can always come back on the way out. We can get it later. No worries. Yeah, we'll come back. We'll ha we have to come this way to leave, so. <laughs> yep. That was a good pin board. Hi, Carly. We ran into it MK a few weeks ago. Oh, awesome. Looking for stitch. Ooh, what, what stitch was I looking for? A stitch pen? All right, so we're gonna head over and ride some rides. Um, I think we're gonna go check out the seas and maybe uh, the land. So there's some some rides over there we can ride. Not too busy yet. This one's getting busier as you can see. It's 1046 and there's quite a line now. But we're gonna head over to the seas and then we'll go do the land. Oh, awesome Disney Magic family. Thanks for being here. I know, right? Too bad we can't pin trade for things like, you know, houses and cars and <laughs> wouldn't that be awesome? All right, here's one of my favorite characters, Baymax. Love him. Hello from Celebration, Florida. Hello. Yeah, it's it's warm. It's not going to be as warm as it has been, but yeah, it's still going to be hot. And thank you to our awesome uh, moppers that are in the chat today. We really appreciate you guys. Really appreciate your help on this all-day stream. So stick with us today, today guys. Um, I did see we we have 178 nine something subscribers so we're getting close i think we only need around 80 ish more to get to 179k today so let's try to get 179k today on the all day stream i think that would be amazing so share us out with your friends your family hi lee and robin go mini is here hi brendan what are mom and i wearing today well i will show you actually i'll show you too one thing that she got for her birthday she's wearing it today so you want to go in front of me, Mom, and I'll show yep. you. Or right. I'll show it. <laughs> show it. Oh, this, yeah. Your backpack. Yeah, yeah. So she got the new 100-year backpack. Yeah. It's even stitchy on it. Yep. So she got that yesterday. Yes. Um, her birthday was Friday, but we waited to give it to her yesterday because yep. we were out and about yep. at the parks. Yep. How cute. Hi, Tigger Tail John. Yes. Get to wake up to Epcot. It's very nice and peaceful here. Oh, did I miss the super chat? Hang on, let me look. One second. Uh, I don't see one. I don't think I missed, but I know I can click a button. Oh, I did. Here we go. Jennifer Price, $2. Sheba Dog raises and lowers his index finger to get notice. Hello, Jennifer. Thank you so much for that. Very sweet. Very, very kind of you. All right, guys, we do have to switch connections before we go into Nemo. So bear with me to the very end. <laughs> so we'll just stand here as we do the switching. So guys, this is intentional lag. Um, so stay tuned, be right back. All right, I think we're all good. Let me know. All good guys? All right, let's go. 
It's only a five minute wait, yay! We're back, thanks Dave. Mine, 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 mine. Thanks Al. Um, no, I have not done any of the rhino or elephant encounters at, at uh, Animal Kingdom. I have done some at SeaWorld though. I've done the dolphins, the penguins, and even the beluga. The beluga was amazing. Well, they're all amazing, but here we go. Thanks, Amelia. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Yeah, and speaking of vlogs, if you guys missed it, here, let me switch, turn down the bits. Um, if you guys missed it, we, uh, we had a vlog yesterday from Universal. Some Universal updates, the new ride, we show you the new ride, well, what we can show you. Hi, Joey's World. How's it going? We tell you our opinion on it. So, um, so yeah, go check out that Universal vlog. I know not everybody's a Universal fan, but it's a lot of fun there, too. We give you some HHN updates. We show you the Minion Cafe and the bakery. So, go check it out, guys. And if nothing else, then just to support us, because it really does help. We put a lot of work into those vlogs as well. Tigger Tail John, thank you so much. $1.99. Did you and Dale go in the Barbie box in Vegas by Cosmo? No, we did not. Is it new or has it been there forever? We, we went into the Cosmo, Cosmopolitan, but I don't remember a Barbie box. Thank you, John, for that. Very kind. Ooh, it is soft, dark, and weird. Hi, Teresa. From Nora J. Uh, Brianna, I might go see the Barbie movie. I don't know. I know Dale won't want to go see it with me, so we'll see. Maybe uh, Ivone and I can go. Tell Mickey it was mom's birthday. Yes. <laughs> We're going to ride Nemo and friends. Passing to Nemo. Hello. Hope you're having a good weekend. I'm going to try to turn up the bits just a bit. The bits a bit. I am wearing my all four park ears today. When we get off the ride, I'll show you guys. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Good morning, Dave. Wendy loves your new backpack, Mom. It is adorable. 30, 100 people in the chat, guys. Pop that like button. Share us out with your family and friends. Ooh, my favorite ride. That's really hard. Right now, it's probably Guardians of the Galaxy. But I like a lot of I like a lot of the retro, you know, old school rides as well, like People Mover, on a Mansion, Pirates. But right now, Guardians. We have two. Okay. Don't touch the butt. The butt is the bottom of the boat. <laughs> 14 pounds. The butt of the boat. Ooh, that was a big old sneeze. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Ooh, there's going to be a new theme park in Oakland. Sounds fun. Man, we're really moving now. I hope we don't have the Neener attack. <laughs> neener, neener, neener. All right, guys. It's going to be fun. Thank you. There might be some lag, so rewind. It should be all good.
Nemo! Where are you, Nemo? Who's Nemo? He's my son. You know that. I do. We went on a huge adventure together. manatee over here. We turn up a bit. It lagged just a little bit in the EAC, but you know, you're underwater there, so it's bound to happen. But hope you guys enjoyed it. Keep bopping the like button. Oh, here's a manatee right here. Hello. Oh, two of them. Aw. So cool. Good times. It was fun, right? It's a fun little relaxing ride. Except for the neener part. Neener, neener, neener. <laughs> Wonder if this one on the right is sleeping. He's not moving much. Oh, no, he's moving now. No, he's eating. Oh, I see. He's got some lettuce. Aren't they pretty? Poor. This one's got his whole fin, but this one lost it. Most of the time in a boating, they get caught in the boating or the boats, motors, which is very sad. 
Yeah, Julia, it's a fun ride, isn't it? Nemo. All right. Well, should we go up and see the, let's go up and see the tanks up upstairs now that we know it works. Uh, let's see if we can go up the escalator. Yep, here we go. Go see if the dolphins are out. I love dolphins. They're like doggies of the sea. Little Joe, yeah, one of them is Little Joe, you're right. Right, Jeremy, aren't they cool? Good Sunday morning, Michael, how are you? I can't remember the other one's name either. We'll go in there and see. Let's see if we can find a dolphin. Oh, there's one right here. Oh my goodness. There must be a trainer up there. Just chilling. Oh. Yeah, there has to be a trainer up there. He's all excited. Yeah. <laughs> he or she, yeah, we don't know. Hey, Jose, how are you? Hi, Spider-Man. Of course we can see the dolphins. It's the only one I see right now. I don't see any more. Yeah, they must be feeding them or doing some kind of training. Oh, here we go. Now we're gonna have a swim. Chloe's doing good, Teresa. Thanks for asking. Good morning, Sandy Pandy. How are you? Let's see if the dolphin comes back this way. Yeah, I love when they do the the uh, training too. It's always so yeah. fun. Wow, you got to go up top. That's amazing, Kevin. I'm so jealous. Oh, there's the dolphin. <laughs> First time in chat. You usually watch via TV. Oh, thanks, Mary. Thanks for watching and thanks for joining the chat. We love that. So glad you're here with us today on this beautiful Sunday. Still morning, right? Yeah, morning. <laughs> Let's see what else you can find. Oh, okay, he's coming back. Kinda. Yeah. Turtle talk is fun. Hi, Priscilla. Priscilla says happy belated birthday to mom. Good morning, Wendy. You're welcome. It is very nice, isn't it, Noreen? Very nice in here. Holy moly, big fish over here. Ooh, and a stingray. Is that Mr. Ray coming at us? Yeah. Where's your school of fish? Well, it is Sunday, I guess. So a school of fish are at home. A friend who did the scuba thing. Yeah, my cousin did the scuba thing. We actually have a video from that. We filmed him, uh, of course, from this side of the glass. <laughs> uh, but it was cool. And then he told us about the experience. So if you haven't seen that vlog, go check it out on Resort TV One. If somebody wants to post it, that would be awesome. Watching from the UK. Thanks, cake lady. Look at that stingray. Holy moly. Or is that a guitar fish? Oh, here's a shark. It is shark week. Yes. It's a Sunday school. There you go. Sunday school fish. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, cool cat. Hi, Kelly. Oh my, look at this fish. <laughs> Don't bother me. Don't bother me. That's what it looks like. <laughs> Aaron and family, thanks for being here and watching with us today. This is the ride, so this is when you go in the EAC right here. Pointy nose fish. <laughs> I'm sure he has an official name. Oh, there's another shark. Hey, Kaylee, how's it going? Hey, take your tail, Jess. How are you? Woke up early just to watch the stream. Good morning, Jess. Thanks for waking up early for us. Hope you guys are having a good Sunday so far. Oh man, look at this guy just laying on the on the ride there. <laughs> Instead of a grouper, it was a grumper. That's hilarious. Love that.
Leave it. Okay, no worries. Have a good time at church today. No, so that oh, that right was there. a tarpon. That big old fish was a tarpon, guys. Let's see. Okay, and do you see these windows over here? Right here? That's the restaurant, Coral Reef. It's amazing. We've done um, a review from there as well. So if you haven't seen that, go check out our channel. Check out the review from there. Oh, you're so welcome, Kaylee. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Let's see, what did who that Dave say? I missed it. Uh, missed it, missed it. And now I can't find it. Oh, I missed it, guys. Thank you, Alondra. That's very kind of you. There's another shark. Oh, two sharks. Hi, Stanley. I was there having a rough day. I would be moving slow, but I would be in my happy place. Oh well, I'm glad we can bring you here virtually. I'm hope I hope it's helping just a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to say hi or no? Okay. No worries. Yeah. No worries. Yeah. For sure. We can grab a picture. We can have a picture. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you for watching. Thank Where are you from? Montreal. Oh, Canada. nice. Okay. So our French can eat here. Yeah. Yes. We've been there. It's beautiful. Look, you turn Beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Have fun. Okay. Bye. Say hi to Josh. We will. We will. Oh, wow. Look at that guy. <laughs> Hoppers from Montreal. Oh, there's another. Hi, Main Street Racers. It is the ultimate fish cake. Yes. Uh, Oh, cool, Martin. I hope you're having fun. Oh, I didn't see the turtle. He's one of my faves. Oh, my goodness. I love you, turtle. Oh, my goodness. Come come say hi, Mr. Crush. Come this way. Oh, my goodness. Guys, he's coming to say hello. Yeah, that's okay. Still coming. Oh, my goodness. Hi. You're so cute. Hi, Crush. <laughs> oh my word, that was really cool. That was awesome. There's a hidden Mickey. Oh, there's a school of fish. Wow, look at all those fish. Isn't that awesome? The restaurant, Glenn, yes, I recommend it. It's amazing. They, and they have, oh, there's a turtle down there sleeping on Mickey. I just noticed that. I know, I was like, this is real. Yeah, 100% real. That's super cool. This is the Living Seas. Um, so you go ride the Nemo ride and you can you get let off right here in the Living Seas. Or you can come in the back door. Um, and just come enjoy the seas and go to uh, Turtle Talk and just see all the exhibits. Oh, the dolphin! Oh my goodness, hi! I love the dolphins. They're probably my fave. They're like doggies of the sea. I love when they play. They Every once in a while, you'll, one of them will have a hula hoop and he like plays with the hula hoop. Hi, Mandy. Good morning, follow the Bradleys. Oh, here he comes. Oh, just having a cruise around the tank. All right, well, let's head on this way. Coral reef can get loud, yes, yes. So depending on, yeah, if you don't like like that, then then, or if your kids, you know, can't handle it, yeah, it will get loud in there. For sure, but I love it. It's a great restaurant. Yummy, yummy food. Great view. I like, I like fish. But they do have other things, they have steak, so if you're not a fish person, you do have steak.
Yeah, Brad, isn't it cool? But Jenna, did you show your ears? Happy birthday, Mom, from Kiki Mouse. Um, I did show them, but when we get outside, I'll show you again. Hey, Garfish. Oh, how cool is that? Hi, Barbara. Watching with my son, uh, Justo, from Argentina. Hello. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Follow the Radleys, that's hilarious. All right, I hardly ever go in this room, so we're going in this room today, Mom. I don't know if it lags, so just keep me posted. I don't have the bits all the way up. They are, aren't that, isn't that cool, Carly? So this is the nursery. Buffet, Phoebe Buffet. Okay, what is this? I don't know what this is. Oh, I think that's for the uh, turtle talk. All right, let's see what we have over here. Rehabilitating reefs. I know. Is it like a ninanami? Or is it an octopus? No, I see it right here. Yeah. Interesting. Got spiky tentacles. All good so far. Thanks, guys. Well, it's also this. There's some things for kids to play with, and then underwater wonders. Not exactly sure what this is. Clownfish and anemones. Oh my word, there's a Mickey hat. Oh my god, cute. Hey, DBC Debra. Corals. The Mickey hat, mom, on the. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and then it's a fish. Oh, yeah, what it's is a, that? It's, uh, it looks like a fish, fish lizard. <laughs> yes. Fish lizard? That's what it looks like. Yeah. I don't think that's what it is. A shrimp. Oh, is it a shrimp? Yeah, Good job. Let's get it. <laughs> Look at the Mickey yeah, There's a starfish right over here. There's a starfish. The shrimp is just going yeah, round and round and round. <laughs> There's another shrimp coming too. <laughs> oh, cool, Brad. Do they really dare me? All right, guys. It's kind of busy over here, so we're gonna head out. We'll go um, see the manatees, manatees from the top. Of here, go see if we can ride another ride. Maybe living with the land. What do you guys think? Give Josh some time to eat some lunch. Josh and Dad. He is like a fish lizard. That's what he looked like. He was looking like he was walking like a lizard, but he's a fish. Technical term there. I'm so glad we can do this now because. Man, the AC in here is amazing. Yes, pop that like button and subscribe if you're new. We're trying to get to 179,000 subscribers today. All right, so we got Little Joe and Lou. Those are the names of the manatees. Little Joe and Lou. There they are. You love living with the land. Awesome. I think we'll probably do that next. Sounds good, guys. The nose arm bug, that's right. Fish lizard, nose arm bugs, all the, all the things. <laughs> Look at all that lettuce ready for him back there. <laughs> Land would be great, all right. Sounds good to me. All right, well, there we go. Lou and Lil Joe. Lou is 2,000 pounds and Lil Joe is 1,800 pounds. Sea cows, that's right. 
uh, Soren. I don't know, it probably is by now. And that one's a little difficult to stream, so I don't know if I'll be doing that one today. But I do love that ride, Jess, it's a great one. That's right, Ocean Crush the Like Button. <laughs> Ocean Crush the Like Button. And they like my lizard fish that I came up with. It was like a lizard, but a fish. <laughs> So back in the day when we were younger, they used to have a diver come in this pipe and it was really cool. They don't do that anymore. As you can tell, it looks pretty dirty. I wonder if the fish lizard lives a million leagues under the sea. <laughs> Carly, I bet it does. And then it becomes a giant fish lizard and that's what got them. A million seas under the ocean. <laughs> Let's go to the land. They do have pins in here, so we're gonna see what pins they have. Also, look how cute the little sea turtle is. You remember him? Yeah, Classy Disney World. It was so fun. Sad they got rid of it. Hi, do you have a pin board here? Ooh, yay. Thank you. Oh my goodness, he's cute. Oh, he is. <laughs> Are you gonna get him? No, you can have him. All right. <laughs> All right, let's see. We got it. Find my pins. In here somewhere. Oswald's cute too, but I just got an Oswald. That's the Hulk, I think. <laughs> oh, it is, isn't it? <laughs> what pens we can buy. Sorry. Look at this oh, robot yeah. <laughs> stitchy. Uh, yeah, I don't know why they stopped the diver. I don't know. It was a fun, fun thing that they did. A lot of cool ones. Yeah, I don't know. Or maybe it was more dangerous than we thought. You know, no. Who knows? I like this one. I'm trying to keep it together. <laughs> uh, Tigger Tail John says, $1.99. Um, Barbie box not new on, on bridge between Aria and Cosmo. Oh, okay. Well, thank you so much, Tigger Tail John. And I don't remember that, so too bad, because that would have been fun to see. We probably did see it, and I just it didn't register. Thank you, though. Appreciate that. I know, we're, we're having a good pen day today. Yes. <laughs> Sleepy figment. Upside down sort of day, I like that. <laughs> you can put that on your pin board when you're having an upside down kind of day. Okay, wait, what's in here? It was all started with Get it? a mouse. Oh, yeah, I get it. luckily it didn't break. <laughs> it's all good. All right, what's the inside look like, Mom? Oh my goodness, uh, it's Walt and Mickey. Yeah, it is. That's, That's really cool. cool. And they've got um, a lot of Mickeys, different Mickeys. Yes. Throughout, oh, the, so throughout nice. the years. That is very cool. Some of the pins look massive. Some of them are bigger, are big. but yes. not, yeah. not massive, I wouldn't say. All right, guys, I am gonna take you outside now. We're all going outside and I gotta get you out of the setting that I have, so bear with me. The stream. I think we're all good. Corey says, that's a great pen. Get it. Both of you. <laughs> Aw, Corey, I know. It is a very cool pen. We really did. I, Brad says, I don't collect pens, but I gotta have that one. It is super cool. I bet they have it at the pen shop on the way out, because we gotta get another one on the way out. Dad's, um, the dwarfs. Oh, that's right. So don't worry, we'll get some pens on the way out. I think today's the day I might get a munchling to unbox for you guys too. Because I want my latte Mickey. Unless I just get the giant one. 
Dale will be like, what did you bring home? A giant stuffed coffee? Don't you have enough coffee? <laughs> oh my goodness, it's so funny. So guys, um, I don't know if Josh has talked about any of the sponsors yet, but let me just chat about one here. Uh, MickeyTravels.com. If you guys want to book a trip right here to Walt Disney World, go check out MickeyTravels.com. They will help you book your trip right here to Walt Disney World or Disneyland, even a Disney cruise. So go check out MickeyTravels.com. You won't be paying anything extra and they will help you with their expert advice. Book your trip. So book your next trip to Disney with MickeyTravels.com. Keep an eye out for rare airplane pens. Okay, definitely will. Definitely will. <laughs> Have a good day. Thank you. Jeffrey Pop, you gotta smuggle it into the house. Okay, and then when he comes into my office where I keep all my things, he'll be like, Whoa, what is this? And when did you add it? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Yeah, we could totally do that, Wendy. I love that idea. All right. Head inside. Inside. Last pan I bought was a stained glass flower and garden pen. Oh, how cool. Hi, Nathan. She would, Corey. She really would. Hi, MDF. Ooh, that sounds good. Mom and I got Starbucks on our way here because we knew the line here at Epcot would be too long to wait in. Hey, Sean Williams. Sean Williams says he wouldn't even notice. He's a guy. Well, you would think, right? Dale notices a lot more than you would think. <laughs> but no, I know what you mean. Oh yeah, the new movie. The show, it's fun. I mean, it's a great place to go cool off. Of course, we can't show it on the stream. Um, Nothing I would wait long for. Well, Jonathan, welcome in. Thanks for being a new subscriber. We appreciate it. Thanks in and welcome to the Resort Hopper family. So we call everybody that watches us Resort Hoppers. And we do go live um, usually every Friday around 6 p.m. Eastern at a Disney park or Universal. Um, but we also go live throughout the week as well. So make sure your notification bell is on and you'll know every time we go live or post a new video. That's so true, Jeffrey Pop. <laughs> Happy Sunday, Michelle. So it looked like I think Joey's World said we had 1,500 likes. Thank you very much for that. It's the Garden Grill. We had the most amazing breakfast there. Had a vlog from that. So if you guys didn't see that, go check it out. Oh, yeah. Here, I'll show you my ears before we head downstairs. Bam. Hello. So my ears are the four park ears, and it has a detachable bow. So I took the bow out. Um, and I've got my Disney World shirt on. Mom's got her uh, lanyard that she got from iBone. And she's got the pins on there to trade so it's easier. Hi, Ashley. And she has her new backpack. Yes. Yeah, we just got her for her birthday. How cute is that? The new um, from the 100 collection. <laughs> so. <laughs> okay, let's head down the escalator. Oops. <clears throat> so I'm going to have to switch connections again when we get down here. It does not seem very busy, so I am loving that. And the land is a nice, relaxing ride. They love your shirt, Mom. Aw, uh, thanks. Aw, uh, thanks, Diamond Diva and Classy Disney Mom. You guys are too sweet. Alright. So, here we go. Switching connections again, guys. Five minutes, yay, yay, yay. Quick for today. Thanks, Wendy. I know, right, Brad? They actually do have some of those um, on Etsy. They're, um, oh, what's that called? They're the plastic ones where they print it. 3D printing, there we go, I couldn't think of the name. Are we back? Okay, good. Thanks, Jeremy. Good morning, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> no worries, clobbering time. There'll be none of that today. 
Yeah, hooray! Turn down the bits just a little bit. The bits a bit. Show the goat. Oh, okay. I'm trying to remember where he's at. Over by the farmhouse. Behind the scenes is a fun is a fun uh, tour. I've done it. It's been a while, but it was fun. You miss my song? Oh, oh, I'll have to bring it back. For sure. Hey, Jiminy Goofy. Welcome in. Looks like snow. Can you see any hidden Mickeys, Mom? I don't see any hidden Mickeys yet, but I'm sure there are some in there somewhere. <laughs> Me too, Lori. Yeah, the music is great. Great, great. Rain and it turns into ice. Elsa. Ice and snow. Thanks for subscribing. Just visited uh, Disney World for my very first time in January, bringing back all the fun and memories. Thank you so much. Yep, Soren is still here. The right of the house. Okay, depends on which side of the boat I'm on, but I will try. I'll try my best. So, welcome in, uh, LJ Cool. Appreciate you subscribing. Welcome to the Resort Hopper family. Here comes the boat. I was like, man, we're not moving. Here's Dale. Hi, Dale. Thank you so much. Dale, you didn't hear me talking about a plushie, right? <laughs> Just kidding. Everybody say hi to Dale. Thank you so much, sweetie. Hope you're having a good Sunday. So if you guys are wondering if you're new here, Josh is my brother. Dale right there is my husband. So Josh and I um, have been going to Disney since we were little, since we were kids, and um, enjoy it a lot. So we decided to do the channel together. And Dale and Josh's wife, Steph, aren't as big of Disney fans, but they do come with us every once in a while. And Dale and I have our own channel, Adventures of Jenna and Dale, and we do adventures outside of the Disney um, parks here in Central Florida and all over, really. So go subscribe over there to Adventures of Jenna and Dale. Really appreciate it. White line? Okay. I was like, wait, where's the white line? Uh, we have five dollars from Mo Banshee. Thank you so much, Mo Banshee. That's so sweet of you. Thank you, thank you for the super chat. Appreciate it. Very kind of you. Hi, Mary. He also says thanks for all the highs. I'm on my phone. Have a beautiful day. Watching from Michigan, just in time for one of my favorite rides in my favorite park. Mom, mom loved her birthday, yes. And it was her 25th, you're correct. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Too funny. We have two. Can we wait for the back of the boat? Okay. Back here? Okay, thank you. I like the back of the boat. Just got back from our Disneyland trip. Your stream is helping my transition. Oh, thank you, Disney um, Pixie. I always remember those getting back. Getting back from the trips are never fun. I'm glad we're helping. Oh, yay, Shannon. Enjoy the rest of your day today. Good morning. It's always nice to get the work done and then enjoy. Some Sean? Dale's probably changing the tire. <laughs> Dale's good at that. Tigger Tail John says, hello, Mom. <laughs> Hi, Nico, the Ge uh, Greco. All right, so we're gonna do back seat of the next boat. Thanks for 3,200 people in the chat. There you, yeah, the mornings and the evenings are the best in Florida, for sure. I agree, Brad. I agree. Yeah, Jeremy, I remember when they had a skipper on here and they would talk to you. 
like on the great movie ride they had one for the uh, there for a while too happy sunday vicky okay thank you you had Jiminy Goofy. <laughs> Hi, Lisa. That's awesome, Lori. All right, here comes our boat. Oh, you're so welcome, Kyle. Thank you so much. Oh, Mom, you're behind me. That's another row. All right, here we go, guys. All right, enjoy the ride, everybody. This is going to be fun. Hi Molly. Okay, so it will lag a little bit in here, so just stay tuned. Rewind if you need to. But enjoy. appeared as desolate as the desert, but over time, rainwater and nutrients gradually penetrated the hard, and rich soil, and will one day become home to the American farm. Discovering better ways to grow food that will assure 
these plants are definitely on their way up. Innovative growing techniques like these increase fields while more efficiently using resources like water, fertilizer, and pesticides. Another innovation at work is our integrated pest management program. By populating our greenhouses with beneficial insects that prey on harmful pests, like aphids and flies, we are significantly reducing our reliance on conventional pesticides. We are growing these plants using our nutrient film system. This technique precisely controls and recycles water in the nutrients. With it, we can produce over 27,000 eggs of lettuce a year in this one small area. source of fertilizer for the plants, and the plants help keep the water clean for the fish. It's another great way to produce more while using less. In our lab, Epcot scientists are working with the U.S. Department of Agriculture on a number of innovative projects. The goal of these efforts is to produce higher yielding and better quality plants.
Hi Tracy, good morning. Oh. Okay, so we gotta turn the bits back up here in a moment, so stay tuned everybody. We're gonna head upstairs. Hello from Arizona. Uh, the buffer? Well, that ride just lags. It's just the thing that happens on some of the rides. It's just what happens. Lag happens. We need a shirt like that. We said that before. But it wasn't too bad, right, guys? Hi, Lily's wife. How's it going? Did anybody else get a lot of lag? Just right at the beginning, where we normally do. I think it got better. Yeah, I remember when they had the cast members do the narration. It was a lot of fun. Okay. So, let me message Josh, because I think he messaged me. Food and Wine starts on Thursday, so I will be here for the opening day of that. It's going to be awesome. We cannot wait. Um, so, yeah. Let me see how long. Check this real quick. Tiny bit of lag. Okay, good. Thanks, Corey Ruprecht. Appreciate that. Oh, yeah. Let's try it. All right. Let me ask Josh. The turtle brownie. Ooh, that sounds amazing. Also, the food smells so good in there. Oh, my goodness. Sorry. Yes, lag happens, that's right. Doing good, Lily. I hope you're having a good Sunday today. Good morning, Victor. Yep, check your live status if you had any lag. Make sure your live button is red. That means you are currently with us at this moment in time. So. All right, hey, Nikki, how are you? Mom, Nikki says hi and hope you had a great birthday. Mom. Thank you. <laughs> Nikki said hi. Don't. <laughs> hi, Nikki. <laughs> that I was going to say, don't sound like I you're wish, mad. She's wishing no, you a happy no, birthday. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Nikki. <laughs> Sorry. Mom was paying attention to something else, but she yes, appreciates it. I do, Nikki. <laughs> Thanks, Nikki. And Tobins, hope you guys are having a good Sunday. Look who we spotted. It's Winnie. Hi, Jake Tobin, how are you too? Hope you're having a good Sunday as well. Let's go over here, we'll get a better view. Hi, Herschel and Margie. Yeah, I, there's a chance of rain today, so we are gonna have a little bit of rain, but hopefully it'll keep it nice and cool. Oh, he's got a stick, oh my goodness. <laughs> Where's he taking a stick? Where's he going? <laughs> I don't know, they don't have Eeyore, guys. Just Winnie. Hi, resort budgeting. Hi, <laughs> Hi, Winnie. Are you going exploring with your, your stick there? Going, oh, fishing. Oh, I love that. Okay, catch me a good fish for, for dinner, okay? Okay. <laughs> we love you, Winnie. <laughs> so cute. He's fishing, guys, he's fishing. I know, I love Piglet. Piglet's my favorite. Now, if you really wanna see the Winnie the Pooh characters, go to Crystal Palace. You, it's a little pricey, but you get to see all of them. They spend a lot of time with you. They take your, you know, take pictures with you. They talk to you. It's really fun. Uh, oh, yes. Yeah, sorry, guys. I got to get you out of potatoes. I'm very sorry. Oh, my goodness. Thanks, little Mr. Young Dude. Hang on. Okay, guys, we are going to Figment. Um, Josh gave me the go-ahead. He's all good. So, um, Figment it is. Thanks, guys. So appreciate it. 
Aw, thank you, Be Best. I didn't used to be, I had practice. Um, but let's go ride the ride. And uh, it will lag in here. It's like 100% sure it'll lag. Um, actually, let me pull over for a second. I'm trying to remember, let me text Josh back before we get in the line. Also guys, if you if you want a bathroom that's usually not so busy, they have bathrooms back back behind here. And they're usually not that bad. <laughs> it's all good, but now I want a potato. <laughs> I know. I'm getting hungry too, guys. Yeah. We'll eat after this. <laughs> potato a la mode. I love it. Good morning, <laughs> Roscoe Mothership. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, let's just wait. There he is. Still fishing over there? He's a fishing. Poor Winnie, he's just not catching. Nothing, nothing yet. Nope. <laughs> oh, thanks Marissa, so glad you're enjoying today. Subscribe if you're new, guys. All right, well, let's go on. Figment. We are going to have to switch connections, so we're going to do that. Um, so give us one moment while I check it. I think I turn, yeah, I turned that off. Okay. Here we go, everybody. This is going to be fun. Ooh, baked potato. Have you ever? Okay. In Indiana, we had this restaurant. I can't remember what it was called. It was a, it was a barbecue place. And they would do baked potatoes with barbecue pulled pork on top of it. Amazing. So good. Okay, hang on, guys. Hi. The upper half of the Figment building, so it used to be a play area for kids um, or anybody. Now it's a DVC lounge. All right, here we go, guys. We're gonna try this, see how it goes. So it will lag, just rewind a little bit. Um, it will go. think it would be me. Oh, sorry. Yep, no worries. Pigment is the original stitch, so true. <laughs> I love that. Hi, Felicia. Thank you so much. Thank you, you too. They were saying Figment is the original stitch. Oh, <laughs> you know, because he can be naughty, but he's super cute. <laughs> All right, everybody. So we're going to have some lunch after this. We'll send it over to Josh. A Gray's Cafeteria. I've never heard of that. Gray's Cafeteria? Yeah. You know it? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Never heard of it. Yeah. Hey, Tim. Wait, Tim says, hi, everyone. Just pop in and say, hey, I'll be back later. All right, Tim. All right, Tim. You okay first? Let me know. We got to know. Um, yeah, I don't know. I see. I don't remember it, so... Oh, thanks, Spider-Man. We never went. No. Hello from the Netherlands. Thank you. Oh, that's okay. I don't want the light to get in your way. So, thank you, though. I'm good. We'll just show it off the side. <laughs> but thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Very kind. Here, I'll let mom. Actually, I'll let you go in first. Okay. And then, yeah. All good. There we go. Perfect. To ensure your safe tour of our sanctuary lands, please remain seated with your hands, arms, 
feet and legs inside your tour track. Keep a watchful eye on your children. Alright guys, here we go. Enjoy the ride. Again, it will die. And I'll bring it right back. No worries. Bienvenidos. Para su seguridad durante su estadía en nuestros laboratorios sensoriales, permanezca sentado y mantenga las manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del vehículo. Y cuide a los pequeñitos. Gracias. Oh, big guy, thank you so much. 1999, hi Jenna and mom from Jesse and Thomas in, in Missouri. Thank you, Jesse and Thomas. Appreciate that. Here we go, enjoy the ride. Thank you. I'm Dr. Nice Channing, chairman of the Imagination Institute. On your tour, you'll see how the five human senses can help capture your imagination. Oh, oh, can I go too? Absolutely not. Uh, this is one of our discoveries, the figment of imagination. Yeah, I know all about the senses. There's sight, sound, <laughs> smell, <laughs> touch, cookie cookie go, and taste. <sighs> Tastes like chicken. Can I go? Please, please, please. No, I don't want you out of my sight. Out of sight? Okay. Come on, everybody. Here we go. Figment, you are not to interfere with the tour. Our first stop is the sound plan. We'll begin by testing your hearing with a series of tones. Left ear, right ear. Left, right. What? This is odd. Um, hello? Who is this? It's Figment. Figment? I thought I told you not to interfere. But you've got it wrong, Doc. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. <laughs> now I've completely lost my train of thought. No, you haven't.
It's exactly what I imagined. at Epcot. Figment is her favorite ride, so it seemed uh, the perfect time to send a treat your way. Stay cool and hydrate, hydrated today, uh, Josh and Jenna. Thank you so much, Victor. That's so sweet of you. And uh, to Julia. Safe travels home, and thank you so much. Very, very kind of you guys. Um, we had another one right before we went on the ride. I don't know if you guys heard when I talked about that, but that was from, uh, let's see, I can find it here. Uh, big guy, big guy since 1999 as well. Hi, Jenna and mom from Jesse and Thomas in Missouri. Thank you so much, guys. So appreciate. Everybody's been so kind today. Very, very sweet. All right, Vanellope's over there. Me and Ingri in. There's the internet. I don't know when we're uh, where we're gonna eat lunch. We're gonna figure that out though. Yeah. So we're gonna do that here in a second. So guys, I got the bit rate way down just so. We're all good until we get out of here, but how was it? Did it work okay? We had a little bit of lag, I saw, but hopefully it wasn't too bad. Oh. Figment hats. Mom, do you need a figment hat? Of course. It's legit. Like, I think you would see these in the 80s or in Japan. Yeah. <laughs> Clap it on her head. Uh -huh. <laughs> how cute would that be? Cute little sleepy, or not stitchy, sleepy figment. $39.99. How much are the hats? Let's see. They are $34.99, and it's big and plushy. I, did we have figment hats back in the day, right? Like, just like baseball. Oh, the yeah. Yes, yes. I think. Yes, I think so. Ooh, eating lunch in Morocco. Okay. I like that idea. We've got the shoulder pals here. Yes, I did. I think they're all gone, too, because I don't see them. You think they'd have them in here? Oh, you want mom's new lounge fly? Me too. It's really cute. It's really cute. All right, let's see here. There's some pins. Got all the princesses. The hat is great for Florida, right? <laughs> nice and cool. 
keep your head nice and toasty. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to head out. So we can switch you over to Josh. I don't know what he has to Push all the buttons. All right. Yep, sorry, I got it, I got it all set, thank you. Um, wanted to wait until we got outside. But we're outside now, so let me, uh, hi Harold, good morning from California. Thanks everybody. All right, see if Josh is ready. Hi, Amy. All right, guys, we're going to send you back to Josh over at Animal Kingdom. And then he's going to be park hopping here after Mom and I eat lunch. Um, and yeah, then Mom and I will park hop as well. So it's been a lot of fun so far. So let's send you over to Josh. Just a bit. Make sure he's all set mansion lover hello welcome in all right guys sending you to Josh see you after lunch Welcome back, everybody. Hopefully, we'll see when you come back over here, and we'll get it. We'll get it working. Yep, there is a part one, or there is a part two. There is a part two, and we'll be doing that a little after seven. We'll see. We'll see when it switches over here. Welcome back, everybody. There we are. All right. So there is a part two that'll be happening a little bit later. Thanks again, everybody, for keeping Jen and Mom company for a little while here. We're we're gonna go on the Gorilla Falls Exploration Trail. We unfortunately um, we couldn't do the uh, the train because it oh, or the okay. I get my umbrella out. Okay. Oh, yep. Here we go. So there there was a uh, anyway we couldn't get our. Um, you dropped something off your stroller back there, ma'am. Ma'am. You drop you drop something right there. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we couldn't get on the Wildlife Express, is what I was saying, because it was actually um, down. So I'll try it later. It's raining now. Let me get my umbrella out. Do you have an umbrella? I can get your. I think I got it. If you wanna. Yep. Okay. So it's not raining. Not raining too bad. So I'll wait for you to get yours out. I can get mine up once I get it, my backpack back on. Okay. I'll wait for you to get yours out and we can go. Some of this is inside anyway. Hey Julie, welcome back. Thanks for being here. Over 3,000 people still here in the chat, hanging out, enjoying an amazing Sunday of park hopping. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, it's not that bad. It just kind of started real, real quick. How was mom's birthday celebration? It was great. Everybody had a great time. Yeah. Anyway, and I wanted to thank, I wanted to uh, thank again, old Mr. Young Dude and uh, Christopher Black for their very generous PayPal's earlier. I don't know if they were both on the stream when I said the thank yous earlier, so I want to make sure they heard me. Big thank yous to old Mr. Young Dude, Fuzz Nuts and Popsicles, and, uh, and Christopher Black. Right, I guess there's no, uh, no need to do that now. Here we go. There they are, Ellie. Look at her tail. Rihanna, look up. See the monkeys? Where do I see the monkeys? There they are. Uh, so, Julie, we've been at Animal Kingdom and Jenna's at Epcot. So, we're doing a split split park hopping today. So that's kind of fun. Yeah, so big thank you to Old Mr. Young Dude and Fudge Nuts and Popsicles. You got your umbrella? Let me take it. I can carry it for you. And also Christopher Black. I got it for now. Okay. I'll pull it back up if we have room here. Yeah. It's a little bit crowded in here. I got the monkeys over there having a good time monkeying around. Hey, Checker Champ. Hello. Hello. 
They were up here in this, yeah. Oh, right, they're right there, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just hanging out. Oh, right up there. Yep. Hey, L. Barbie, hello. Uh, yeah. So, next, um, Mom and Jenna are going to uh, be uh, eating lunch now. Uh, Dad and I just ate lunch, and then they are, uh, they're going to be heading, once park hopping starts, they're going to be heading to Hollywood Studios, and we're going to be, I got it, we're going to be heading to, um, no, sorry, we're going to be heading to Hollywood Studios, and they're going to be heading to Magic Kingdom. I for a minute, you guys Yep, I got it, it back. Nope. I thought maybe I missed it. Sorry, that. I said it wrong, so, yep. <laughs> I thought, oh my goodness, I was wrong. Yeah. No, you're good. I was wrong. So anyway, my, um, Jenna and Mom are going to head to Magic after go. this, and, and uh, we're going to head to Hollywood. So definitely um, stay tuned for all the fun. It's one of those you can't decide whether to have an umbrella up or not. Yeah, so I can, definitely. Uh, take it for it if you need. Oh, I got it. Thanks. Okay. Yeah. So fun times, guys. But um, since we can't park up till two, that's how we did it. We decided to do it a little bit at a time. Oh, is it? Okay. See it? Uh, it's way in the corner, way back by the fence. Guys. Oh, okay. I have to yeah. get over a little bit. Yep, way there. Back, okay. Right there. All right. Yeah. Must be uh, the rain came and it's. Uh, yep. Cool. Right here. Yep. So we're gonna finish at Magic Kingdom. Well, that's awesome, bad, Tina. Tanita. Yeah, these are great trails. No, it feels pretty good. Yeah, the rain. This is not bad. Rain's gonna help us stay cool today. Right here. Go back in the, uh, against the fence. All right, guys. So. <laughs> yep, we're just gonna be hopping around all over the place. Maximus minibus, maximalist minibus. I really said that right. Um, One ninety nine for um, Sandy uh, Biggins in uh, Medford, Massachusetts. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thanks for the stream. Having a really hard week. Saying goodbye to my dog tomorrow. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah, we remember. I remember all about that. I. He, of course, ours, we didn't know he was going to go, but uh, we knew he was. We just didn't know what, what day, but uh, it's very hard for sure. Hey, Leaf, I'm sorry to hear that. She's dealing with, let's see, what did Leaf say? I'm sorry, I missed it. Something going on with Amy maybe or something? Let me see here. I have to scroll back. Uh, let's see. Amy's foot is bothering her. Oh, sorry. Leaf, hopefully she feels better. Oh, no worries, resort budgeting. Yep. Uh, we understand people are going to come in and ask questions about what's going on and you know, we'll, we'll, we'll help or people in the chat can help too. So, all right. Oh, thanks. Old Mr. Young Dude. Yeah, sorry. I wanted to make sure. I know you said in the, in the PayPal message, you said that you were going to be doing chores and housework and stuff. And so I want to make sure you heard the, uh, I want to make sure you heard the uh, thank you because I really appreciate it. So yeah, thank you. <laughs> All right. I got your umbrella in my bag in case, in case it gets bad again. Yep. Thank you. All right. Hey, anyway, I guess we can go over here because we can actually see the mole rats today because our, our, our stream actually works in here where it didn't used to. So. Oh, there they are. They're all, they always sleep in the same little spot there. Oh, oh, there's one. There's one. There's one crawling around over there. We got the little little holes they go through. And those are fully grown. Oops. Hello from London. Hello, Team O'Sullivan. But yeah, it's definitely um, a crazy day today, but it doesn't matter with the rain because Dad saw the radar. It looks like it's not going to be that bad, so we're happy to... It's cooler. Yeah. Thank you. Still rolling in fast. Yep, it's coming fast, but we got our umbrella, so we'll get them back out here if it starts raining again. All right. Big rain coming. Yep, thanks. Trey, we'll, be, we'll, we'll make sure uh, we find some cover after we get out of this little area here. <laughs> I bought some shirts from Arctic Cool and they kept me cool in Florida. It has UV protection and the sweat evaporates quickly. Oh. Uh, my wife likes those kind of shirts. I'll have to, Arctic Cool, I'll have to uh, tell her about that. Steph likes those. 
see the net. She found some. We were down at Tradewinds Resort in, in St. Pete, and she found one she liked, but she's she never been able to find any since then that she liked that well. Oh. Hey, Sarah. Loving the live stream flying up to Disney next week from North Wales to celebrate my grandmother's 70th. Hope to see you, oh. for sure. Pouring in four corners. Yeah, that's not too far from here, so we'll get it soon, but it'll uh, it'll come and pass. Oh, you can kind of see it right there. You got light and dark. Yeah, some big ones up there. There we go. All right. The fish or if they're birds? Oh, yeah, I don't know. Hello. African spoonbills, okay. And what are the yellow birds called? Golden weavers. Okay. Cool. And they're the ones that make. Yep, so you'll see them all around the area. Them are really good right here. They build their nuts upside down. Oh. Okay. Wow. That's cool. And I can tell why these are called spoonbills, of course. <laughs> exactly. It's pretty easy to see. <laughs> pretty neat. It's a little nicer today. It's cooler, isn't it? For yeah. Yep. The birds tend to, it, does the heat bother the birds? Then? No, no. Like I said, we have the apricots, that tropical. Yeah, the okay, okay. okay. No worries. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Marble teal in the middle there, those ducks. Yeah. We're kind of burying them for the storm. A lot of the birds and the trees will usually just stay in the trees if it's going to be something. Okay. Yeah, we were at Epcot the other night before a storm, and all the birds moved to a different tree that they felt like was safer. They all moved at this like hundreds of them at the same time. They're 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 very smart about that. Yeah, they're very smart. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, cool. Down yeah. Interesting animals, yes, for sure. Pretty, pretty scenery here. And then hopefully, yeah, hippos coming up next, like she said, and then see the gorillas. Hello, Becky. Yeah, we're going to be seeing some. Oh, oh, yeah. That's how you can tell the uh, how you can tell the storm is coming. We get that. that we, we always knew that if we were outside marching band and that cold blast hit, it's time to go inside. <laughs> AK is really the most beautiful park. Yes, it is. It's very awesome. Very beautiful place, for sure. Underappreciated, too. Thank you. Underappreciated. I mean, I know a lot of people do like it, but yeah, I think it's just not doesn't get as much attention as the other parks because it doesn't have the the blockbuster stuff that some of the other parks do. And Flight of Passage is cool, for sure. Yeah, here's one right there. <laughs> yeah. All right, Rick. Yeah. Check back in later, no worries. And we'll see if we can get... I hear the thunder. We can get in here and see our hippo friend. Oh, wow, look. And you can see that, you can see her eyes came up. And uh, you can see the rain starting on the water there. They're not super concerned about the rain because they're in the water anyway. Yeah, Tanina, lots of hoppers watching. There, put her head back, put her head back down. It's a nice place for them to sit. And they do need to stay in the water a lot because it keeps their body cool. That's coming down now. I've been gone for a while. Just get my life together somewhat. No worries, um, Julie, for sure. Glad to see you. Good to hear Dad's laugh. Yep. <laughs> they have wiggled the ears. And here comes the rain, so we're going to have to get our umbrellas out if we go out of here. Oh, that's funny, Janine. Yeah, hit the like, everybody. Excuse me. Hippopotamus. <laughs> yeah, hit the like, everybody. Yeah, it looks like it's coming, so we may we'll, we'll find a spot or see how bad it is. Yep, no worries. Thanks. Oh, this is so. This is uh, if that's part of the safari trail there a little bit. Could be. All right, let's see. How bad it is. Not bad yet. Oh. Oh, that was weird. It looks okay. I think the trees are helping us a little yeah. bit here. A lot of this is underwater, which is nice. It can't rain. It's not 3 p.m. Right? Yeah. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Oh, there it is. It used to be a 3 p.m. rain all the time. Yep. I always said it was four when I worked at Punta Gorda. Oh yeah. Yeah, but it didn't matter. I, I knew it. Get on my motorcycle and go home. Yep. <laughs> Early. 
Got dark. Yeah, I did. Yep, and Mom and Jenna are Mom and Jenna are eating, so they got to go inside too, so that's good. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Oh, I don't think I don't think it'll be that long. We can go back and forth a little bit then. Yep. You can just see the rain and stuff. I left my raincoat in my locker. Okay. What kind of motor? They want to know what kind of motorcycle you had. Well, at that time, I had just a 175, but I've owned the, the Honda. You said Honda. My older brother worked at the Honda shop. Okay. In Champagne when I was in the college there. Right? Yeah. And he was going. So 350 and 175. 175, 350. Yeah. This is this is free. This was before all that. I mean, the Harleys were there, but we didn't get Harleys. No, no, no. Yeah. 350 Honda. Okay. Bought it for I think five hundred dollars, brand new. Yep. It was missing the front forks, and my brother put them on. Somebody took them off for parts at the, at the store. Drove it three thousand miles on a trip going out to Colorado, coming back, and they sold it for seven hundred. <laughs> wow. That that was way back. You sold it. Well, you fix it so, up so you can sell it for more. Then we, well, then we sprayed painted the, the struts or the, uh, the the forks up front, the forks. Uh, yeah. It's coming down. Yep, it is. It was a little bit. Uh, he had a 750, the first model that came out. That's the first one. First one, and uh, uh, he, it, it was more. It was four cylinders, so it's more smooth than what I had. Yeah, mine was a little better. <laughs> yeah, for this sure. Is a good here. <laughs> yeah. Let me see. Hey guys, so we're we're gonna hang out for a little bit. You have a Honda CBR 600 RR. Oh, those are the yeah the bigger touring bikes, I guess. Touring yeah. Bike. yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, pretty. I had a Yamaha. I have Yam 1973 Yamaha TX 650 fully restored. Honda, oh. Honda or a Harley Ultra Classic. Cool. Now we had a Triumph 650 one time too, Dan. Now we we lived on a farm so we could fix things and take it. You know, we did that. Yeah. Then we'd fix it and sell it. <laughs> yeah. Why not? Yeah. We built a. Oh big boy! Look. V8 on it and shop. You know, went to tractor pulling kind of Oh yeah. yeah. That way, yeah, you do. Well, here it comes, guys. Yep. When does school start back? Um, yeah, it starts. Uh, teachers have to be back not next week, but the week after, and then kids come back the week after that. So yeah, they what they said, guys. And this is a good uh, reminder for everybody. If you are um, here, there's a big metal bridge at the end of this, and they're not allowing anybody to pass on it because of the lightning. Um, so we had two choices: we can stay here, or the next one, which is gorillas. Or we can um, we can go all the way back to the beginning. So those are the choices we have. So, uh, we can stay here for now. Has uh, someone already posted the question for the 31st? Are we able to use Resort TV on logo on some socials and tag you in them? What? Uh, oh, Ryan. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, please use our logos. And actually, I can. Oh, here comes the zebras. The zebras. I can. Um, and I can actually uh, mail you the logo there. Uh, Ryan, I can mail you a better, like a nice version of the logo if you guys want. So just, not today of course, but tomorrow I can. Hey, here comes the zebras. Yeah, they don't seem bothered at all. Hey, Christopher Black, I was just telling uh, both you and old Mr. Young dude, thank you for the PayPals. I appreciate, appreciate all of you. A zebra. <laughs> All right, this one in the middle. Y'all see her floppy hair? Yes. She's a lot younger than the other. Her name's Aubra, and she's about four. And she's got that floppy hair because her head isn't strong enough to hold her head. So that's one way you can tell the young zebras. Oh. 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 Yeah. 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 Uh, Kelly Matza, 1999, just a little something to help you keep going all day. Get something to drink or a snack on thank you for all you do. 
I appreciate that, Kelly, for a drink and a snack. Appreciate that. You got something to keep going. I uh, appreciate that very, very much. We can enjoy looking at some zebras while we wait for the rain to uh, subside here. You did hear the thunder, so there is lightning, so they have us staying uh, undercover here. So. so that's good. So thank you so much, Kelly. Appreciate that. Hey, mansion lover. It's uh, raining like the rain for us. That's right. Yeah, the zebras are running around. Running around. They like it. That's what she, Casimir was saying. The zebras really like the rain. And the, the, the meerkats, they don't like it. So they're, they're underground in their holes in their burrows. So they don't like it. If you had to choose only one Disney park to visit for the rest of your life, which would you choose? Magic Kingdom, for sure. Even though I would miss um, Epcot and Disneyland and some of the others. And I'd miss this park, too. Yeah. Now they're just having, having uh, some lunch. No big deal. Just rain. I said we won't melt. There are three zebras out right now. I don't know how many they have on the whole park, but there are three out right now. She said the one in the middle is a uh, younger younger um, <clears throat> girl, I guess, and she uh, can't, her hair's floppy because she can't hold it up yet because her head's not strong enough. Hey, cool cat, how are you? You have tropical weather, that's right. Yeah, we're very, well, I have zoomed a little bit. I'll show you how close they really are, but it was still pretty darn close. Yeah, the rain cools them down exactly. They love it, they love it. It's a very nice cool breeze and just a nice summer rain. No big deal. Seeing the rain and animals is perfect. Isn't it great? It's peaceful, isn't it? Yep, Joey's World says, thanks for the super chats. From Kelly. I love the zebras, like the rain because it helps them stay cool. Exactly, I'm sure that's what it is. Well, at least we get to see some animals while we wait. And they're very beautiful. Log on to Resort TV. I want to see my favorite animals. It's going to be a good day. I love zebras in this channel. That's awesome, Bulldog. I like zebras and zebra fish. BDF. Yep. I, I don't know. Zebra fish, I'd have to look that up. I can't uh, bring an image of that to my mind, but um, I do like zebras. Uh, right now, it's only zebras because the uh, other animals are, are undercover. They don't like the rain, whereas the zebras do. All right. Here, let's go zoom out a little bit, and I will show you kind of where we are right now. If you were just joining us, you can see this. There's a nice little, we're actually under this uh, canopy here. We're under this canopy, and um, there's this nice little, you can see where the different uh, meerkats and all the different um, animals can go in the burrows, but then you've got the zebras over here just chilling. Hey, Tiki Man fan. Hey, Craig. Craig's Robotics was here earlier. Uh, what zebras are those? I know they have different species. Um, yeah, I don't know. I have to ask her. Dad's talking to her right now. I didn't want to interrupt. Oh, Jules went to the movies. Cool. Sound of Freedom. Yeah, I haven't heard. I've seen that. I have not seen that. Robert loves the drums. <laughs> awesome. I'm at the Secret Exploration Trail. I love it. Let me get some zoom on for you guys. I love that we can do a 3x zoom. Hey Matt, thanks for being here. Yeah, it's, it's raining very steady right now, but it's not really blowing. It's just kind of a nice, gentle summer rain. Isn't it kind of peaceful? The thunder, I don't know. It's not threatening really. I mean, yeah, you gotta be careful, but it's just kind of peaceful. Hey, happy swamp. I figured zebrafish had stripes too. I, I figured I just couldn't, I couldn't exactly see what they look like. So in my mind, I'll check the radar here real quick and see how much longer we are. Never been to Animal Kingdom, and how do you keep the phone dry? Well, right now we're under cover right now, so but usually I just use a um, umbrella. So it looks like here. Let me un, let me let me zoom out, or as we say, unzoom. There we go. So this is what the radar looks like right now. So we're in that little spot, and we'll just wait till it passes a little bit. That won't take long. It's moving pretty fast. That's 12:30. That's not even. So let me see what it says here. This is your weather report. 
Isn't that great? Yeah, they're they're beautiful animals, and they're just sitting there, just chilling. All right, so let's see. Uh, uh, yeah, it'll it'll be moved out here pretty soon. It won't take long. So, like, if you're just joining us, yep, we're in this nice little uh, covered area. It's kind of a round pavilion here, and we're just relaxing, as are the zebras. That radar app, I, I don't like it as much anymore, but uh, it's um, AccuWeather. My thing is, a lot of these a lot of these weather apps now they want a monthly fee. I get it, but man, I just I don't want to add another monthly fee. You know, we have enough we have enough streaming services, so AccuWeather definitely wants me to pay a monthly fee, and I'm like I would pay like one time to unlock it, but I'm not going to pay like every month. So all good. Watching the zebras. It's nice that the zebras came out to say hi. Accurate weather isn't even accurate, I figured. So I, I tried my radar, somebody recommended, but it was really glitchy. So, yeah, so many ads. I know, does anybody else have a good recommendation for a weather app? I used to have the weather channel, but it was really glitchy. Um, the AccuWeather at least has a more stable app, so I don't know. It's almost like they don't test these apps that much. I mean, I know probably the developers are overworked, I guess, or whatever, but it's like, you're like, did you guys like try this? Because it like keeps crashing. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I understand if they didn't have like, a, I figure they have a whole team of people developing this stuff. So I have my radar and it wasn't really working as well for me. But maybe, uh, maybe I'll try it again. Maybe they've updated it and it got better. Pinpoint weather, okay. Um, it looks like some kind of hay or something or grass. So people, we're doing a live stream. People in the chat are asking, what are they eating? Oh, that is hay. Okay. Um, they eat Timothy hay, oh, and you. those bags are repurposed feed bags. Okay. And there's a community of women in um, they're in Kenya uh, that work with a group called the Bread and Zebra Trust, yeah. and they make those bags. And they, you know, mail them around the world, and that's how they raise money uh, to support their community. So it helps zebra. That's cool. Yeah. Very cool. This is the most endangered of the zebra species. Oh wow. They're, uh, they live in the deserts in northern Kenya, and there's the people there can't find water, and if the people can't find water, the zebras can't find water. So it's okay. All yeah. That's really. I didn't realize. It so it's not even people hunting them; it's that they can't find water. That's the main threat facing this type of zebra. Wow. Yep. Well, that's definitely too bad. It's good that hopefully they have enough, you know, have some in, in different uh, places like this around the world right, that they right. can keep them keep and, them going. You know, raising money, helping them out, raising awareness. Yeah. I, bet, I don't know if you want to try to get my little handy zebra chart. Okay. Oh, right here. Yeah. Oh. All the different types of zebras. This is what? How do you say it? Gravy zebra. Gravy. Okay, and it says stripes across the body, solid white belly. And then this is a common zebra where the stripes connect across the belly. Okay, and then this is a mountain zebra, narrow stripes towards the neck and broader towards the back. And the snout is solid. And they have a little zipper down the middle. So these are. Grevy zebra. Grevy's, yep. They're, okay. So they're the ones, they have the most white on them because they do live in the desert. Oh, uh, okay. They need that uh, right. lighter color yeah. to keep them cool. Yeah. Now, do you have all three kinds here at Animal Kingdom or just we these? We have, Grevy's are here. The mountain zebras are on the safari. And if you go to Animal Kingdom Lodge, they have mountain and common over there. Okay. Okay. Very cool. Yeah, I, mean, I never even noticed, but I guess that's it's a big difference, you know, with the when the stripes go all the way yeah. around, you when can I see, see it. When I see people wearing zebra print clothing, yeah. I can pick out what kind of zebra it is. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty cool. Uh, see, now we know. Do you want to know where the, where the Timothy Bay comes from? Uh, uh, we grow it. Yeah. Oh, you grow it. Yeah. We're, we're learning yeah. stuff. This is edutainment yeah. at Disney. Yeah. Okay, okay. Um, so, so these are Grevy zebra. You never notice, like, if the stripes connect or not, but it is a big difference. She's just chowing down, man. Having a great time. I love it. Looks like it's it's almost done. They all, everybody's getting some food. I'm glad they get well taken care of here.
I think uh, somebody on the safari said that the mother zebras can tell and the babies can tell their mothers and the moms can and moms can tell babies and babies can tell moms from the stripes. Fox weather app is great. Okay, my radar. I'll just try, try my radar again and weather underground. Somebody said thanks, guys. Now, did I hear? I heard a safari driver say one time. I think that the. Uh, Mother zebras or the baby zebras can tell the mothers by the stripe pattern, yep. or how's that? Yep. Okay. And they usually know within a matter of minutes which one is their mother, okay. and they won't attempt to nurse from any other zebra. Wow. Okay. Okay. That's huh. def definitely important uh, to, uh, for survival. Yep. You don't want one mama feeding all the babies for sure. No. With, um, <laughs> like with gorillas over here, we will sometimes see. You know, they live with multiple females and young in the group, and they will if. They notice an infant is malnourished or needs help, they'll nurse each other's young. But okay. Do that. Okay, interesting. So the gorillas will, but the zebras won't. Okay. Yeah, they're a little uh, opportunistic would be a okay. for a zebra. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's why they blend in those big herds. They're looking out for them themselves. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the gorillas in some ways seem similar to more similar to humans, that they do seem to show concern for each other a little in bit a lot more. Of ways, yeah. 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 Oh, thanks. Yep. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you for all the facts. I appreciate it. You too. Oh, cool. Yeah, very nice. <laughs> yeah, well, y'all take care. It was nice meeting you. Thank if you, you. have any more questions, I'll be around. Excellent. Uh, let's see. WB Resort TV1. Hi there. Hello, WB. Yeah, I have to get like seven miles away or something. You're yeah, hardly far away. They'll call you. Yep. <laughs> no. So we have an option. We can go back where we came through in the front or if we want to pass the bridge. Or we can go this way. Your last stop, you'll be able to go to. Go back your way. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Okay. The rain's starting to let up, so yeah. It doesn't sound like it's overhead right now. I would go out with the lightning very Yeah, it sounds like it is. WB, hi there. How's it going? Welcome. Yeah, you too. The weather bug, yep. Yeah. We will. All we do. <laughs> we sure do. <laughs> Uh, I guess we can go down and see the gorillas real quick, and then maybe maybe if the rain hasn't stopped by then, we'll we'll go back and thank you. Thirty five hundred people watching, wasn't that fun? And the, hey, the phones. I'm I'm not complaining. The, we're staying cool. The phone's staying cool, and there's something about a summer rainstorm that's relaxing. Look, see, it's already light over there. I just uh, nature's way of re renewing itself. Oh, like I said, the cost company. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome. Okay. Well, there's people on the stream that are people on the stream want to send you a cast compliment. So her name is Cheryl. Yeah. So everybody sends Cheryl a compliment. She's awesome. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh, they're going backwards. That's fine. Yep. Her name is Cheryl. Hopefully, I showed her name tag a little bit. It's C H E R. Y L Cheryl on the Gorilla Falls Exploration She's been Trail. Working for 31 years. Here 31 years. Yeah, wow. She started to follow her mom around. And yeah, yeah, yeah. 31 years. She's good. Yep. Thanks, guys, for reminding me to get her name for you. I appreciate it. Oh, we got gorillas. Just we got a couple just hanging out here. They like staying inside too. Just sitting there. Just chilling. Mm -hmm. It's good. They're watching the rain. Yep. <laughs> Um, I didn't say I didn't hear where she was from, but yeah, I don't know. But um, originally, you mean? Or, yeah, I don't know. Uh, no, she didn't, she didn't say that. Okay, let's look down here at some of the other gorillas here hanging out in the in the family. Oh, they got the babies and everything. More animals to explore. Yeah, thirty-one years. Hey, Sean Rogers, how are you? Hey, Sean Rogers. I'm gonna get some popcorn today, Sean. Yeah. <laughs> and here comes a couple down there. Yeah, I'll have to say hi to them here in a second. <laughs> hey, Myers and the Mouse, how are you? Oh, here. Oh, he, I thought he was gonna get up and go. The weather. Yeah, let's see what they're doing over here. <laughs> yeah. I think that's the dad, maybe? I don't think it is. Is it? Is it? Is it? That's the dad, yeah. Yeah. He's 42. 42. 42. Wow. This one's four. Little baby. Little baby. Two. Okay. Two. Okay. okay, wow. We were here a couple weeks ago, and they were, they were all, the, the two littles were playing. Yeah. They were throwing each other over the bushes. It was the funniest thing. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> He's just like, sorry, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they were having fun. <laughs> He's watching him. His dad's watching him. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty. I don't have the zoom. It's pretty close to be be to a gorilla who's looking at you. <laughs> Cool out there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the baby is two years old. They said. Uh, area gorilla falls in is in the Africa area. Yeah. All right. We'll move on so somebody else can get a shot here. Yep. It's um. It's on the Gorilla Falls Trail. It's in in Africa. This is really cool. Well, that was neat. Oh, for sure. Let's go down there and see if they've opened it, and if not, we'll just okay. go back the other way. Yeah, we'll see. How, we'll see how far they. What's that? Yeah, she was standing here earlier. Oh, it, oh, it's closed. Yep. Yeah, okay. It's closed, so we will have to go back the other way. That's fine. All right. It, look, it looks like it's clean. It's it is. Well, that's pr this is pretty much the end of the trail, so we can right. just go back because this pretty much stopped raining. Yeah, so we'll go this way. Sorry. All right. Is that Grace? I think so. I don't remember the names. They said, so if you rewind back, you can see that the second to smallest one was four. The people with us were saying. Yes. And then the the, uh, the baby was two, two. And then they said the dad was 41 there. Yeah. Almost as old as me. 41. Almost as old as me, too. Yeah. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> We saw the baby just three days after she was born. Wow. Yeah, I, wonder how, I wonder how big they are when they're born. Maybe they can remember. I, I, don't, I don't know. That'd be cool to see. Yeah. How many pounds are they? What age does the gorilla become an adult? They live a similar age as humans, so I'd say they become an adult probably right around the... You know. Well, I don't know. That's a good question. Mm -hmm. Let me look it up. I mean, I don't know if they, they talk about like teenagers the same way that... you know that, Right. That we do? I'm not sure. So, anyway, but... Oh, we got our hippo here. We got backside of hippo. I was going to say, you got the other side of the hippo. Backside of water. She just laid back down. Kind of cloudy, but you can see it. Yeah. BDS says I'm 61. All right, cool. They're all babies according to my age, Teresa says. Uh, look at that. That is so cool. It's still raining. It's not pouring, but it's yeah. raining. Leaf says getting bad wind up in a pop guy. Yep. And I shot you up all right here we go wow it's like nobody in nobody in here you got the place to yourself second smallest is grace and the two-year-old is ada okay so the next park is going to be um we're going to send it back to jenna at some point and then i'm going to head to hollywood studios so yeah, Hollywood Studios is next, and then Jenna's going to head to Magic Kingdom. So we've already done Epcot and, and Animal Kingdom, and these are, we, we can't park up till two, of course. These are our first two parks, but we split up to make it fun. <laughs> Gotta get a cookie. Yep, and so Ebb and Jenna is at, um, Jenna is at uh, lunch with mom. Yep. So they, they just started eating just a few minutes ago. Dad and I are the same gorilla age, Dad, Rich Rimple says. <laughs> you guys are the same gorilla age? Okay. Hey, we didn't look at the snakes. Anybody want to see the snakes? Probably not. Oh, what's that Indian I hate snakes. It has to be snakes. Right, Sean says gross bats. I don't think there are bats on this trail, Sean. It's on the Asian trail. Oh, there's a frog. Look at that guy. Two of them. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, they're big. They blend in. Yeah, they do. You can't even see them. There's a snake right there. Reptile the alert. Kind of the... Mostly blue skies in Davenport. Cool. So that's not oh, too far okay. away. So that'll be that'll be close. Good. And I oh this is a turtle over here. 
You can kind of see it, maybe you can, right? What is it? Uh, the turtle, yep. He's over there, here, he's right there. This All is right. a vegan, is, it is that vegan, John? Uh, V-E, is that a V? A vegan man? something. San Bon, San? I don't know. Hard to see. Thanks, Corey. We're trying. We're trying here. There we go. Entomology. Entomology. New entomologists at Purdue. Yeah, a lot of good ones. You can really learn from these. Entomology. Yeah, thanks, Corey Ruprecht. I appreciate it. We're having fun. Yeah. Oh, there's Grace right there. They talk about some of the gorillas here. Look at that. Yeah, very cool. There's some of the animals in the reserve here. So that's a good uh, a good thing to learn here. You know, the rain's not too bad right now, no. but because there's still lightning, they can't open the bridge, which is fine for safety. Um, but, because you can still hear it rumbling. So what yeah. you do is um, you just come back around the front. We didn't really miss anything. We saw the gorillas. Yeah, yeah. So that's pretty good. You did. You saw the, the, the front side of gorilla. <laughs> yep, we did see the front side of gorilla. I believe that's the closest I've been to one that's turned around looking at you. Just staring at you, yeah. yeah. You can really see how big they are. You definitely wouldn't want to make him mad. You wouldn't last very long. <laughs> big was the one that, um, when we went around the backside there that year. Remember, and then he, he beat on his chest and he was going to come. He was start like looking at us, you know. Well, I think they were yelling at somebody because they were waving at him, and they said that the gorillas, oh. when you wait, one of the guests, another guest was waving at him, and they they said that they see that as a type of aggression. Yes, and they were. That's why they were doing that. Yeah. So. And I, was that one of the older, older, and the bigger? Yeah. So, um, be mindful of all that, yeah. that's right. And so that's the exit to safari, but we can still come out this way. Okay. So, do they keep going with the safari? I guess. With uh, stuff? I believe they still do the safari. Maybe. I believe. I don't know. That's a good question. Maybe yeah. not. You guys know it sounds like the trucks are still running, but with lightning and stuff, I wouldn't think it would be a great idea. So I don't know. Well, you know, they look like the trucks went out, didn't they? Yes. Yeah, so Jamie says must be. Must be humid. The clouds are sweating. Yes, the clouds are sweating. It looks like the monkeys went under cover. Oh no, they're still up there. Monkeys right, right way back there in the corner at the top. You can see their white fur. Passholder magnets. I didn't get any passholder magnets at Chester and Hester's. Can you do that? We can try. We can try. Danger Mouse Dean, another five pound super chat. How is everyone? We're doing great, Dean. How are you? Hopefully everybody in the chat's doing well also. Especially today. With it. It's just cooler. A little. It I is. The rain, and, but it was cooler to begin with. And you know what? We have not done a four-park stream in one stream since November of 2018. I was trying to find a thumbnail, but my thumbnail wasn't even... I didn't even have it saved because it was so long ago. 2018. We did a six-park stream the next year after that, but we never did the four-park since then. So 2018, unless somebody else can find one. All right. The train's probably not open yet, but yeah, well, we can probably. Uh, yeah. Probably not. Are well, we going to go up this way, maybe? Yep, I think we have to, because I think to the left is a safari truck exit. Uh, hey, Molly and Emily. WW is an excellent way to get away from stress. It's an escapade. You have to abide by the park rules, though. Yes, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Oh, for sure. And, and I think a lot of people, that's why they, they take time now to explain to people. Um, you know, yeah. on the safari, hey, we're in their homes, so you want to don't make noises, don't make, you know, don't be like, you know, all that stuff. Just, yep. just be quiet and just, you know, um, observe. <laughs> and, and, and the people have to realize it's, you know, about seeing all that. It's not about just you. It's about everybody else here, the animals and everybody involved right. that you can see it as a, as a community. Right. Exactly. Yeah, you have to. Sorry. You have to. Uh, Enjoy it as a. And it's, it is enjoyable. This one, I enjoy this park a lot. Yeah, it is. Because you see all the animals, and you know, it just, it's laid back more. You oh, know? for sure. Love that part. It looks like it's open now. Oh, wow. Oh, hey. Hi. Hi. We were hoping we could, my sister's watching right now. Okay. You want to say hi to her? Can we? Yeah, for sure. Hi. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hello. Hi, Carly. Carly Nelson. Oh, Carly. Yeah. Yeah, so that's my wife. Okay, so wait, so which Carly is watching right now? Yeah. Okay, I thought she I thought she said she was in the park. No, she probably said we're in 
in the you're park. in the park. I, I misread the comment. That's really cool, though. She's in the chat all the time. She's yeah, super nice. Yeah. She's and shares. Guys. She introduced us to you guys, so we've been watching you in preparation. Oh, here she is. She said, that's my family. <laughs> so, should we share a last name with us, too? So. Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> I say, hey, you all. Yeah. Hello. Woohoo. Yeah. Is Carly on there? Carly's right here. And then you're her sister. Yeah. yeah. Woohoo. Hi, Carly. <laughs> <laughs> that was. I, I thought Nelson. Carly Nelson. Okay, yes. Nelson. I love it. Yeah. Okay. Absolutely. Grand Rapids, Michigan. Michigan. Okay. okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, Jenny didn't live too far from us. I've been to Grand Rapids. Yeah. yeah when I worked at Purdue. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank <laughs> you. Right. Thank you. Oh, for sure. It's our pleasure. Carly. What was your name? Kelly. Kelly, okay. Yeah. And good to meet you all. Yeah, yeah. Thank yeah. You. Hey, yeah, for sure. Yeah, Bye. <laughs> I love it. Hey, all right. <laughs> all right. Okay. Maybe it's open. I think it is. I mean, yeah, I, yeah. it looks like it's moving. Oh, they're moving, yeah. Yep. Okay, so, guys, this is going to lag, um, like, Wait. definitely. So what I'm going to try and do is, if it lags, I will try and put on the uh, the BRB um, and see if we can keep you guys moving that way. If not, um, we don't go over here very often, so yeah. what you do, there's a lot of people watching right now, what you do if it lags is just rewind a little bit, and it will eventually come back. Rewind and come back, rewind and come back. Um, okay, so we got a $20 super chat from Rob. It says, thank you as always for a wonderful day at Disney. Can't wait to be there in November. Thanks, Rob. Thank you. Let me pull it up so I can see the better, better uh, look at the name here. All right. Um, oh yeah, Robert. Okay. Thank you as always. Can't wait to be there in November. Thank you. Yeah, pretty cool. Yeah. You can always like this back here too. You know, oh, for sure. Right? It's always always yeah. fun. Always fun. Let's see here. So I'll have the um, DRB ready just in case we do lag. Two. Thank you. All right. We'll see if we can make it on. If not, we'll wait till the next one. So guys, it probably will lag, but uh, we'll be we'll be going. We haven't done this uh, on the stream for a long time, and last time there it was uh, definitely very crowded. So we can go down this way if you want. I only need two seats, so it shouldn't be too big of a deal. Oh yeah, there's more up here, I believe. There's a lot of people going that way, but maybe we'll find two seats somewhere. Surely you gotta have a seat. Two seats, two seats. Yeah, it looks yeah, like we got seats here. Okay. Yep. Okay, perfect. All right, guys. Got room? Perfect. All right, so I got Animal Kingdom BRB ready just in case. So we're going to go down to uh, lower quality here for you guys. Cross your fingers. Hey, Timothy Rainwater. It's good to see you guys. Rainwater family. Dad says hi. Hello. Right, Kelly and Mama Mouse here. Great idea for yes, great idea for the stream today, Josh. Divide and conquer, much more leisurely and wonderful way to see all four parks. Thanks for the stream, yeah, Stream Finder. Thanks. We haven't, we've never done this before. Divide and conquer, but it, it is works more well. Leisurely with, for you guys and for everybody else to see how you get, you don't have to be run, run, run into park. And know? everybody gets a break. They need that. You need. Well, Jen is charging her phone right now, so it works out really nice. And our mine was 100. percent We just keep charging Greetings, our phones friends. off the stream. All right, here we go. Welcome aboard the Wildlife Express. For a safe journey, remember to stay seated, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the train. Sit all the way back against the bench, and please be sure to watch your children. Asante. Bienvenidos a bordo del Wildlife Express. Para que tengan un viaje seguro, manténganse sentados, con las manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del cuadrado. Siéntense en los pies, pegados a la cabeza. Y por favor, Welcome aboard the Wildlife 
Express would surface to repeat this planet by. Here, you'll discover a wide range of animal adventures from the affection section where you can get up close and personal with domesticated animals like goats, sheep, and more to sneak peeks at animal care and action at our veterinary, nutrition, and science centers. Also, be sure to check out the animation experience at Conservation Station where you can learn to draw your favorite Disney characters inspired by live animals for one of our animators. The tradition of animals and animation reaches all the way back to Walt Disney himself and his long-standing passion for conservation. He believed it was important that we protect our wildlife and preserve the natural world. The lion, the Kobe's tool. These are the buildings this that they're housed in. This is shaped his legacy from animation to conservation to the very adventures we offer here at Disney's Animal Kingdom each and every day. As we make our way to Rafiki's Planet Watch, keep an eye out for some of the exciting wildlife we might encounter along the way and the highly trained specialists who care for them. From ostriches and rhinos to the mighty African elephant, the species we care for here at Disney's Animal Kingdom are some of the very same animals that inspired animated classics like the Lion King, the Jungle Book, and more. Did you know Bambi was the first animated feature to bring live animals into the studio? In the 1940s, Walt Disney and his animators modeled characters from the film after the movements and natural behaviors of their real-life counterparts. Even with the latest advances in computer animation, this tradition continues today as anime... We are now approaching Conservation Station at Rafiki's Planet Watch. For your safety and the safety of those around you, Please sit all the way back against the bench and avoid leaning out toward the railing. Remain seated until the train comes to a complete stop and please be sure to watch your children as you exit. Go well and explore. Well, that worked way better than I thought. Just one little blip there. I restarted and it was That's fine. Great. That was quick. Good, good. It's neat to see behind the scenes. It really is. Know. It is very cool. All right, guys. Now we can go back here. I know that it works really good. It's just like literally one little blip for like a couple seconds. Excellent. Yeah, thanks. Wasn't that cool to see? It was like two second blip and that was it. All right, here we go. Sometimes the guys it lags a little bit back here in the forest, but uh, maybe it won't. We'll see. We don't know. We're 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 forging a trail here. So this is what the train looks like, by the way, Eastern Star Railway. I don't know, uh, Kelly and Ivone, if you guys have tried this one or not. You might have already known it worked. I, I haven't tried it on AT and T, so AT and T seems to be playing a lot nicer than T-Mobile does back here. Yeah, that was AT&T here, so pretty good. And it's back now. Okay, we're gonna have to be potato here because there's hardly any signal right here. That's all right, it's working, so. <laughs> How is that? It's holding on with two bars. <laughs> wow. It, we have to struggle through here. Well, it's working pretty good now, even in the rain, so we have to potato through here. Nice. Once you get in Disney Wi-Fi. Okay, thanks, Kelly. <laughs> oh. Rafiki, he says, go this way. Liam loves this place back here. Oh, he does. I remember the last time you were here, it was so hot that day. It was sunny, and you were out petting the animals. You know? Oh, yeah, for he sure. That, that yeah. was fun. Streamfinder says, that's the first time I ever saw the top of the train. Isn't it? It's really oh. good theming. It's like, you're, it's like you're going on this long expedition. That's <laughs> the whole, whole point behind it. With the galvanized roof. Yes. Oh, we did a little thing. We did with Liam, yes. So there's all these little animals to look at, and the kids love these when you go find all the animals in here. It's super fun. They love this. Liam loved this when he did it a couple months ago. Maybe the clouds are helping carry the signal. Could be. 
I do have some settings set, so we'll see. I set some settings. Yeah. No, that was really cool back over there. Yeah, I think you were looking for like beneficial insects. Yeah. And ladybugs. And big shout out again to Ken because he's got the app tweaked where I can pull the bit rate down low and it will continue to go even when the signal's really low. I'm gonna rhyme like eight times when I say that. Low when it goes. <laughs> okay, now we should be coming back up. Better signal here. Really, really nice little walk here. It is, especially when it's cool. When it's cool, it's hot. <laughs> this can be kind of miserable back here when it's hot. There's no breeze. Yeah, trees and everything. Are... Yeah, a lot of people are saying they haven't done this before. It's a really neat little place. Thanks, Myers in the house. <laughs> what is it? It's a nice poem, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's turn the, wow, we're, we're full power in here now, Kelly. Okay, full power. I asked uh, Mama Mouse when she met the other day for, to give Mama a birthday present, what if, um, this is kind of cool, like just a random like fence back here, if um, they've got their phone fixed, and she goes, I don't know, Kelly does that. <laughs> She's like, I don't know, he does that. I said, okay. <laughs> This is kind of cool. Oh, so that's the road that goes out to Western Way out there. Yeah, that's what she was saying. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it goes to Western Way. Yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah. Well, see, your, your sister-in-law worked back here. That's right. Yeah. So, um... Look, at they got white fence back there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, also, uh, well, a little birdhouse back there. Yeah. You're so close to Western Way in case you ever want to sneak out the back. Yeah, <laughs> definitely do not want to do that. No. I want to follow the rules. See, the other thing they have here is these sketch. You yes. can do sketches, you know, time back there. That, yes, uh, you can. Not a class, but an activity. That's right. This used to just be um, ex exhibits about the environment and things like that, but now it's the sketch class too. So, all right, now we're, if we come out of the woods here, yeah. say we're. Not... I wonder if the animals are up because of the rain too, so. Well, they got places for them to get underneath. Yeah. That's awesome, rainwater. So I'm glad you guys like it. So you can see kind of the woods we just came out of. Cool. <laughs> Excuse me. Such a fan. This is fun seeing areas we usually skip because of time. Yeah. yeah. Well, and usually this closes before we get to get um, in here. So yeah, we're gonna try it in here, and if we have to switch uh, Wi-Fi, we'll do it. But it should be fine. But where is everyone? I know, Rich. Right? I was like, you feel like you shouldn't be here, but <laughs> yeah. so there is a restroom in here. Uh, but this is so cool in here with the animals everywhere. So the restroom back there. Uh, and uh, yeah, look at that, huh? So cool. They're everywhere. Yeah, the sound studios did used to be here. I'm really I'm sad that they're not here anymore. The reinforced sound. We do need to do sketch class vlog for sure. Is that flip? <laughs> probably one of them. <laughs> All right. Well, this is probably nothing going on right here because sketch class. That's right. So here is the animation experience here at Conservation Station, and if you wondered where the uh, the booths were. The rainforest booths were around here somewhere, but you can go. There's room for you to walk around here. Mm -hmm. Oh, and they've got all kinds of different experiences here. Oh, so Ann, Anna Ramirez Gonzalez is a visual development artist at Pixar. So okay, it looks cool. like Eeyore, and then they show different stages. Oh, they show different stages of drawing. Hey, hey. It's cool how they really work to get the, uh, really work to get the lines right. So this is the animation experiences where you go in and do your standby line, and back there is where those booths were that oh, you go and listen to you, the rainforest you and go stuff. In and, uh, you shut the door because there was soundproof. Like it that. was, yeah. That was pretty cool. This is kind of neat over here. Just very, it's a neat area. You've got an atrium up here, and or, it's a neat uh, place glass to ceiling. Off if you get it is. Yeah, people do miss this spot. I agree. And yes, it is a nice place to cool off. Okay. Cameras, um, gosh, on animals in the back in there. They used to have cameras on animals that were in different areas in the. I believe so. I let's see. Here, let's go back this way. There's a. There's a. Uh, there's a, the veterinary uh, offices are back here where they they uh, take care of a lot of animals that need either just for checkups or they need any kind of medical treatment. I am so excited. We can bring this to you without any like very very little lag, just tiny little bits of lag. Oh, it's, she. Okay, this is the food center back here where they, they talk about what they feed the different animals. So. That's cool, we'll come back and find all the people. That's cool. And we'll see, I don't know if they have the, the outdoor place 
yeah. might not be open yet, but we'll have to look in a minute if the outdoor side is open or it may be closed still. So we've got, it will start at the other end and come back down this way, I guess. This looks like it's less crowded down here. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah, they all start right there. Yeah. yeah we'll go down here. So you have this uh, uh, operating room. <sighs> That's cool. Logo. Yeah. Alright, so I'm not going to do the animation class today just because I think it'd be kind of hard, but um, definitely uh, we will do that sometime on the vlog maybe. Uh, Mickey's got his uh, mask on because he's uh, operating on the animals there. <laughs> it's really cool. He's got all the lights and everything. This is where they... Oh, yeah, definitely an MRI. Or some type of a thing. Yeah, Michelle, no, th th I think a lot of people don't know this kind of stuff is here. It's a really, they really are... If you watch the Animal Kingdom uh, series on Disney+, Plus, there's a very passionate... Uh, yeah, the, the magic of Disney's Animal Kingdom, there's a very passionate... Um, idea about you know taking care of the animals here and it's all about that and it's not just about you know putting them out for people to see it's all about education awareness and really being good stewards of the animals so, so that's cool to see for sure take good care of them all right oh cool yeah that's right i remember that match the feces with the species <laughs> ct scan okay yeah what is it Somebody says CT scan. Oh, CT scan. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shoshana, hello, thank you. Yeah, so this is very, very cool here. They really work on this. I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as we are. And you can see now, animation experience is not happening right now. There is a line, but it didn't look like it was moving very much right now. But we'll have to do it sometime. Do they let park guests watch the surgeries? I think they do. I do think they do. Uh, Dawn. Uh, so Dawn W sent twenty dollar PayPal. Thank you, Josh and Dad, for uh, showing my favorite part. Thank you so much, <laughs> Dawn, for that twenty dollar PayPal. I appreciate it very much. That's very kind. All right. I don't think they're they're coming over the radio to tell everybody what's going on. I didn't hear what they said. They had skin to up here about what they were doing. Procedures? Yeah, I think they do let you watch if you're in here at the right time. Yes, you can see some procedures. I've never seen any, but I'm not here that often. So, yeah, I think you just have to be here at the right time. Is it still raining? No, not really. It's just, it was just sprinkling a minute ago. Yep, super fun. Got the frog in here somewhere. He's hiding real good. You can watch the actual surgery. I've seen a couple. Wow. Well, that's amazing. They've got some top notch doctors and surgeons that come and work on these, and there's some that are on staff, and I believe they bring in help if they need it, you know, from outside veterinarians and things. Or even sm or small, yeah. Or small, yeah, yeah. Either way. Or oh. but, but, uh, there he is back there on the wall. Look <laughs> at him. But what were you going to say? Oh, yeah, wow. Our. Um, just kind of different species that are, are uh, peculiar to that area. Of course, the horse would be one thing that doesn't matter. Right. No, they have different ones for different... Uh, yeah. Special. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Here's a, a skink. Okay. Hmm. I love this section of the park. It's very interesting and educational. It sure is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah they have the different specialties for each one. That yeah, snake was under the rock over there. Couldn't couldn't see it, but uh, Egyptian turtle or tortoise. There's, there's a crocodile skull. Oh hi. Oh, you're, you guys are very you're fine. Well, oh, yeah. I lost my pin on the train, and I saw you guys were on the train, oh. and I was like holding up the entire front row. Uh, oh so no. I wanna, but the pin is important, right? Of course. Yes, 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 yeah. Right. Did you find it? Yeah. Oh, good for you. Okay, good. <laughs> and, and Jane would like, yeah, they would go after that pin. You were, oh, for uh, sure. Yeah. Well, thanks for everything. Nice yeah, oh, you're very welcome. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's been okay with the rain so this far. <laughs> nice to meet you. Okay, so we got some spiders over here. Yep. Giant bugs. <laughs> Let's see if we can see some giant bugs over here. If you don't like bugs, you might want to look away for a minute. Boy, look at that. I mean, that's not a real one, but it's just a, you know, it's a model, but still pretty, yeah. But 
wow. imagine coming face to face with one of those. Yeah. <laughs> or even something like that. It's a good reminder with all the equipment, personnel, machine, medicines, and food, just how big an investment Disney has in all the animals in this park. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah, Streamfinder yeah, yeah. for oh, sure. Yes. Yeah, I think it's easy to criticize Disney about a lot of things, but they really oh, yeah. do care about these animals and they show it. And you can see it back here more than anywhere else. And, and not only here, but worldwide, because then you do those projects with the, like the farmers and the bees. Like know? she was talking about the farmers in Africa, oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, they do a lot. Yeah, so it is. They, they definitely, when they. I know, you know, Joe Rudy's talked about this too. When they said we're going to do a park about animals, we're going to go in 100%. We're not yep. just going to be like a zoo, you know. Right. Nothing wrong with zoos, but you know, they, they want to be they want to be more than that. I so. remember the first day, or the first time we opened, Michael Eisner rode with his family. It was on ABC. Oh yeah. And did you remember that? He had his family and everything, and they they rode through the safari, and it was just amazing. Oh, I bet. Oh, always. I died right. I killed it. Hold on, guys. Hello. <laughs> Yes, no. Michael Eisner was, was great. I was enjoyed. I was enjoyed seeing him and his family on there. There was one where he. I remember there was one one of those commercials where he he kept trying to shoot the basketball uh, in, the, in the hoop and he didn't make it or something and they had to keep reshooting it. Yeah. That would have been me. It's a snake curled up on the log there. Interesting to see them do surgery on a fish. Wow. Hello. Hello. This is the Lagoon Animal Nutrition Center. Very cool. Yeah. Let me know if you have any questions. Okay. We were watching the zebras eat in the rain a little earlier out now on the gorilla Seriously, trail. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, that brought back memory. My dad just showed a tooth. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. That looks pretty good. Yeah. It, it does, and she told us about the right. feeding bags. Very cool. Very cool. Very. It's different for all of our animals. Some of them like to have it all in one space. Right. And then other times we do like to eat separated, divvy it out a little bit, make sure that there are uh, opportune they're, positions for it all to be given. Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah, well, we, exactly. We had, a, we had a dog and a cat for a while. Sadly, both have passed, but they were, they were, um, we had to keep the cat upstairs, and then there was a little baby gate even before we had kids, and we had to keep them separated so that the dog wouldn't eat the cat food. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And so she, she would get mad. <laughs> we have a lot of that same concept here. Yeah. All of the food that we offer on the safari, if it's there, any of the animals can eat it. Okay. Oh, okay. Any of the animals that are like on that, In that area, area yeah, yeah. can have it. So it's a lot of hay and a lot of the browse. Right. Their actual like, produce that we lay out. Oh, oh she's already talking. Uh, <laughs> uh, just when we get to the like the pellets and the produce that we weigh out specifically oh, for okay. animals, yeah, those are given in their overnight bars. Oh, so okay. then nobody else can so get in there. Else can get in Got there. it. That's, That's right. smart. I love it. Thank you. I see what you know what the skulls were. Interesting story. I yes, know. go ahead. You know, some of the feed stuffs that go in the pellets. Yes. You had one, and we had one in the community in the county. It's called the. It was alfalfa pellets, and you had the, the shake farms. Yeah. Actually, raise alfalfa and then put it into pellet, you know, pelletize it, grind it, put it in pelletize, you know, pelletize it. Yeah. And it, it doesn't operate anymore, but that reminds me of some of that with pellets. You know. Oh, for sure. That's really cool. Starting up again. All right. Okay. Yep. Let's go in and let's go in and see some, see some animals. <laughs> Just make sure to only pet animals from the neck down and keep their food on the ground. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, so here we are. So guys, let's check it out. Yes, I had a cat. Um, we had to had to put her to sleep in in uh, what 2018, I believe. How was that? She was 17. Wow. And we just got she got to the point where she couldn't get up anymore. She couldn't even stand up. So we finally decided that was enough. And then uh, Porty, of course, passed away just in November. So. Yep. But there you go. And see, when they're back there like that, of course, you know, you don't go back and bother them. If they come up here, then you can pet them, but you let them. It's nice that they, they give them a choice. So some of these, 
um, animals, you know, they all have a place they can go get away if they're feeling overwhelmed, which is nice. And they, I was talking to a cast member, they try them out around people and see how they are around the cast members first. Right. And if they have, you know, one that's just not receptive to people, then they'll they'll find another better location, whether yeah. it be on the safari or wherever, where they're not gotcha. not petted. So yeah. <laughs> yep. Very sad, but that's okay. We, it's part of a uh, part of life. You know, when you lose it, you lose the pets and things, it happens. So. There you go. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I'm, I can't tell that. Right down there is a Timothy head. It's like a. Oh, yeah. It's a real fine kind of seed. This is the. You know Timothy. If you okay. Saw it, yeah. It smells good. Yeah. I always like. Hay time when we used to do that, but except when it's hot. <laughs> yes. Yeah, we're cat sitting right now too, Kaylee. Um, <clears throat> so we have a litter box back in the house. <laughs> uh, our cat was actually really good. She was a big cat, not overweight, just big, just tall and long. Um, but she was um, she would not jump up on things. Other than she'd jump up on the couch to snuggle like any other cat will. Right. And on the chair, she'd jump on my computer chair and stuff. But she'd never go any higher than a chair or a couch. Yeah. Uh, and this cat goes all the way to the top of the fridge and higher. The cat that we're watching. Oh my goodness. So it's fine. I mean, you know, we we, we work with them. We yeah. let them know, no, you can't be on the table. That's not, you know, that's not sanitary. <laughs> but he, he's pretty good. He's he's kind of figured out that he can't be on the tables and stuff in our house. And maybe he was allowed to do that at home. But yeah. Yeah, yeah. but he's 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 getting better. Oh my goodness. Oh, we got a little uh, pig over here. Uh, her, uh, her name was Taz. Our cat. Got some spotted, spotted pulling china. It used to be like that. That yeah. was not. We didn't give her that name. Or the, her previous owners did. We we oh. we took her from a friend who couldn't care for her anymore when she was one. So right. we had her for 16 years. Oh yeah. But yeah. There we go. A little, little pig there. What kind of what kind of pig is that? Well, it's got it, the old breed was a spotted pulling china. Now it could be a mixture. Now I don't know. Yep. You know, they, they crossbreed a lot of the animals. You know. it's, got yep. some, it's got some, probably some York in it too, because you see by the ears that stick out. Like that. You know, Yorkshires are white, and the ears stick out, you know, stick up straight. Your I see. Dad, and your grandpa, <clears throat> they, were, one? they yep. were red. And by the way, they served Duroc pork chops at the Beast Cafe. Oh yeah, that's right. And yeah, we did that the other day. <laughs> yeah. So I told my brother that, and they got a real kick out of that. Yeah. <laughs> Rainwater said, we raised goats, and one year the nanny started birthing by the years, and we had about 100 goats. What? Wow. Oh, my goodness. That's crazy. No and they're kidding. got one coming out to say hi to everybody. Aww. Hello. What, what kind of goats? Uh, they are social. Think? Yeah, tell us what kind of goats. Yeah. Oh, bye, Rich Rim Rimple. Bye. Hey, Rich. Yep. So here, let's go over here real quick. They made uh, goat cheese or anything like that? Or they, no. yeah, I don't know. <clears throat> so did you did you sell some and, and give them new homes, or what did you what did you do with them? You had so that many. Yeah, wow. Cat Whisperer says shelves, walkways up high on the walls are ideal. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Well, and, and he oh, he's only going to be with us for a couple more weeks. So, <clears throat> you know, he likes to snuggle. So we just try and snuggle with him. Or I just I just pick him up and put him down. And, and you know, we just get him distracted, basically. We don't we don't get too upset with him because he, he that's how he's he's been trained. So we're like, nope, nope. <laughs> Come down here. <laughs> Like uh, donkeys over here, right? Yeah. yeah. Isn't that donkey? Uh, uh, what is this? That one, I'm, I'm not too sure. They donkey. Or the little pony? Or, oh, yeah. It's a donkey or a burrow. A burrow. Yeah, okay, maybe a burrow. Oh. Grandpa had horse. We had horse ponies, but I didn't really have any. That's donkeys. Pua. Yeah, that's, that is Pua. That's true. The pig looks like Pua. Uh -huh. No particular breed. Yes, we sold quite a few for sure. Yeah, I okay. bet. Okay, okay. So, yep, so, and a lot of times they will run around through here, but they know if they come up here, then people can't, you know, get in there to bother them if they want to be left alone. Especially when they eat. Most animals like to be left alone when they're eating, but you see one is out running around between all the areas there. Around this way. Oh, there. Well, mm -hmm. Here comes one. Sheep. Sheep, yep. Um, Definitely a donkey, somebody said, yeah. Donkey. I mean, I, I obviously can tell a sheep from a, you know, from a goat, but it's, you know. No, uh, they used to not have uh, the, the little goat projects at the fairs, and of course now they do all over. They, oh, really? They started them before I left there, actually. Why did they not have them? I, I don't know. You know, I guess it wasn't a thing for 4 at the time, then way back. Because, you know. I mean, a lot of farms have goats, you know, Yeah, they, well, and, and again, it might have been the top sign of the time, yeah. yeah. 
the pig there was used as the inspiration to create Pua. Oh, I didn't know that pig was the inspiration to create Pua in Moana, I believe. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Safe zones are good for everyone. Yeah, for sure. No, it is because, you, you know, you, everybody needs a break sometimes. So that's pretty cool. Well, Jenna says she's almost ready. All so right. here, oh, here's yeah. another pig. Yep. Well, let me uh, here. Let me tell her. Um, finishing up at Rafiki's Planet Watch, and I will send it to you after we are finished. Period. Just a couple more minutes. There's a Timothy seahead right down there. See that one? Oh yeah. Curled like they, they. You can tell. They, Grandpa, your alfalfa Timothy mixture actually. Nice. And fed to the dairy cows that we had in the bean form. And, and Timothy's used a lot of time just for horses and, go and goats. <laughs> That's awesome. And zebras. They, yes, sir, yeah. they seem to like it. <laughs> yeah. Timothy is pretty nutritious. So yeah. yeah. And the alfalfa then has a higher protein into the lagoon, so it gives it some of the more protein than if you had making a mixture. If you didn't know, Dad grew up on a farm and then was a county extension agent, so worked with farm mostly, mostly crops, but some animals. Yeah, yeah. And your your grandpa, my dad, was he loved his animals, loved animals. He, he raised all different kinds. <laughs> Hello, Mr. or Mrs. Sheep. <laughs> Except sheep. Right? Yep. <laughs> no sheep. Nope. But my, sheep are a whole different thing, though. You got to shear them and all that stuff. It's a whole different my project. My grandfather, my, 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 not your dad's, but my grandfather, had got a sheep. All right, well, we'll probably head on because it's almost park hopping time. But this was a good way to end here at Animal Kingdom, I think. We had a lot of fun here. <laughs> oh, they're, they're playing. It, it, they're playing with each other a little bit there. <laughs> Yeah. They're playing. They look pretty content. This is the one they said was the inspiration for Pua, oh, I guess. Okay. Okay. I can see the resemblance yeah. for sure. You're famous, buddy. Mm -hmm. Yep, we're going to move on here in just a minute. How many times did Dad get called Hank Kimball? <laughs> <laughs> uh, once in a while, yeah. Yep, Hank Kimball. Yeah, you, you talked about that before. Well, and actually the character, I think, for that, the Acres, uh, I'm not so sure if he wasn't... From the area, you know, there. You oh, know, the, you mean the person it was based on? Yeah. Was from Indiana somewhere yeah, there? Yeah, yeah, the old county agent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Always got the kick out of the question. Well, how do you plant chickens? How do you what? How do you plant chickens? <laughs> how do you plant chickens? Yeah. That's all questions like, where are we at? Uh, I think you just push, maybe? Pull. Pull I was wrong. But, <laughs> but you know, it's like, yeah. We didn't, oh, we didn't touch any, so we're good. Yeah. It's one of those things where, yeah, you know, they're trying to make it fake, you know, fun of the, you know, kind of agent kind of thing, you know. Kind yes. Of thing. So, yeah, they do ask you to wash your hands if you didn't, if you did touch any, but we didn't, we didn't pet any animals, so we're good. Uh -huh. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, my goodness, does it say I have a name on it? Uh, I wonder if that's a Komodo dragon. Yeah, look at that thing. It is, it looks like it. We oh. just pet Pua when it was March. That's awesome. We better head on All so right. Jenna can take it back here in a second. Um, now, let's see, do you guys want to ride the, you guys want to, yeah, we can go out this way. Do you guys want to ride the train back with us or um, people on the stream or do you want to go over to Epcot with Jenna? It's up to you. Yep, we're good. You can hear the woo-woo. That's Metallica <laughs> live, that's funny. Uh, oh, Jenna says we only need 54 more subscribers till 179K. Woo! Guys, subscribe if you're new. We got 3,600 people in the chat. All right. Hey, I need to subscribe, Jen. I'm yeah. <laughs> so they're going to take it for a while then, and that's fine because we've done quite a bit here. This has been fun. I like this. Part. You guys want to do the train. Okay. All right. Let's do the train. I saw we went to that little office back there. Go around the back there. And then go uh -huh, and okay. They did a back behind the You did a behind the scenes tour. Yeah, Look at, with, with our... Yes. Uh, Pollination Garden. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, it said train. All right. We're going to ride the train. Okay. They want to hear the train. I love that idea. Well, that won't take long. And then we can send it to Jenna, and we'll see you guys over at Hollywood Studios. You're going to go home and feed the dogs and stuff, but yeah, we'll, we'll see it. We'll see you at Magic yeah, then. Yeah, yeah. So I'm heading to Hollywood after this. Jenna and Mom are going to hang out at Epcot for a little while before they head to Magic. Yeah, correction, you're going to get a cookie before you go over there. <laughs> yes, that's, and that's fine. I'm in a Coke. What, you guys are just tons of people here today. Be sure to hit the like for us, please, and subscribe. Let's get to 179K. What a great day. Well, I think they like this uh, format kind of thing. Yeah. It is what's well, fun because there's not as much... 
like park hopping is fun and we probably will do another stream where we yeah. stay together on it but you actually get the benefit of the park hopping without the logistics between them exactly it goes quicker yeah liam explained that to us yesterday he did didn't he? <laughs> he did actually he did he, did. he said well the resort hoppers will like it because they don't have to wait as long <laughs> He's he so smart. I yeah, I'm going to turn this down just a little bit so we don't get any lag or less lag than we would normally get. Okay. I think you guys are getting ready to go when you're talking about what time and all. And he, he was all he talking about it. it. Yes, he did. He did. <laughs> Teresa said, 499, thank you for showing us part of Animal Kingdom because not many streamers show this. Yeah, for yeah. sure, Teresa. Well, and I say, well, we're guilty on that too. We don't come here as much, but definitely when we have a whole day, we have some time. Yeah. So. Appreciate it, guys. Is, is that because of the lag back coming back this way, or is it just because of time? That's the Both. Yeah. A lot of people know there's lag back here. Yeah. And uh, yeah. Well, that worked. You had it was good, wasn't it? Oh, for sure. And says thank you, Dad, for your knowledge. I love listening to you talk about animals. Such yeah. a fun stream. Thanks, Josh and Jenna. Oh, oh for sure. Thank you. My knowledge of animals is nothing compared to what my dad was, because Dad raised. I had everything hogs dairy cattle beef cattle yeah you know not sheep but and horses pony we had a pony grandpa grandpa got us a shetland pony and a cart and we i guess we were very fortunate back then but on the farm you could do that you yes know? well you had uh yeah hello how are you i'm good uh, yeah yeah not as hot, <laughs> not as hot yeah um yep grandpa if he was here he would definitely tell you all about it for sure well he loved his animals yeah, yeah. Your grandpa was um, got to be not only an FFA state farmer, he was a national finalist farmer too. That's right. Gosh, yeah, yeah, I, I've got the picture. Yeah. Oh, thanks, Jay Booker. Yeah, it's it's um, he always used to he had his little you know jokes that he would say. He always used because they were they were 100 percent Swedish, once, and so were you. <laughs> yeah. And they said, um, oh look, here it comes, perfect timing. They said uh, he'd always say, you can tell a Swede, but you can't tell him much. <laughs> grandpa would always say that you can tell a Swede, but you can't tell him much. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so funny. I remember that, yeah. The gates in the center of the station will be opening, so please make sure you move to the far left or far right hand side of those white lines on the All right, guys. So we... Oh, we didn't have any light going through there that time. That's cool. Didn't at all, right? Dad should write down his memories of being an extension agent, his memories of his dad as well, all that knowledge. Yeah, it would be great to have that written down. You know, there's a book written by a county agent, a good friend of ours, the Bill Ox Davis. Oh. By Jerry Nelson. He's a county agent um, in was, was it Wisconsin. He wrote about dairy style in North Dakota. Oh, wow. I got it. It's in my, it's on my dresser. Yeah, you have yeah. to check that out. I will. He wrote the book. He wrote a book. <laughs> oh. Sorry, guys. A little bit of lag there. I said no lag and then it lagged. I love this old look at you. Hold on guys, we gotta switch. Ah, uh, did we do it? Or do we gotta switch signals here? It's just it's like a, it has to switch tower somehow. They're calling the train for you guys. Yeah, I should be there any minute. Thanks, Stream Finder. Sorry about the little glitches here. I'm gonna I'm gonna pause real quick just to let the stream reset. So I'll be right back. This is intentional lag. And we're back. Welcome back, everybody. You like my little BRB? I figured I'll just put it on for you because I had it ready. At Animal Kingdom BRB. That music was um, the Oasis. But I don't know what this music is here. It's really nice. Yep, thanks, everybody. Sometimes it helps on this phone to just reset it a little bit. We'll have potato mode for a minute, but then we'll be back in just a second. All 
right, so it looks like we're going this way. They got plenty of room on here. Well, after this, we're going to send it to Jenna. Yep, we're good. Let's scoot down so other people can go. All right, there we go. We're good. Thanks, guys. You love the BRB. Awesome. They're good. I got more room here. Plenty. Yep, I'm all good. All right, guys, we'll be back here, or we'll be back to full quality here in just a second. But let's, uh, once we get back here, we'll, and this, it did, I can't talk. It's a loop. It does take a different way back. It doesn't join up with the other track. It actually does take a different way back. And we'll send it to Jenna Depcock. It takes you by that little place where we ate lunch one time, you know, around that area. You remember that? In the back there? Yes, yeah. it does. A little I can't food. the name of that little area. It's a little food court. Food court, yeah. I saw Metallica Life said something about Metallica and Marching Band. That looked interesting, whatever it was you were talking about there. All aboard. Well, I'm glad you guys enjoyed this. Yeah, it was definitely worth a little lag to get back here. And especially when it was a little cooler, too, I think, for us, for everybody. It was real cool. Yeah. Didn't they feel cooler? Did you guys feel cooler? <laughs> I bet you did. It was, it was nice. Greetings, friends. Here we go. And welcome aboard the Wildlife Express. We hope you enjoyed your visit to Rafiki's Planet Watch. We are now beginning our return trip to the African town of Harambe. For your safety, please remain seated and keep your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the train. Sit all the way back against the bench. And please, be sure to watch your children. Bienvenidos. Comenzamos ahora nuestro viaje de regreso a la aldea africana de Arama. Para su seguridad, permanezcan sentados con las manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro del tren. Siéntense hasta atrás, pegados al respaldo de la banca. Y por favor, miren a los niños. Gracias. Welcome aboard the Wildlife Express with service from Rafiki's Planet Watch to the village of Harambe. As you head back out into Disney's Animal Kingdom, we hope you take with you a great appreciation for the very journey that led us here. You see, it was Walt Disney's passion for animals and conservation that led him to send film crews across the globe to capture dramatic footage of wildlife in remote locations. Walt Disney's True Life Adventure series touched the hearts of millions of viewers, inspiring a spirit of conservation and paving the road for the nature documentaries we see today. That same power eventually inspired the creation of Disney Nature, the latest continuation of this wildlife storytelling tradition. With the release of powerful films like African Cats, Born in China, and Penguins, Disney Nature creates a unique opportunity to connect with wildlife on an emotional level, inspiring us to preserve nature with care and understanding. And, you know, each film provides an opportunity for filmgoers to become conservationists just by seeing the films. A portion of the first week's ticket sales for each Disney Nature release is directed through the Disney conservators with nonprofit organizations around the globe. legacy of animal storytelling that inspired the idea of Disney's Animal Show. Celebrates our deep. My friends, this is just a reminder that you must remain seated. Please stop for the children. And protecting our natural world. As you venture out into the park or make your way back to wherever you call home, remember that legacy lives in you. All the way back against the bench and avoid 
Alright guys, here we are. That was easy and it looks like it worked pretty good. Just a couple little blips. We're gonna send it to Jenna. Get the signal back up here for you guys. And once we get stopped, we'll move it out. Okay. Longer trip back, and it seems like a little bit circle, but it's cool. I like it. Yeah, it's nice, just nice and cool, and especially with the water dripping off the plants. Yeah. It's all lush and beautiful tropical scenery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And they're coming down to open the doors, oh, and then we'll be out. Yep, beautiful foliage. Okay. To the right. All right, I'm going to send you to Jenna here in just a second. I'm going to wait for her to tell me she's ready, and then we'll, we'll go back to Epcot, guys. A little park hopping. Remember, this is all live. The only thing that's not live is the little BRB screen, but I think that's pretty pretty obvious that's yeah. not live. But, but otherwise, oh, you can see the train again. Sorry, I didn't show it very well. There's the train for you guys real quick. It's pretty cool, isn't it? All the sleeping bags and stuff. Really cool. So yeah, so super fun. I'm glad you guys. I'm glad you guys uh, got to come with us on that. All right. She might be not be ready quite yet. Need me to text them. Watch the water there, Josh. Right. That's it. Thanks. Okay. So we're going to get a cookie and then head over to, um, I'm going to head to Hollywood Studios. And uh, Jenna is going to stay at Epcot for a little longer. So yeah, we'll see you guys over there. All right, everybody. Thanks for joining us uh, for this Animal Kingdom fun. Park hop to Epcot and you don't even have to use the park transportation. All you have to do is just keep your hands and arms inside the stream and remain seated. Or, or don't. You can even stand if you want on this ride. <laughs> All right, everybody, I'll get to my good shot of the Rafiki sign here, and then I'll head out. So, okay, guys, sending you to Epcot in three, two, and one. Everybody. Welcome back to Epcot. It has finished raining for now, so that's good, but I thought, hey, why not head into the shop, see what's new on our way to the next destination here at Epcot. Hello, welcome to Epcot. Welcome, welcome. Hey, Myers and the Mouse, how's it going? Hi, Vicky. Take your tail, John. Hello, hello. Look, guys, they have the rose gold bags back in stock the lounge flies i had one of these got it a long time ago when they first came out they're amazing hey joey's world thank you hey metallic alive happy's haunt amy hey sean rogers how are you welcome in guys i have to show you i showed this on friday night live what we didn't show this oh where'd it go they had a little uh one out for us to see but how stinking cute is this it's hard to see it. It's the rescuers. So I forget their names, but the rescuers from the rescues down under, and they have a little leaf boat, and it's the cutest thing ever. Oh, here you can kind of see it better here. They're in a leaf boat. <laughs> that's what they did. Hi, Phil Collins. I know it's adorable. It's uh, thirty-four ninety-nine for those. Those bags are really cool, but this bag is rocking. I'm telling you. Look at this. 
Hope you guys had fun at, at Animal Kingdom. Look like you guys did. We were watching while we were having uh, lunch. But this is really awesome. These are the um, Electric Mayhem. Dr. Dr. Teeth? Is that his name? He's going to say Dr. Tooth, but he's got more than one. Yes, he does. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, right? Isn't that the cutest thing ever? Hey, Jacob. How's it going? Manoa J, Patriotism USA. Brett is here. Jose. Ah, oh, thanks, John. Um, let's see. These are $88, so a little expensive. Bianca and Bernard. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. You are right. That's awesome. I always like the name Bianca. Miss Bianca and Bernard. Oh, oh, so cool. Isn't that cute, Myers and the Mouse? I'm assuming that this is Mama Mouse because she said stinking cute. <laughs> it's got to be Mama Mouse. Unless Kelly's making fun of me. Could be that, too. <laughs> oh, cool, Cody. I love that one, too. I just stepped on popcorn. That's all good. Look at old Yoda. It's a groovy lounge play. It is Bespoke Magic. <laughs> Hi, Cindy. Yes, all things are cute, cute, and more cute. Gotta love the cute. Here's Bolt. And Marie. Let's see, who else do we have? Got some shoulder plushies. We've got Groot. I have him. And Figment. Hey, hey over here. Hey, hey. Mama said it, I typed it. But with sarcasm. <laughs> Kelly. <laughs> Mama needs this one, Kelly. Tuck, tuck. <laughs> Love that movie. Yes, so cute. Hi, Marsha. How many lanyards? Um, I don't know. We have to find some and I'll show you. Epcot is your favorite. Cool, cool. I've got this bag and it's amazing. 100 year. Yeah, the, oh yeah, Rescuer is down under. Which one? Uh, you do not, mom. This one? Yeah, dad needs it actually. Yes, you're right. It's kind of a dad shirt, I'm just saying. You could get the uh, sweatshirt. No. Mom's cold, guys, this is weird. <laughs> But we're in the air conditioning. We'll get out of it and you'll be fine. You'll be fine. I love how empty it is in here. It looks great. Hey, Christopher Block. Uh, I, I need, I mean, the cats need figment for their stroller. Yes, yes, they do, Corey. I've got a lot of these left. I might wait till these go to the outlet. What you looking at now, Mom? It's cute, but it's... um. Real, it's a not a good color for us, I don't think. It's really not. <laughs> <laughs> not for mom and I. Let's see what ears they have, guys. I still wanted these ears from the 50th. I never got them. These are the ears I have on today without the bow. Yes, the rescuers. That was the first one. You're right. Chewy. That's true, John. Yeah, it is perfect for California. Thousand percent. Animals with Josh and Dad shopping with Jenna and Mom. Perfect Disney day. Thanks, guys. So glad you're loving it. And don't worry, we'll go ride some rides here in a little bit. But that's all we did all morning, so I figured let's do a little shopping. Hi, Frog. So, um... They, a lot of people, I think, well, John and his wife were looking for this bag, and they've got them right here. They've got more of them. I just got this one the other day at Springs, and look, ready? Boop. <laughs> ready? Boop. <laughs> Rawr. <laughs> That's the cutest bag ever. So Mom and Dad got me that one, and I love it. Some raincoats. Mom, you could get a raincoat, except for you have one. Ooh, look at this. This is new. Perfect for Halloween, even though it's hot, but... Jack and Sally. <laughs> Check the back. This is cool. That's a cool one. Yep, of course, I love this one. Little stitchy plane is a little ukulele. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then here's the back. He's chilling, having an icy. Living the best life. 
It is puku peekaboo. I can't even talk. Pukaboo? <laughs> peekaboo stitch. <laughs> it's a pukaboo. It's a new animal. <laughs> They're stitchy. I like these too. I'll make you a mini. Regular t shirts. Mouth is definitely hard, yeah. Oh, this one's cool. Dad almost needs this one. Just along yeah. for the ride. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of new shirts. Ooh, look at that one. Yes, more J lingo, 100%. Uh, oh, what's happening? Okay, got something from Josh. Sorry, guys. Checking it out. Mama Mouse needs this one. Right? Mama Mouse needs this one. Does she have this one? Oh, okay, John. Jack and Sally, yeah. Oh, yeah, Jollywood Nights. Yeah, you could use it for that as well. Okay, what else do we have here? Stitchy! So cute! Hi, Glenn! <laughs> They're laughing at my peekaboo stitchy. Oh, guys, guess what I did too while we were waiting for Josh to be done? I bought um, one of the munchlings to um, have an unboxing. So I hope I get my Mickey latte. I'm a little worried it's not gonna be Mickey. That's the only one I want is the Mickey latte, but I also kind of need these. Chip! Mama does not have it and said, heck yeah. <laughs> she needs it. She needs it. Okay, somebody is asking about um, lanyards. So here's some. There's a Guardians. This is the one mom has that um, Kelly and Ivone got her for her birthday. I like this Munchling one, though. This is really cute. All the Munchlings. Mer Let's see. This is the, I think, yeah, Little Mermaid. We've got Mickey and the gang. See if there's more over here. There is more. Oh, I have this one. Doggies and kitties. There's the kitties. And there's the doggies. These are wishables. They're all the, all the wishables are gone now. Hi, Vicky. It's Wonderland Alice. Cute. So cute. Mickey's. We've got some for um, Star Wars and Tinkerbell Joey. Oh yeah. <laughs> so. If anybody gets this and they don't want this pen, I want it so bad. But I don't want the rest of them. Yeah. <laughs> Just want that they one. do that. Look at his face. Yep. <laughs> yeah. You can totally use keychains as Christmas ornaments. Oh my goodness, I didn't even That's think of that. Oh my goodness, Corey Ruprecht, look at you. Look at you, now I want to spend more money because I need him and him and him and him and her. <laughs> Dale, it's Corey Ruprecht's fault. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> totally kidding. Traders, Jenna, use the others to trade. Well, that's true. That's true, Mom. It's just, you know, dollar monies, things that you have to pay. But no, you're you're so right. Let's see. Well, how much are they? That's a good point. I like I like how you're thinking. 40 bucks. Eek. We'll see. Chippendale magnet, I know, all the Chippendales. Um, let's see, what do we have here? Anything we need. We don't talk about Bruno. No, we do not, so we'll leave that one. <laughs> we need this one, because that's us. Yes. <laughs> Corey says, sorry, Daryl. Oh, here's the cool one that we saw earlier we have to get. It was all started by a mouse. Myers and the Mouse, have you seen this one? <laughs> Myers and the Mouse said, 40 bucks, never mind, put it down. <laughs> Okay, so check this out. Now you gotta open it up without dropping it like I did last time. Look at this pen, how stinking cool is this? Waltz on the inside and Mickey, all the Mickeys from the different years. Uh, but get them. <laughs> so cute. The Chuby shoulder pal, no. No, I've not seen him. I saw him once and I haven't seen him since. I need this one. Isn't that cool, guys? So cool. It might be on my next next pen I need list. <laughs> so look at big list. I did want to get pens. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Tell him I got it. Thank you, Josh. So. What should we go look at now? And then we'll head out, head out and uh, go ride a ride or head around the countries. We haven't been to the countries yet. 
still really want these backpacks, and I know I don't need them, but I love them. Especially her. I love him too, but he's kind of sad. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Okay, so me and my buddy watch you guys all the time. Aww. I'm actually on the phone with him now. No way. He sort of led me to you. Do you want to say hi? Of course. <laughs> What's your name? My name is Austin. His name is uh, Steven. He's, Steven. He's, from, he's in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. I'm in Panama City, Florida. Awesome. And we work at the same job, so anytime we get the chance, we, we are able to go to Disney together. Yeah. We're actually coming back in September. Nice. But, uh, well, but, hey, Steven. Hey, Steven. <laughs> That's on, so buddy. awesome. I love all your pens. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm like, so much. No, you're I totally see fine. all these you're pens. Totally I see Stitchy and Stitchy. <laughs> um, and <laughs> I've got actually a Stitchy. Stitchy. No <laughs> way. Yeah. That's amazing. I love well, it. Sorry to bother you. No you worries. Guys have an awesome, awesome you day. too. You Thanks okay, for saying hi. Today. Bye. Thanks. Guys, I was looking at all the Stitchy pens. Those were cool. And here is my, my plushy coffee I need. Don't mind me, Dale. I'm just buying a plushy coffee. Don't you guys think I need him? I need him. <laughs> nah, we're all good. Here we go. We got this, Mom. <laughs> just kidding. All right, guys. Stay funny. Mom, mom and streaming. Holding. Holding it. I know, right? Gonna hold my plushy coffee. It's the only way mom will have a coffee. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly If it's plushy. Yeah. Mama says yes, Kelly says nope. <laughs> I know, Kelly, that's why I'm not getting it, because I think Dale would say the same. I suggest you get the, the stitch pen. Isn't it cute? Alright. But I did. So this is the only one I want. Jenna, it's Kelly. He will tell. He'll tell on you. I know. He's probably texting Dale right now. <laughs> but I did get one of these because they're cheaper. <laughs> you need him. I know. Oh, you could put pens on him. That would be cute. Um, <laughs> but they do have a miniature one of what I really, really want. And but you can't tell because they're mystery. So I bought one. We're gonna open one up here in a minute. So the little ones are $16.99. The big ones are $34.99, which isn't horrible, but yeah. I know, you just carry them around. The pin, oh, with Walt and Mickey. Oh, goodness, I don't know. I would assume. <coughs> Sorry, guys. <coughs> I choked during uh, lunch, and so my throat is like. Sorry. <coughs> it got all irritated. I choked on my chicken nuggy. But I was okay, don't worry. Um, but I think it was probably $14.99. I'm not sure. If we see it again, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll tell you guys. I'll let you know but let's head on out of here that way? oh disembark that's a good idea problem is is getting time to ship them out that it's hard to get get that done <laughs> yeah it's nice out here right yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sorry Ooh. just uh ruined my my throat there, but it's all good now. We have 3,600 people in the chat, so let's talk about uh, Magic Band Readers, one of our other awesome, awesome sponsors that we have, magicbandreaders.com. If you guys want to uh, bring your Magic Band Reader, um, bring a Magic Band Reader home with you, you can get one at magicbandreaders.com. There's so many different designs you can choose from. Um, there's a regular Mickey Mouse one like you do, um, like you have when you scan into the park. Um, they also have a uh, Spaceship Earth one that does the Spaceship Earth show. A lot of different designs. There's Avengers, Pirates, Figment, Monorail even. So go check them out, guys. Magicbandreaders.com. Use our code RESORT15 for 15% off. It is so fun, right? My ears and the mouse, you can use your Magic Band at home. If you get the... Um, the plug-in, there's an extra plug-in for it, and then you can plug in lights, lamps, um, even your Christmas tree, and then you can turn it on with that. So go check them out, guys. Magicbandreaders.com. Wow. It's like not busy, and I'm loving it. I don't know what's happening right now, but I'm going to take it. What's behind the wall? They are refurbing a lot of um, Epcot right now. It's been like that forever. We call it Walcott. Yeah. Eventually, it'll be Epcot again. <laughs> One of these days. 
But guys, make sure you subscribe if you're new. I was checking while we were having lunch. It looks like we're 54 subscribers away from 179,000 subscribers. So if you've not subscribed, if you've not asked your, you know, mom, dad, brother, sister, aunt, uncle, cousin, doggy to subscribe, kitty cat, subscribe. <laughs> Everybody subscribe. No, I'm just kidding about the animals, but have your family subscribe and uh, your friends. Ooh, monorail shop. If, if they love Disney. Let's try to get to 179K today. How cool would that be? On an all day stream. Hi, Linda. Thanks, cool cat. Hi, Dust88, how are you? Moana is coming soon. That is very true. That's true, Christopher Black. Moana, coming soon. All right, let's go into the Avengers shop, which is over here, or Marvel, I guess. Looks so weird here without all the flowers and topiaries. Mm -hmm. uh, Elizabeth, I don't know if they still have the 25th anniversary or not. Did Josh go shopping while he was in Animal Kingdom today? Hi, Val. Coco, Miguel and Dante. Let's go get a nice view across, across the lake. Now that the uh, barges are gone, we get a good view. Yeah. So mom and I had connections. We had um, chicken fingers and I choked on one. <laughs> and my throat's all irritated now, but it's all good. Just might have a few coughs here and there. Doesn't look great. Oh, I love Moana too. It's a great, great movie. Oh, Frozen and Ratatouille are down? Holy moly. <laughs> That's crazy. You can hear the drums in Japan. That's fun. Wow, this is nice. I, I mean, they're still setting something up out here, but you can still see, kind of, you know, through it. We cannot confirm nor deny Josh did any shopping other than for cookies. <laughs> all right, Kelly. That's funny. So, he didn't. <laughs> it's all good. I figured he would. Not, you know, he didn't have a lot of time to shop, so. Epcot does, look, yeah, it does. It's not too busy, at least up front. I'm sure it's busier in the countries. Hey, real Rapunzel. Happy belated birthday to mom. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, Zach, uh, Zach and Sarah. Send a super chat to part two of the stream. Oh no, LOL. Anyways, uh, it said it was so good to see you the other day. We are back in Tennessee celebrating Wyatt's birthday. Aw, thanks Sarah, uh, Zach and Sarah and Wyatt, happy birthday. Um, thanks for sending it over on, you know, part two. And uh, thanks for letting us know on part one. <laughs> thanks Zach and Sarah. And glad you had a great time. I'm glad we got to see you guys too. And hi Winnie Kate. Thanks guys. Ooh, the taco salad at Connections. I've never had that. Alrighty, here we go. Hi, Wonderland Alice. So, they do have pin trading in both of these shops. Actually, let's go in this one and then we'll go across. And then we'll make our way to Mexico and go ride a boat ride. Thanks. Thank you so much. Love, love your streams. We're watching a lot to get us ready for our 30th anniversary trip at the end of September. Well, happy anniversary. 2.1K likes. Thanks, everybody. I was at DAC on Thursday, and there was a lot of anniversary items. Okay. Good deal, Chelsea. Well, the last time I was there, which has been a couple weeks, they had most of it. Um, still, they didn't have all of it, but they had most of it. So... That was a while ago. A couple weeks, maybe? Or a week? Yeah, it's really nice, Manoa Jay. I'm actually really surprised. But I'm okay with it. Okay, let's see what we can find. There's that peace sign. 90s shirt over here. Oh, they got a lot of Jack Skellington stuff. Ooh, look at these ears. These are new. Mom, you need these for your dress. If I can get them off. I can tell how tight they are. Yeah, <laughs> these are very tight. And they're plastic, so a lot of times the plastic ones are tighter. Those are cool, though. They are. I'm going to need... Nope, I got it. Never mind. Got or it. maybe. 
One handed is a little tough. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Got it. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Looks like there's um, Jack Skellington jammies here. And a sweatshirt. What else do we have? Ooh, there's a Sally hat. That's cute. Isn't that cute? Ooh, and the bag is adorable. It is $39.99. There's the back. A t-shirt dress. You could put a belt on it, Mom. It's cute. I like the color. Yeah, see, they must have. They're all about peace, love, and rock and roll. Well, there you go, Metallica. Oh, look, and there's a guy's... Um, Yep. Jack hat. A little backpack here and some. It's like jammies to me. I know, Rue or Bunzel. <gasps> me too. Zero's my favorite. He's adorable. And they've got some of the Haunted Mansion stuff here. Got the Crocs. We've got the ears, the backpack. This is Madame Leota. Everything glows in the dark, even the shirt. The ears, the hat. Carly says, oh my goodness, I need it. <laughs> kind of making our way around. Is that a, oh, that is a necklace. That's weird. Right. Oh, they got stitch stuff over here still. I'm actually surprised they didn't have a st another stitch backpack out this year. I know where he's Steve. I totally get it. Hey, Chef Ricky from Amelia Island. Hello. Here's mom's dress. She hasn't worn yet. Mom, you got to wear that cute dress. It's adorable. Yeah. No worries. You have time. Here's the stitchy ears that I love so much. All right. I don't see the pen. Oh, there's the pen board. I see it. Sorry. Excuse me. Here it is. Hi. Right. We both have him. We do. You have that. We do. Dad has the train. Yep. All right, I'm all set. I think so. Cool beans. Yeah. All right. Well, let's head to the next one. Ooh, these are all 30% off. That's good because they're expensive. Okay. So. Here we go. So let's also talk about um, David's Vacation Club Rentals. If you guys would like to treat your family to a stay at a Disney Deluxe Villa for a fraction of the cost, go check them out at dvcrequest.com slash gv. <laughs> very soft, but they're very cute. So dvcrequest.com slash gv. You don't have to be a DVC member to rent from David's. So you can stay at those DVC resorts without having DVC or owning DVC. Hi everyone. I'm a and I like warm hugs. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, the goofy dress is very cute. Okay, Jenna, $40, 20% off, divided by four pens on the lanyard, then trade three. Good deal. Is that a good deal, Corey? Okay. Okay. Rocket and Groot. No? Not gonna do it? It's okay. Oh! That was quick, but good job. <laughs> Hi, Tony! So again, go to go check out David's dvcrequest.com slash tv. going off but it's not no worky today no worky there it goes good job mom it's both of them yeah when they're together they'll go off at the same time yeah back and forth yeah oh look little Pluto's over there meeting and greeting 
All right, let's go in here and then we'll head to Mexico and go ride that nice boat ride. I know, me too, Corey. I love all the animals, the doggies, Pua. Hi. Oh, there's the pen board. Hi. Ooh, I need this one. I need uh, ice cream. Your mom will have you hold that. All right. about that. I could. I might. Okay. And I'll let you get yours. Okay. Yep. Alright. Which one are you going to get? The Cinderella? Yes. Okay. They're on your lanyard, remember? So they're easier for you. <laughs> Thanks, Motor. Actually, I was charging while we were eating. I like the Pluto cupcake, too. That's really cute. Which one are you going to trade, Mom? Well, this one, I guess. Oh, too bright. The Dale pin would look good on that plushie. I agree. Hi, Katie. No, so I already have this one. That's why I gave yes. it away. I've got more than one of these, these stitchy pens. Otherwise, I'll keep it 100%. All right, mom, you good? We did our training, thank you so much. That was cool. We've got some good pens today. Good trading pens. I still want these guys. Very sad. You'll be able to So stinking cute. Yep. Got your Marvel stuff over here. And look over here is Baby Rocket, and he's so stinking cute. Look at him, Mom. <laughs> <He's cute. laughs> He's cute, too. And then the doggy. Guardians of the Galaxy, which I've not seen. I think it's coming soon okay, to Disney say. Plus, hopefully. Because, yeah. Um, yeah. I can't wait to see that. Got the Scarlet Witch, which I have yeah. and I love. And I <laughs> probably need the mug. <laughs> Really love seeing the pin trading action. Thanks, Kaylee. I'm glad you enjoy it. Mom and I have really enjoyed doing the pin trading. That's a cool shirt. It is. Yeah. I have this one. This one. Oh no, that's kids. I was gonna say I really like this one. <laughs> Why is it kids? Yeah, I know. It's that cute. Cool. It's also a bit short, isn't it? That's the problem these days. All of the shirts are too short. Get cute little Marie. Whoops. She's got magnet hands. Put them on your backpack. Oh, look at this. World Showcase Passport Pack. Contains World Showcase Passport, Mickey Button, and 77 stickers. $14.99. That's really fun. I'm going to go around the countries and put your sticker on the country that you went to visit, I guess. I like that. Wakanda. All the Wakanda merch. They got a lot right here. Wakanda. Oh, is mom going to buy a shirt? Are you getting it? Put it up to you and see if it's too short, though. What size did you get? A small? Small. Um, no? It would be too short on me, but I'm taller. Yes. It's cute. Do you want to um, get it and then carry it or get it on our way out? I'll get it and carry it because okay. not being your life. All righty. Looks like you can go over there. Yeah. yeah. Perfect. Mom's buying, guys. Don't tell Dad. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, bye. Cool cat. 
Avengers Assemble. Myers and the Mouse, Avengers. Assemble. Add Avengers. <laughs> Just kidding. When we went to Disneyland last year, that's what we would say. Add Avengers. Because that's what Ivone said. <laughs> It was fun. Fun trip. I was actually watching one of our vlogs last night from our Disneyland trip. Because I want to go back. So yeah, guys, if you, if you don't have anything to watch, like last night I had nothing to watch on TV. So I went back to our YouTube channel and watched an old vlog. Aw, oh, thank you, Slow. You're so sweet. That backpack. Dad does love when mom shops. You're right. He really does. Oh my goodness. Why don't they have this for adults right I mean it was mom's birthday you're right good point all right we will head out here when mom is done and we'll go ride the Mexico ride it's a cool shop in here all set mom hey want to go ride the Mexico ride let's go Three caballeros, three caballeros. Thanks, Kelly. Well, we had so much fun. Glad you enjoyed them. Ooh, Mom, they got our favorite cookies. M&M, my favorite. We're in trouble now. We might have to get one on the way out when we flip it to Josh. Ooh, before we go on the Mexico ride, do you guys want to do the unboxing of my munchling? Before I forget, let's go over here to the table. I'm going to do an unboxing. Yeah, I wonder if they had made, um, sometimes they'll make a Mickey out of them. Actually, we, it's not too wet. We could sit down. Okay. Dried off pretty quickly. Okay. So, I'm going to get a stand. Have you hold it for a second? Got, got it. Do you have it? <laughs> I don't know. She said got it and I didn't no, know. No, no, I said it. not got okay. it. <laughs> it didn't seem like you had it. So no, I, I didn't. I kept a hold. Oh my word, look at this squirrel did. on the table. Oh uh, yeah. He's like, you can't see me. I'm you can't not see me. <laughs> Guys, look how cute. Yeah. He saw you No, no, mom, don't don't scare him. Don't scare him. <laughs> He's so stinking cute. Yes. Okay, we'll do the unboxing, but first. He's listening. Squirrel cam. <laughs> he's so stinky. You never get to see those, right? No, it's a squirrel cam. He's sleeping. Well, he's not really sleeping. He's chilling. He has listen to everything we're saying. He has the best spot right here. Yeah. You're going to Disneyland for your 30th next June. Oh, Carly, that's amazing. Took so many notes from your blog vlogs. That's awesome. It is very quiet right here, and I love it. Squirrel. <laughs> like he legit is not moving. Okay. Well, we'll let him sleep and we'll do the unboxing. <laughs> okay. I'll let you stare at him for a minute while I get my box, my munchling box out. Okay, everybody send good vibes for the coffee Mickey. <laughs> yeah. Coffee Mickey, we need good vibes. Oh, oh Look here comes coming. Pluto. <laughs> It's not even raining, Pluto, is it? Pluto! Pluto, look, squirrel! <laughs> is it? Okay. All right. Bye, Pluto! We love you! No, he's so cute. He's skipping in. Yeah, the squirrels are definitely well fed. So true. Okay. Oh, he did move the scissors. Oh, he's looking at you, Mom. <laughs> looking at you. He's ready to jump. Is he ready to jump? All right. Let's flip the camera around. You should get the passport thing and do it together one day. How much did it cost? Um, I don't know, Wendy. I didn't check to see how much it costs. Ooh, the lighting is not huge. Mm -hmm. You can add this. It's fine. It'll be fine. We'll turn. Oh, that's the wrong one. Pressing buttons. Turn up the sun. That'll help. Okay. Everybody, good vibes. Good vibes. Good vibes. 
<laughs> so these are the ones we can get. This is the one I want. Mickey Latte. I gotta redo my nails. Uh, but we've got Marie. I wouldn't mind having Baymax either. He's cute. Um, there's Mochi from um, Big Hero 6. O'Malley, May Mouse. I mean, I'd really, I would take any of them, but I really, really, really want the latte. <laughs> <laughs> the squirrel saving his firework spot. That's awesome. <laughs> Last time I was there, I had multiple squirrels run under my chair. Yeah, they are not afraid of people here. Nope, you are right. Okay. Here we go. Let's open this. How do you even open it? We've done a few. Maybe from the bottom? Or do you open it from the top? Let's try the bottom. Yeah, let's try the bottom. That one's smart. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Coffee vibes. Coffee vibes. <laughs> you just threw pixie dust at the screen? I love it. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Trying to get this. It's like a little sticker. Yeah, I gotta get stickers off all the way around. Oh no. <laughs> the suspense. <laughs> and the squirrel's just napping over there. Yeah, he is. Hey, Nicole. <laughs> Might need your nails, Mom, because mine are no good right now. Can. Took off my nail polish. You can get that. And then, when I do that, I bite my fingernails. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got no, I've got no fingernails. everybody right now. <laughs> oh, yeah. <It> is. Kelly! <laughs> can't have it if you can't open it. I'm gonna open it. I got this. <laughs> I got this. See? See? <laughs> okay. Is everybody ready? Careful you don't dump them. Womp womp. Aww. He's cute though, but that's not, I would have rather had Baymax. Yeah. Baymax or the coffee. Well, def definitely the coffee. So, anybody want an O'Malley? <laughs> that was the one I actually least wanted. <laughs> yeah, not the way it goes. Yeah. Um, oh, well. Yeah. No worries. Now yeah. I just have to buy the big one. <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's that simple, right? I could just give them away. That's true. Who wants them? Yeah. Maybe a little kid. All right. Yeah. Let's put it back. Want, want. That's sad news. Yeah. But we try. We yep. try. <gasps> what? Our squirrel left? He was waiting to see what I opened. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> he is cute. He's definitely cute. Yes. I just, um, yeah. Would have rather had one of the other ones. But that's how it goes when you get mystery stuff. Yep. I should have bought all the boxes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well. Oh, did you like that one? Well, cool. <laughs> well, there you go. All right, let's put it back in the box. So I don't lose them. And there is your Munchling unboxing for the day. Yeah. <laughs> Sailor the cool cat says yay. Oh, yeah. that's right. I bet Sailor likes that. Um, the the Munchling ones, I think they're $16.99. So I think it was about $14.50 with my discount. All right, let's flip you guys back around, and bam. There's mom. <laughs> and look, the squirrel is gone. Where did he go? Don't see him? He's out of here. Put it on a pin trading board. <laughs> That's funny. If I want to trade a pin for a bunchling. <laughs> That's funny. I bet Liam would like him. There you go. That's true. Okay. The passport is for when you go to each country, they will stamp it. Real fun. Veronica and Todd. Very cool. Yeah, it looked like a lot of fun. All right, let's go ride the Mexico ride. Awesome. Ready to grow gardens. That's super cool. Let's uh, t chat about another awesome sponsor that we have. Uh, we have Behind the Ride. If you guys are wanting to learn how some of your favorite rides right here at Walt Disney World were created, go check out Behind the Ride by David Mumpower on Amazon. So this is a book on Amazon. You can get the ebook or the hardcover copy, either one. Again, Behind the Ride on Amazon.
You get what you get, that's right, exactly. You get what you get. I could, I could give it to a random kid. Maybe I'll do that when we're not live. Be like, here you go, you want a kitty? <laughs> and you get a kitty, and you, oh, just kidding, I only have one. <laughs> Uh, no booths are open yet. They officially open on Thursday for food and wine. I know, they should set up a, a munchling trading board. You can just put your munchling up there. Whoop, I got that one. I got that one. So I'm going to trade it. <laughs> hey, Stefan. Ah, uh, no, you can't return them, unfortunately. But that's okay. No worries. No worries at all. It was still fun to unbox the suspense, I'm telling you. And um, it was still cute. All right, let's go in here. Still cute, just not the one I wanted. And that's how it goes sometimes, so no worries. It's all good. Ooh, smell the, the chippies in here. Wow, where are the people? I hope Magic Kingdom's like this. <laughs> This is amazing. My hands hurt. We did the drum roll, but it took so long to open the box. <laughs> Sorry, Kelly. You know, I had to build the suspense up for you guys. <laughs> Ooh, okay, cool, John. That's awesome. They do have a pin board over here, so let's go check it. Before we ride the ride. See what they have. Okay. Oh, there's another little Dale. Wow, they've got quite a few here. Yeah. I like how they have them organized. Yeah. Mike Wazowski. Yeah. There's a um, Dale lock. Oh, That's fun. Very cool. I don't see any I need, but there you go. Hey, Vicky. That's right, a live action squirrel plushie. <laughs> oh, I love that, Corey. Today I learned that there's a make your own glass creation in Germany. Yeah, Nicole, we uh, have walked by that before. It looks super fun. Mama Mouse and I have wanted to do that. All right, let's go ride the ride. There's a little line, but it's not bad. Yeah, Wendy, um, so it's paypal.me slash resort TV one. If one of the mods wants to post the link, um, again, you never, you don't have to give anything at all, um, but that is the, the best way that um, and YouTube doesn't take any of it. So. But thank you so much. But again, it's always free to watch. Just watch and like share us out that helps a lot there we go thanks Sally R. I have eaten here it's really good it's a fun restaurant nice um, of course atmosphere and good food oh cool Dusty D. thank you so much one of your favorite rides at Disney. Awesome. We were able to trade my daughter's monthly at Disney Springs in the big store in June. They have a basket in the back. Okay. I love that. Thank you, Beach Club. That's good to know. Yeah, for sure, Ryan. You really can. Yep, everybody's here. <laughs> It's a great pavilion, I agree. It's one of the most awkward lines because, you know, you're just back and forth. Well, my son was for a random lady in Animal Kingdom gifted him two stuffed animals that she won in Dino Land. He still has them to this day. He's 11. Oh, I love that. 
Oh, you're eating there tomorrow? That is amazing. That's right, it, can, it wasn't too spicy, at least what I got. Yeah, Myers and the Mouse, it's great. Great pavilion, great ride. Smells delish. Can't go wrong. What time? Oh, that happens. It's all good. All right, ceiling stream. It's the awkward part. Awkward line. We should come up with an awkward song. Should we come up? Uh, let's see. I don't know. I can't think of one right now. I'm usually good at coming up with songs, but I can't think of one right now. This is my awkward song. It isn't very long. Hey! <laughs> This? Oh my god. Use the phone nicely. Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, don't go anywhere. We're gonna be riding that ride here soon. Share us out. Subscribe if you're new. Do all the things. We appreciate it. We're getting close to 179K and it'll be amazing if we could get there today on our all-day stream. We have a lot, we got a whole lot of fun coming, so don't go anywhere. Josh is on his way to Hollywood Studios uh, now, or at least he should be heading that way soon if he's not already. And we're going to be bopping you over there soon. Two can, can we do number one? Okay, thank you. Oh, what did I hear? DMV, what are you doing? I missed it. Just popping in for a late lunch break. Iz is about to take her math final. Oh, good luck, Iz. You'll do the best. Best ever. I'm sure you will, but good luck. Good luck, let us know how it goes. Watch your steps. Hey guys, enjoy the ride. Here we go. Adios, amigos. Adios. Arms, feet, and legs inside the boat. And if you have children, you can have a piece of art.
ti. Gracias. We got a boat back up on I-4 here. Oh, here we go.
Have a good birthday. Thanks for asking. Hi. Wow. Got really busy all of a sudden. I wonder if it's raining. Mm. Alright. So, what did Jack say? Something. Tell him. Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. Let's go this way. I was like going out this way. Because then you can see the pretty orchids. Alright, let me fix the sun. Oops, whoa, too much. Too much. Okay, it's either sprinkling or it's coming off the trees. You're welcome. I'm so glad you guys liked it. Oh, wow. Are all the orchids gone? I guess they took them out for flower and garden, huh? That's too bad. They were always so pretty. Oh, we there missed one. We found one. We did. We found two. There and there. Tell mom one day when she hits 30, we will have to take her to dinner. 
<laughs> Myers in the mouse. <laughs> All right, I'll tell her. I'll let her know. <laughs> but only when she turns 30. <laughs> That's funny. Too funny, guys. 130. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at Donald over there. He's got quite the line. All right, where should we go? Oh yeah, it's sprinkling. Here it comes. Stay away. Stay away. We were in Future World all morning. Um, so we thought we would head to the country now. I don't know what we're gonna do yet, but maybe we can go in the shops in China. Oh yeah, here it comes. Walk a little faster. Hey, rainwaters. Oh boy, here come the rainwaters. Guys, send them away. <laughs> send them away. Woo. You can go in the church. Do you wanna go in the church? Oh, we can make it, I think. We can make it to China. Not too bad, but I shouldn't say that. Cause then it'll get worse. <laughs> I said it's not too bad, but then it'll get worse. Uh, Corey says 30, nine years is a long time to wait. <laughs> uh, that's funny. We're not gonna make it. I didn't think it was supposed to rain again until four. Oh well. It's Florida. All right, guys. Head on in here to China. Do the anti-rain dance. That's right, guys. Use a nice champagne. All right. <laughs> My ears in the mouth. That's awesome. All right. We're almost to the shop. Hopefully, it'll be done raining here in a little bit. Yeah, the crowds are not bad today at all. I'm really curious because mom and I are gonna hop over to Magic next. Really curious how Magic is. I'm sure it's busier, it always is. But it'd be nice if it wasn't. Birdies, I hear birdies. Oh my goodness, look how cute. I know, isn't it crazy? There's nobody here, aren't they cute? Yeah. That's right. Good job, Mom. Who would have thought of doing that rabbit? I know. They cute. Yep. Mm, they all have bubble gum. Well, fairies is what it looks like to me. I don't know if that's what they are, but yeah. oh, princess blind box. Okay, oh, just okay. kidding. The princesses. Princesses. Yesterday, MK was the lowest park attendance rating. What? My ears and the mouse. Okay, well, if it's like that today, I'm going to be super excited. Also, I need this hat. Crazy banana hat. Yeah. <laughs> this is a great shop. They've got, like, everything. Lots of things. I never go this way. More bunnies. Oh, it is the year of the rabbit. That's why, Mom. Oh, that makes sense. Yep. The year Shoot. of the rabbit. Purple bunny. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Little outfit. Oh, kido, smoky. Bird show. Well, we're not at Animal Kingdom, so we won't be able to do that. And Josh left. He is at Hollywood Studios. Did he say how long it was? Ask him how long, just so we have a roundabout, <laughs> a roundabout time frame here. Got some cool hats in here. Ratatouille is only 30 minutes? Are you serious? Okay, wait, what is this? <laughs> pudding. Get your pudding. 
What are these? I don't know, because I can't read Chinese. Some sort of pillows. Yeah, that was a deal hat. Some slippers. Ooh, 40 minutes? Okay. It's not bad. You'll be here for the Christmas party? That's amazing. Haunted's 40, Pirates 20, Jungle 55, Space 65. Alright, so it's not... Oh, TT is 25? Oh, it's a little busy then. Okay. Alright, oh, what are these? What are these? Are these socks? These are socks. It's popcorn socks, strawberry tea socks, watermelon socks, butterfly avocado socks. <laughs> That's funny. I just like the packaging. <laughs> oh my goodness, what is this? A corgi state of mind. <laughs> Don't let me see inside the book. Uh, oh my goodness, look at him. <laughs> Hi, Christopher oh Robin. <laughs> Learn the Corgi way of life. Practice positive self-affirmations with Corgi as he shares with you his daily mantras and cheery outlook on life. Free audiobook reading in Mandarin available. Learning Chinese has never been so easy. We're in the uh, China store. Yes. <laughs> Shiba Boba. There you go, Jen. There you go, Jen. like sushi but I think it's for incense yeah right uh, we're not gonna have enough time for ratatouille because Josh is waiting in line right now for Tower of Terror um, so whenever he gets up closer to the front of the line I will switch you guys over there that way you don't have to wait in a really long line all right I do have to turn down the bits because it gets a little cranky back here Let's see if it's raining anymore. That part of the shop is where it gets cranky. Okay, I think we're good now. But I think we are going to make our way back up to the front because we will be switching you to Josh. Here, actually, let's go over here for a second. And I'm going to text him and see what the plan is. Good idea. So I don't know if I'm going to start heading. I would assume I'll start heading over to Magic. But maybe he wants Got me it. to hang out here some more. Let's see what he says. Yes. You're just pointing it. I know. I was just trying Not to... Not you think. now. No. I know. I'm <laughs> trying to get it to turn around. There you go. There you go. doesn't cooperate. No worries. I'm for us you. amateurs. Just showing them the shop fronts. Okay. <laughs> Checking the radar real quick too. Yeah. Hey Jenna or Gina, I'm not sure which way. That Gina is. is it J E N A? Yeah. Gina. Gina. Yeah. I asked her the last time. Oh, that good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, Bella. <laughs> I haven't heard back from him yet. Nope. So Taking. I'm sure you will. I think it's Starbucks o'clock. Do you think it's Starbucks o'clock? I think so. <laughs> I think it's Brenda, when Brenda was saying it was his birthday. Well, happy birthday, Brendan. Um, Emily, so we're going to be switching to Josh in Hollywood. Just trying to get all the parks to show you all the things today. As much as we can show you. And you can hop after 2 o'clock. So, that is probably what we're going to do. Well, Josh has already hopped. I'm not quite sure if I'm going to hop yet or not, but to hop or not to hop? That is the question. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Kimmy, how are you? Uh, let's see. My friend just posted from Epcot saying he's having a nice beverage. So now I'm watching for him in the background. Oh, cool. That's awesome. Hi, Shannon. Hi, Diana. Ooh, it was nice and 
cool in there. It's starting to get warm again. Mom does a nice job. Yes, she always does a nice job. Hey, how are you? Doing good. How are you guys? Good, good. Thank you, thank you. I saw you got the popcorn bucket. Like, it's too cute. He was, he was like, never picks a bucket. And said, Dale was the exact same. Dale said the same thing. Like, yeah. This is my pick. Yeah. Do you, do you guys want to say hi? Yeah. yeah. Remind me your names. I, I recognize oh, you, but remind me your names. Amber. Amber. Bradley. And Brett? Bradley. Bradley, sorry. From Kentucky. From Kentucky. <laughs> awesome. Well, it's good to see you guys again. Ooh, tell Josh hi. I will try to stay dry. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hi, let's see. We're gonna head this way, guys. Um, so we're not gonna ride the monorail. We're gonna go ahead and drive over there because we're gonna switch you to Josh. Um, that way we can have our car there at the end of the night and it won't be difficult to get back to our car. Um, because sometimes that can be difficult if you stay late. But if that wasn't enough or uh, if it wasn't gonna be hard to do, we would definitely take the monorail. We love the monorail. Josh could be skipping. This is true. You never know. <laughs> yeah, Josh is actually um, waiting in line right now for Tower of Terror. So, as soon as he is done there, um, or as soon as he's getting close, we're going to go in the shop here on the way. But as soon as he's getting close, we're going to switch you over there to Josh. All right, he says in about five to ten minutes, so... Sounds good. We don't come, oh, Frozen's close. I was gonna say, it is not busy back here, but that is why. <laughs> well, it's closed. Must be having some issues. Um, I don't remember what time we'll be there for, for, King, bleh, for King and Country. But, um, but we will be there for sure one day, maybe two. We're not quite sure the plan on that yet. But let's go in here. I know they have a pen board. Yep, Josh is in line for Tower of Terror. Don't go anywhere. Ooh, it's nice in here. Look at the, is it an elk? Yeah, guys, pop that like button and subscribe if you're new. I'm gonna go check out the pen board when they're all done here. No, no, you're fine. I'm just gonna look at the board. No, you're fine. No worries. All good. I don't see one. Do you see one, Mom? Uh, Jan, not sure. We'll just see what's available and how bad the the lines are. Here's a troll. Are we blipping? All right, we'll head out. We're blipping. Blip, blip. You didn't see one? Okay. Uh, Wendy, I believe we're going to go live. Not 100% sure um, next Sunday for, for King and Country. We're going to be there. I think we're going to go live, though. I'm not quite sure. So stay tuned. Have your notification bells on and all the things, and we'll let you know. Here's the Kringla Bakery. <laughs> Christopher Robin said you should knock on the frozen door and ask them if they want to build a snowman. I love this idea. I love that idea. It's awesome. Alright, so stay tuned. We're going to head up this way. Ooh, that's a nice breeze. So we're going to be heading out over to Magic Kingdom soon, so we might as well walk this way while we're waiting on Josh. Yep. Hi, Amy. Might even have to hop in line at the Starbucks on the way. <laughs> no. Probably not a might. That's a, That's a probably. definite. <laughs> Man, we moved right along. We sure did. It went to might to yes. <laughs> yes, we're only 35 subscribers away from 179K, guys. This is pretty awesome on an all-day stream, and it would be amazing if we could hit that today. Yeah. Hi, Alyssa. Yep, that was the old name of the ride, Maelstrom. 
Google says Starbucks is less busy than usual in the Magic Kingdom. All right, I like that. Hopefully, does it say that at Epcot? <laughs> Oh, that's too bad, Karen. I'm sorry he's missing missing your son. Weather's coming in. Okay, you can kind of feel it. It's starting to get breezy. But also, guys, um, if you missed my vlog from yesterday um it was a it was a fun vlog mom and i enjoyed a day at universal studios and we got to ride the new minion ride the minion blast ride um so we didn't you can't film on the ride but we told you all about it gave you our review on it and what we thought of it um then we went to the minion cafe the minion bakery we had a whole minion day and uh but we also did some exploring around the park showing you some updates um the starbucks is not where it normally is right now so we showed you where the new starbucks is or the temporary one and then we went and uh oh cool taylor hi kelly um and then we also did some hhn updates which is halloween horror nights if you're not sure what that is um because they're getting ready for that so they're starting to set up oh josh sent some paypals on your phone mom so we'll check those out and oh he sent them to me too so here i got it no worries um so yeah go check out that vlog if you missed it including some really fun things like we went into diagon alley and they don't normally have uh, death eaters in there they usually only have them on the islands of adventure side and they actually um looks like they're gonna have them there this year by what we saw of them setting things up so go watch the vlog guys go give it a like all the things all right so we do have um a couple paypals here one is from uh, melissa melissa a she sent ten dollars on paypal says um thank you for taking time to show me all the magic of disney you're so welcome melissa thank you so much i'm just trying to show the pretty there we go yep so thank you so much melissa that's very sweet very kind and uh, Wendy H sent twenty dollars on PayPal and says, "Gift in honor of Mom's birthday." Aww, thank you. Thank you, Wendy. That's so sweet of you. Do you want to grab a cookie here, Mom? Because they're delicious. So thank you, Wendy. Looks like they do. Looks like they got quite a few, actually. Do you want to get two? That way, we have some for later if we want some. All right. Yeah, I want the m and but you can get whichever one you want. Two m and Um, Two m and cookies, please. Anything else? Nope, that's it. Right. It's going to be twelve seventy-six. Okay. And you take annual packs, right? We do. Okay. Nice okay. Yep. I know, me too, Allie. I'm so excited. Oh my goodness, them and Nocturne Alley will pro yeah, that'll freak me out. Wands at the ready for sure. I didn't even think about that. Oh my goodness. Now I got more excited. Yes, thank you so much for the PayPal's, everybody. Now you're getting hungry. hungry. Wish I could send you a cookie through the screen. M&M cookies. Joffrey's has the best M&M cookies. They have good tea here too. Not a fan of their coffee, but I like their tea. And cookies. Looks like you have to hit something over there. We're all set. Yep. Awesome. Do you want to put them in your bag there, Mom? That might not. Oh, that might. Can you fold them over? Yeah. They are more expensive, yeah. They don't have peanut butter here, but I heard they had some at um, Magic Kingdom. Do you need help or you got it? Okay. HHN, okay, so here's my take on HHN. I was so scared of it. I didn't even want to see like any of, any of it. Like I didn't even see how they decorated for it. It scared me. But I went for the first time during 2020 when they only had like two houses 
and it, it was free, like, well, not free, but it was included with your universal ticket. You didn't have to pay extra. So I went to the houses then, and I loved it. And then, m with my universal pass, I have the top pass, they give you a free HHN ticket. So the year after that, in 2021, um, Ivona and I went, um, and Dale and Kelly, and we had the best time ever. It was amazing. So now we're hooked. Last year we got the frequent fear. We're gonna get the frequent fear again. It's scary, I'm not gonna lie. But go with a group of friends and just go have fun. Laugh, we laugh so much, it's so awesome. Oh my goodness, look at the armadillo. <laughs> That's cute. Armadillo. I don't know where he's from, but it's cute. Yeah. Alrighty. So yeah, scary but fun. Oh, I didn't know Tiffany was going to be there. That's cool, Christopher. You're getting rain in Texas. Awesome. I mean, maybe that's awesome. Maybe it's not. I don't know. <laughs> if you're outside and trying to enjoy the day, it's not awesome. But you definitely, if you need it, then that's good. Definitely would help cool it off. Like here. Best part is hearing you two scream at HHN. Best therapy. <laughs> I know. We have so much fun. Oh, my goodness. I can't wait. Cannot wait to go again. It's like an adrenaline rush. You're like, oh, and then you get out and you're like, oh my goodness. <laughs> it's it's fun. Oh look, they do have some of the, the flowers still set up over here. Oh they do. Flower and garden. Yeah. Fake man. Let's go see the flowers. Ooh, cool, Chris is posting all the, the people that are gonna be here for uh, Eat to the Beat. Can't wait for Toby Mac too. It's gonna be epic. Still waiting to hear from Josh. I don't think I've heard anything yet. Make sure I didn't miss it. Hi, Gail. It's funny because when Josh goes H H N, he chuckles. <laughs> it's like it's like a scared laugh, right? Well, and Josh and I are going to opening day this year, so that's going to be a lot of fun. I think Dale might come with us too because he's got a frequent fear. Um, so yeah, it's going to be awesome. Hi, Jay Harry. We are in Epcot. It is very quiet today. It's very weird, but we're yeah. enjoying it. Yes, we are. Um, and sounds like um, Hollywood isn't too bad either because it was only a 40 minute or 35 minute for Tower of Terror, which is not bad. Hi, Tanina. How's it going? Welcome in. Happy Sunday, everybody. So mom and I are going to head to Starbucks. Probably let mom go ahead and get in line and then that way Josh, oh, looks like he is ready. Okay. Well, there we go. That worked out. So we are going to send you over to Josh. He is ready. Almost there. You guys are going to get to go ride Tower of Terror, spend some time at Hollywood Studios. And then whenever mom and I come back, we will be in um, Magic Kingdom. So, all right, guys. Let's get up here a little bit further. Trying to see the spaceship Earth here. Let's just go right here, Mom. All right, everybody, we're sending you over to Josh. Have fun on Tower of Terror. Actually, let's go over here because I can't see it. <laughs> trying to get a good spot, but the trees are in the way. There we go. All right, guys, have fun on Tower of Terror. We'll see you in a bit. We'll see you in a bit when we're at Magic Kingdom. Welcome to Hollywood Studios. We have hopped. 
we parked and we hopped, so we park hopped. So here we are at the tower. And we have, uh, we try to do this at each park. And we have, uh, hey everybody, we have a new park, new shirt. So, great movie ride. There you go. So I try to do a uh, different park or different shirt at each park. So I just thought that'd be fun. So I had Animal Kingdom at the last park and uh, we'll have Magic Kingdom for later. So there you go. I don't know if we, we can ride Runaway Railway or not in honor of Great Movie Ride, but we will see. So, welcome to Hollywood Studios, guys. Yep, you've been teleported. Park the car and hop, park hopping, that's right. Exactly, Myers and the Mouse. <laughs> welcome, Chester Cat. Yeah, the hopping is fun because, you know, the, the actual transportation is good too, and we'll do that again sometime. But it's fun sometimes to skip that and there's a lot more time in the stream actually enjoying the parks. So, thanks everybody. Yeah, it looks like there's not that many lightning lanes, so we should be going inside here pretty pretty quickly. The stream has been great today, such a good idea. This should be a once a month deal. Uh, yeah, Christopher. You know, we'll have to do these more often for sure. I think Jenna and mom and dad, we all like these more because too, everybody gets a break. So like now Jenna's been going for a while, so now she gets a break. She can charge her phone and you know, she can just uh, enjoy. So that's nice. Jeremy's coming, so hope you run. Okay, Karen, where should I find him? I can go back to the front after I'm done here to say hi to him. Hey, Candy. He may not know where he's going to be yet. I know it's the fastest park hopping ever. Instant hopping is awesome. Awesome. Hey, Thorin, I'm so glad you enjoy it. Oh my goodness, thanks everybody. Thanks, Jim. Jim's in Korea. Dad went home to feed the dogs because then he's gonna join us at Magic. So the dogs, you know, they're both a little older so they need to, they, they can't go a whole day without eating. So he went home to uh, get the dogs fed, get them outside and just make sure they're doing good. He can he can take a break too. And uh, then he'll be back. So dad is, um, he doesn't wanna, you know, he doesn't like to hit the parks quite as hard as we do anyway. So he likes a little break too. Tag team streams are awesome. Yes. Very cool, Janine. Sydney says, best ride ever. Yes, the Resort TV1 Network. That's right. Love that you're changing your shirt for each park. What a cool idea. Also makes me realize I need many more ride shirts from different parks. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> it's also nice when you're outside and just to change the shirt, you know, get a clean shirt. <laughs> yeah, charge her phone, she must. Yep. I just uh, sent Jenna a text, yep, to see what her next plans were. So we'll see. Yep. So I think she's going to head over to uh, Magic. We have uh, 199 from Nath uh, Nathaniel. 199 from Nathaniel Moran. Can you please go do Rise? Love you guys. Thanks, Nathaniel. I would love to, but I think it's a hundred and some minutes. So if it was down a little bit, I would, but I'm not sure if we have time for that. So Nathaniel, thank you for the super chat though. My favorite way to ride this ride is through Josh so I don't have to feel the stomach drop. Yeah, for sure, Allie. And we're almost there, so that's good. What a great stream. Thank you. Quality's great, no lag. Very good, very good. Oh yeah. I uh, actually had the quality cranked up really high. So that's good. Just joined. I am at Tower of Terror. There you go. Hello, Kay Tiki. Yesterday was Tower's birthday. Tammy, I didn't know that. Very cool. Well, let me know if you guys are ready for a little drop. We do costume changes very often. That's awesome, Ginger. I love that. Yeah, you guys, you guys had your outfits on point. That's right, Patrick. Thanks, Tanina. What family dog do you have? Oh, well, mom and dad have a dog named Murray. So, he's not on the streams because, you know, Jenna shows Chloe on the male streams and stuff, but uh, Murray's not around for that. Uh, we're going to do Happily Ever After. Yeah, so I'm going to head to Magic after this. I want to I want to go to Magic, too. But that way we could do all, all uh, four parks this way. 
I appreciate your job. Thanks, Candy. Yeah, big drop. They need uh, to clean this window. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> That's all part of the fun. Love the stream today. It's a great idea. Thanks, part of Dizwell. Come over to Rise. I may be able to figure out getting you in Lightning Lane if I am FOH. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want to get anybody in trouble. You say FOH. I'm not sure what that means, but you know, I don't want to. I don't want to break any rules or anything. But that was a nice offer. I mean, I'd love to ride it, but I'm not sure how that works. Hey, Trixie. Ooh, it feels great in here. Look, guys, isn't this cool? My daughter's excited about this. She won't ride in person. Oh, John, that's awesome. Yeah, it was so good to meet all you guys the other day. We'll do wide angle. It can be pretty chaotic as part of the fun. That's true. Well, and you don't have to, you know, you don't have to hurry to your next spot, you know, so you can, if you're running late, that's okay. Fun to do wide angle here. This is my favorite attraction on property. Love your Animal Kingdom stream. Thanks, Stephen. Hey, Paolo's Adventures. Murray's one in, it's in one of Jen and Dale's videos. That's right. Murray on Chloe's 14th birthday. That's true. Yeah, he's on there. So if you're watching Adventures of Jen and Dale, you'll see Murray. Thanks, everybody. My poor husband carries back carries a backpack full of outfit changes in each park. He's truly a trooper. Wow, Brooke, that's awesome. He's a good guy. That's a keeper. Hey, Deets, yep. <laughs> I love this ride, even though it drops. It scare me because it drops. Yeah, for sure. Here, I'll switch the camera back so you can get better. The thing about the ultra wide is it's good, but the color is better on the regular lens. They should call it Super Sunday. Yeah. Ah, oh, there you go. Yeah, Corey Ruprecht, I think we can set up so that the dogs can read the mail, right? Uh, Kurderf, S-E-K-50, uh, 50, 50 S-D-K, can you please say hi to um, Caroline in Sweden? Can you also visit the Dolphin Resort Hotel? Well, first of all, I don't know if we can visit the Dolphin this time. We have before, though. But hello, Caroline in Sweden. My family is from Sweden, too, originally. So that's pretty cool. Thank you for that. Appreciate it. Oh, is there a term for where they clean this, but they don't actually clean it? <laughs> it's pretty cool. I love how they have mail in the mailboxes, too. All the details, guys. And there's a little hidden message down there I can't show you right now, because we've got to keep moving. Cast members stay all the way down in their sleep. Watching the streams helped me become less scared of the ride. That's awesome, Tanina. I'm so glad. Turn this down just a little bit so we don't get any lag. Hey, Caitlin. The building is so cool. Yeah, the hidden message is take the stairs. It used to be, and I don't have a picture of this, but it used to be, it used to be Cursed Tower, You Will Die, which obviously was a little bit dark, so they changed it to be a little more family friendly. Hey, Victor, thanks for watching. Uh, so we're teleporting today. Yep, no transportation. Nope, not today. We're going to do something a little different. So that way we get to enjoy more. You get to enjoy more of the rides and stuff. We've done the transportation hopping, which is fun. And today we're doing something different. Uh, no, so we haven't done all four parks since uh, 2018, though, in one day. We've done six parks, actually. We did, I uh, believe we were the first to do a six park stream with. Uh, with um, Magic with all four Disney World parks and then both California parks. We did that once. That was the most recent uh, park hopping like this we did. And then after 2020, we didn't do any more because it was harder. We just didn't. We could have. Hey, Lynn. Oh, watching from the ER. I hope that your mom is okay. My goodness. 
Where from Sweden are they coming from? I believe Suna Varmland or something. In just a few moments, the library doors in front of you will Sorry, be Sorry, said that wrong probably. Please stand back from the doors as they will be open in Tokyo. Thank you. Uh, Robin, I'm sorry your chat wasn't working. You might want to delete and reinstall your app. Sometimes that helps. Sometimes that helps. I got it full up today. trying to show you guys ever since. <laughs> Alright, let me see if I can get my brightness back up so I can see whatever's going on. As Kim says, the video quality looks amazing. Great. Glad. I had it turned down a little bit, but I'm glad it looks good still. It does lag back there a little bit, but looks like we're good. And if you have your, uh, Natisha says she feels like she missed something once she's, because it's live. All you got to do is uh, rewind. You can watch any of it from the very beginning. The whole thing is on. I may do, um, I may go ahead and do Smuggler's Run after this because I can do Single Rider, hopefully. All right, Christopher. I love that that's a face. And yes, I point out a lot of the same things every time, but you know, we have new people watching, so. Uh, oh, Jen can do TTA before we get there. We can do it multiple times. It wouldn't be a Resort TV One stream if we didn't do TTA multiple times. <laughs> <Thanks. coughs> Sorry, got something stuck in my throat. All right, I'm good. Should I go left or right? Left or right? I think we're gonna go right. We're going right. Eleven times. Wow, crazy Disney nerd. That's amazing. DHS. Yeah, it's pretty crowded. A lot of the wait times are over a hundred minutes. So much for that whole Disney's not crowded thing. <laughs> 
No, and it is a little bit less crowded in some ways, but still pretty crowded. Yes, Smuggler's Run does have a single rider. And we have taken the express elevator a couple times. Where I'm landing in Sweden, it's like the shine in the Lord of the Rings. The shine. Oh, wow. Farmland, that's so cool. My dad uh, visited it. Uh, he visited the town uh, not too long ago. They went and found where his great grandfather lived. His name was Axel, my great grandfather, who came over to the U.S. from uh, Sweden when he was 18. And my um, my son is named after him. So, anyway, kind of cool. We have yeah, the history is so fun. Yeah, we're about on the ride. We just have to wait over here. I probably should have gone the other way, but you never know. Yeah, we did hear about the Heartland uh, Park. It's not, it looks cool. I don't know if I'll be able to get there, but um, looks cool. I've been. I like Oklahoma. Uh, we recommend the stairs. Yeah, Park Hoppers. How are you guys doing? Thanks for being here. They did uh, Haunted Mansion all day yesterday. How many rides did you guys get in there? I checked in a couple times, didn't chat, I was just checking real quick because we were celebrating mom's birthday yesterday, so I didn't have a whole lot of time, but uh, we were having a great time, mom, so. Any characters out of Hollywood uh, Jacob wants to know? Uh, I don't know. Let's just see. If I see some, I'll say hi to him for sure. Jason says, point the camera at the top. Jason, I would love to do that. I don't know if the gimbal will allow me to do that. Oh, I can try it though. They got 13. Wow, that's pretty. That's a pretty good number there. Especially since it's like you know unlucky 13. Hey, Disney pass holder. Yeah, I went right back here. Yeah, <laughs> I'm solo. <laughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Awesome. Where do you want me? Row six. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, I know Stream Finder. It's too bad they put people in the basement, right? <laughs> Happy birthday to your mom. Thanks for checking in. We rode Spooky 13 times. That's awesome. Hey, that's hard work, guys. Lots of waiting in line. To our for your safety, welcome aboard. Okay. That pays to be a single rider for sure. That's cool. Let's see, pointing up, I, like, I don't know if it'll work. I'm a little worried about the gimbal. It's a cool idea though. If I get too much G-force on the gimbal, it will go wacky. You were the 
passengers and most of the common elevator are about to ascend into your very own next the Twilight Zone. One stormy night long ago, five people stepped through the door. That door is opening once again, and this time, it's opening for you. discover what lies beyond the fifth dimension, beyond the deepest, darkest corner of imagination, in the Tower of Terror. Sorry about a little bit of lag. I forgot to uh, I forgot to do the silly little connect to Wi-Fi thing. You know, you, you have to all back. Sorry, I, yeah, I had the Wi-Fi, but it didn't work. So, all right, there we go. Perfect. We're back. Yeah, it was a little bit rougher signal today in that area, but that's all right. We still have fun. All right, let's go check out the rest of Hollywood Studios. Yeah, I didn't catch back up on its own either. It just I had to I had to start and stop to get it back. But that was fun. <clears throat> I tried to look up a little bit, um, but yeah, I feel like it would have made me sick looking up too. <sighs> so I did look up for a second. I was like, Ooh. I was like, okay, I can't do that. But I did point up a little bit. Video quality is amazing. Thanks, Natisha. Appreciate that. Yep. It's, uh, it's about to be a lot more amazing. There we go, how's that? It's only 35 for tower. Hope everybody's having an amazing day so far and enjoying this four park extravaganza. I love doing this. 
And like I said, we haven't done this since 2018, so. Crazy, I look back when I was making the thumbnail, I was like, has it really been that long? But it sure has. Let's see, what it, okay. Sorry, I missed some chat here. Hard to see. All right, let me turn the uh, brightness up here so I can see what you guys are saying. That's better. Put my sunglasses on so my eyes get used to the bright light. What gimbal do I use? It's the Moza Mini MX. That Moza Mini MX. I had an Amazon affiliate link, but I forgot to, uh, I, I keep forgetting to put that on our video, so I'll, I'll do that pretty soon. Well, if you guys want to buy some of the stuff we use, you can buy it, and then we, we actually get like a referral credit on that, which is kind of cool. All right. Thanks, Kathy. No, it's not too crowded. It's, you know, it's normal. Like, I feel like it's like a little bit lighter than normal. It's just not a big difference, though. Nope, not using Genie Plus today. We didn't really need it. We're not going to do tons of rides at each park. We're just doing a few at each park. So I figured out we could wait in some lines today. Uh, send you the affiliate link. Uh, it's actually on my... Where did I put it? Oh, it's on one of my Thursday Thoughts videos. What do you need to do to, to go to Disney? I've got the affiliate links on there. Let me see. Moppers, maybe one of you can pull it up. I have a Thursday Thoughts video that talks about what to bring to Disney, and the affiliate links are on that one. I just need to add it to all the streams. I don't know why I haven't done that. Probably just, I forgot. <laughs> anyway, my eyes are burning. Donald is going to be out soon. Jacob, uh, all about the characters. That's cool. I'll like me some characters too. Well, we can go over there. We're not that far. We can look at least. I don't mind. Oh, I didn't look back at Tower. How dare I? I didn't get the, the down Sunset Boulevard view. How dare I? All right. <laughs> so still 3,300 awesome people in the chat today. It's uh, really pretty awesome. Last time we did this, I think we struggled to hit like five or 600. So maybe, maybe maybe 800 I don't know we were not definitely not at a thousand at that point when we last did this thanks MWA Dalton bring your patience yes Laura for sure uh, did they already reopen rock and roll coaster yeah I believe it's open there it is thank you Allie for posting that yeah so on those that the, the affiliate links are on there so I didn't see what park hopper said what was and Myers and I said, "Oh my gosh, that's brutal." I didn't see the, the wait time was wait times were high yesterday, though, from what I could gather. Clear drops. Yeah, I have some. I, I used to have some drops in my bag, and I didn't bring them. But mine's just getting sweat or sunscreen in, in my eyes. So if I have contacts, it'll clear up here pretty soon. All the all the crying I'm doing right now. <laughs> all right, and here's the Chinese theater in all its glory. The heat, oh, one one eleven, yeah, it was hot. It's getting warmer again today, but we've been pretty lucky today with that. All right, let me check. Let me check the uh, the app here real quick for wait times. Jenna's heading to Magic, so. We're going to hang out here for a little while while she heads over there. 45. Oh, there's Daisy. 45 for Runaway. 45 for um, Smuggler's Run. So, we'll see. I, I wouldn't mind doing uh, Runaway Railway if it really is 45, but a long time to be in line. Let's stroll the park a little bit. Oh, there's Daisy. Everybody say hi to Daisy. There you go, Jacob. 
Hi, Daisy. Hi, Daisy. <laughs> you look fabulous as always. <laughs> yes, I'm <laughs> Bye. <laughs> 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 Don't mean a thing. Well, I love me some jazz. Tom Eldridge, thanks so much for today's stream. Loving it. Hope you, Jenna, Mom, and Dad are having a great, big, beautiful Sunday. We sure are. Oh, Natisha, we're glad you're here. Hey, Bit Ritz. Is it just me or is, not, is it not a long line over here? Let's check this out real quick. It, it's not outside, so that makes... Yeah, that's not even outside. We're, I think we're just doing it, guys. But I do want to switch connections here in a minute. Or is there a standby closed? I'm confused. No, it's not closed. It's just not outside, like at all. Okay, we're, we're going. All right, guys. Stay tuned, I'm gonna switch our connection real quick out, if you guys don't mind. So let me, uh, yeah, look at that, huh? It says 50, but it's not even outside. All right. We got a new Hollywood Studios BRB. It's just right here, that won't take long. All right, I'll be right back. Enjoy the new BRB. was fun. I love that music. It's from the Great Movie Ride. Just like my shirt. Let me see if I can. And I took that picture. Oh, I should have left it on more. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That was a bad place to stop. I was just listening to it. That's funny. I almost did. I should have, I should have come back right when he said, action. <laughs> that was great. At least we get to wait inside. I, I think it'll be worth it to wait for this, don't you guys? And action. Yeah, let's get let's help us get to 179,000. Yeah, Jacob, this is Runaway Railway. Let me try something real quick. Hooray for Hollywood. Cheshire Cat, I watched your new Retro Tech video last night where you installed an SSD in an old Toshiba. It's so fascinating. Thanks, Cheshire Cat. Yeah, and actually, I have a way now to uh, fit it in there better and to take the case off of it. Um, so I'm not using it anyway. And you can take the plastic shell off of it and it'll fit just fine. So I watched somebody do it on YouTube, so you know, it must be true. <laughs> but no, actually, it's, it's kind of cool. There's just a tiny little circuit board in there. So yeah, please go and subscribe to my new um, channel, Retro TV One Tech. There it is right there. There's the new video. So yeah, didn't get a whole lot of views, but said not a lot of our people are interested in uh, retro tech. But I'm going to keep doing it because I enjoy it. It's kind of like my little my little passion project. So if you guys would go watch that, I would appreciate it. If not, hopefully we'll get the uh, retro community interested here pretty soon. But yeah, it takes time. <laughs> it does take time. Do you have a Steam Deck? I don't actually. 
Uh, Jacob, I probably won't wait to see Mickey and Minnie. Uh, probably won't have time for that. I need to head to Magic here in a minute, or after you know Jen and Mom get there. So, yep, no worries. I'm just I don't usually wait and stay in line for characters that much, but we did see some, so that's good. Thanks everybody for uh, all the moppers posting the link. I appreciate it. Thanks moppers. Yeah, I'll be driving from each park, one park to the other. How did you get the photo for the Be Right Back? There were no people. So that was my birthday last year. We were there for a <coughs> um, media event. And um, at the media event, we ended up being some of the last people in there. And uh, there was nobody in there, so we got the picture uh, during the media event. I do have a Coke and cookies and Tisha, thanks for asking. Speaking of which, let me get another drink. So I could put that BRB on and you could listen to the, a little bit more of it if you want, or we can stand here and chat, it's up to you. It's a fun little, uh, fun little tune for sure. That's the uh, overture from Great Movie Ride. I love this though, we get to really study the inside of this awesome building here while we're waiting. definitely not empty. I know a lot of people are saying that on the news and whatever else, but it's not empty for sure. Uh, no, never ridden tower with lights on. We did, well, we were there with lights on one time when it broke down, but the ride, the ride had already stopped. I'm going to got cookies too. Nice. All right. Thanks, Kathleen. Yeah, it was fun, wasn't it? Oh, we'll wait till we get through here. This is fun to see. Uh, no, probably won't bring back the great movie ride because it's, uh, you know, this one's gone already. I don't have a way to film the ride to magic right now. I don't have any kind of a place to, I don't usually do driving streams, so I don't really have a place to like plug in my phone. I do have a, um, I do have a camera for my, like I, um, accident safety camera or whatever my car, but to get the videos off of that, it doesn't work very well. Anyway, hopefully you guys do enjoy what we do offer you. So we're probably not going to be taking a lot of requests today, but just enjoy. Oh, that's cool, crazy Disney nerd. <clears throat> Walked off buzz. The lights all come on. Dash cam, thanks. I couldn't think of the name of it. I gotta get the Halloween BRB out, that's right, that's right. I'm trying to think. Uh, yeah, we, we do wanna say thank you to some of our sponsors. I know Jenna talked about magicbandreaders.com, but you, you see those Magic Band Readers right there. If you want, you can get your very own Magic Band Reader, just like that, from magicbandreaders.com. MagicBandReaders.com. Yeah, we'll walk through Galaxy Jets. I'll probably go do a Smuggler's Run after this. So MagicBandReaders.com. So go check them out and use code RESORT15 for 15% off. MagicBandReaders.com. RESORT15 for 15% off. Uh, let me see here. I can pull up the video of it real quick. There. That's another what one, what one of them looks like. MagicBandReaders.com. Use code RESORT15 for 15% off. We also have <coughs> um, Davis DVC Rentals. DVCRequest.com slash TV. If you want to uh, rent a DVC room for a fraction of the cost, that's Davis DVC Rentals. DVCRequest.com slash TV. We'll do the wide angle in here. Now, 
That's dvcrequest.com slash TV. You can rent a DVC room even if you're not a member. Very, very well done here. Oh, Noel, enjoy the movie. Can you play the Bards Burn Off? Yeah, I love that one. Uh, Tanina, there are a ton of hidden Mickeys in here. I don't know in this room, though. Probably somewhere. Right, Ginger. I don't want to say it out loud, just in case. Yes, theoretically. <laughs> that one, yeah. You wish Disneyland would have kept Tower of Terror? Yeah, a super fun ride. But Guardians is fun too. So this is the uh, Runaway Railway. Hopefully we get to... There's not a lot of lightning lanes, so hopefully we get to go in here in a bit. Definitely won't be 50. It is kind of cool having two different versions of the tower, that's true. That kind of sounds like the fairy, the, the fairy music on Zelda. I really appreciate it when you scan with the camera like that. It's exactly what I do with my eyes when I'm standing in line. Oh, thanks Mystic Disney, that's cool. I try. Yes, we bought tickets for Jollywood Nights already. Yep, we're gonna be there, opening night. I don't know if it's sold out yet. Hi guys. Sir, I'm sorry, can't have the other talks in here. If you want to set up, you can just go to the place and you can catch up with your house. Thank you. Appreciate you guys. Post 613, new subscriber. Welcome. Hey, Alex. Thanks for an excellent day. You're very welcome. Yeah, this artwork is gorgeous. All right, I'll tell you what. Why don't you enjoy, uh, now that we're in, the, in the, the dense part of the line, why don't you enjoy the BRB for a second? And um, you can, uh, can definitely um, hear some of the awesome music. And I'll watch it with you. I'll be right back. All right, so we'll do a little BRB. We'll enjoy it together. We'll be back hopefully in time to ride the ride. Unless we'll chat amongst ourselves. Oh, Jollywood Nights is the new party that they're going to do here at Hollywood Studios. Yeah, so yeah, enjoy that BRB for a second.
Welcome back, everybody. Isn't that fun? I could get this music. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be kind of hard, but it'd be fun. That particular arrangement might be hard, but that is, is a really, really, really beautiful, beautiful one. Glad you guys enjoyed that. And yeah, the reason I had Epcot on first, because it's hard for me, there's a delay in the stream, so when I start the server for the BRB, it's hard for me to know exactly where it cuts. So I don't have any, I don't have anybody like on a control board, it's just me. Uh, so that, but yeah, if you're wondering why I did that, that's why I did that. And then why it went, it, it actually looped because I, could, I couldn't get it to, uh, take, to go off. But it's still pretty cool tech. Almost there. It's got to go around. Yeah, isn't that fun music is so, so, oh, I found the line. Yeah, that's all right. Not that far. So classic, though. I were really close. I miss great movie as well. The Osborne Family Lights, yes, I miss that too with the snow. Big deal. That's right, Janine. <laughs> I think it's up next on the cow and your great big rabbit. That's what they were saying. Yeah, I didn't know that. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah, for sure. Lisa, Joey, Keith, yeah, for sure. Great memories. Yeah, we just have to get back to this door here and then we're there. I don't know how long I've been in line, but maybe 20 minutes. It's worth it. A lot of the wait times are inflated for sure. But I think I do think that they Oh thanks Leo for sending that uh, that Facebook message. I'm not very good at checking those sometimes. I need to do better. But yeah, I know Disney does that because you know it's easier if they overestimate a wait time, people will be mad if it's a lot more than what they said. Says it's 60, interesting. It might have gotten way longer. Here we go. Yep, Timothy, we're in Runaway Railway. Almost there. Yeah, that's right, Joey's world. A lot has changed at Hollywood Studios, for sure. 18 minutes, wow, Ollie, that's not bad at all. And we're, we're almost... We're about to move quite a bit here. All right, we're in the final stretch. Any VR of great movie? Right? I have a, a couple of really nice ones, but no VR. We didn't have any VR back in 2017. Somebody might have. Oh, Tanina, that's cool. I love Muppets. My son and I did that one the other day. Doing great with ride timing. Yeah, it's been fun. It's been a fun day. Well, thanks for joining us, guys. Refresh the stream where you let the ads play out. Thank you, that really helps, yes. It really helps to let the ads play. Thank you, thank you, thank you.
whole lot of people live right now, so that's kind of cool. It's very rare. Usually there's a ton of people live at the same time, but it looks like maybe just us and I don't know who else. Maybe one or two more people. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Thank you. Here we go. Yeah, thanks, Jossa family. Any new vids on Resort TV and Homes? We did the Sunshine Skyway vid, uh, bridge, <clears throat> but other than that, nope. We haven't had time to film anything, so. be something new, but I have uh, on uh, Retro TV One Tech, I have a new video. So go check that out, Retro TV One Tech. I still say MGM sometimes. Uh, Kelly, hi Shannon. Yeah, Tanina, he loves the Muppets. He loves the old school Muppets too. We've been watching the original Muppet show and he can do the whole intro. <laughs> oh yeah, let's see if we're getting close to 179K here. We are, oh, only 25 away. Only 25 away from 179K. Only 25. Pretty awesome. 25 away. Pouring here in Palm Bay. Wow. Thank you for all you do. This is incredible. The time and effort. Words can't explain how you, um, mom, dad, and Jennifer got me through low times. Well, Nikisha, first of all, I'm sorry to hear that you've had some rough times, but secondly, I'm glad that we've helped get you through. So these are my favorite hidden Mickeys up here. Hi, Shell. Disna, hello. Here, hold on just a second. There we go. Ready? So there's, if you can see it, it's right there. Pretty cool. Love this music. I just, I love old cheesy music. It's like game show music and I love it. I'm here for it. This takes me back to my childhood. With all the changes over the years, what is your current favorite attraction? Attraction, Probably Rise, but also uh, I love Rock and Roller Coaster. Hi, how are you? <laughs> That's having fun? Yes. Awesome. And there's one up here too, you can still see it. Yeah, Ginger, it's very subtle. Yeah, we're getting close to uh, 200K, about 21K away. Uh, do they have these lights at Grand Destino? I'm not sure. These are more Asian style. Not sure if they have those there or not. They could. I do like how they theme this new area very much like the rest of the um, the rest of the um, place. Oh yeah, there is one on the wall technically. I mean, you could kind of say that's one, I guess. I agree with rides. It's one of the few rides where I genuinely enjoy going through the line. Nice. Hoping you guys hit 200K by 2024. Yes. <clears throat> oh yeah, I think we will. Hopefully. We'll see. Well, we're going to work hard. No shortage of working hard here, but we enjoy it, you know? What's your favorite live entertainment in the parks? Oh, gee. I'd say it used to be like some of the guitar guys at Disney Springs, but <clears throat> I'm not sure who it is now. Oh, by the way, there's another one right there. Hidden Mickey on the wall. Yep. Uh, Eli, 499. Thank you, Josh and Jenna, for the live stream today. I've been here since the beginning. Thank you, Eli. I appreciate that very much. For Eli Sluice, thank you so much for the super chat. <clears throat> and there we go. Oh, 
Yeah, we'll get right up there. All right, I'm gonna do <clears throat> switch to wide angle here, guys. Look at this, huh? Never stood this close. this here Loki motive? Well, I guess, Goofy, but are you going to help me fix the screen? Thanks. Be back in a jiffy to pick you all up. Well, my friends, I guess I'll have to call Donald for some duct tape. <laughs> <laughs> uh, call Donald for the duct tape. That's fun. All right. I'm going to switch. It might rot lag for just a second. I'm going to switch off. There we go. We're back. Just a little blip. I fixed it. I got on the right connection now, and we're good. Welcome back, everybody. And again, in honor of Hollywood Studios and Great Movie Ride, I have my Great Movie Ride shirt on. There you go. So, yeah. Change shirts at every park. Why not? Because, you know, it's fun. So, yeah. There you go. If you can see, it says, that's a wrap. So, super fun. And, uh, yeah, we will enjoy the ride. Bum, bum, bum. We'll do a couple, we'll do maybe a smuggler's run here and do, go through Galaxy's Edge and I bet by then Jenna will be ready to go at Magic Kingdom and uh, we'll send you over there. Oh, see she's already at TTC. And I'm doing Runaway Railway now. And maybe we'll do Smuggler's Run. And then, maybe send it to you after that. Here you go. I can walk around Galaxy's Edge too. I'm glad we got to ride this. We didn't wait that long. It was I don't, it's, it's a long ride or I would, I would totally show great movie ride on here through our BRB system, but I don't want to, um, I don't want to have you guys off the stream for that long, so it's a long ride. Oh, uh, uh, Tanine, I'm so glad you found this channel too. Xavier says hi. Hi, Xavier. Well, howdy, everybody. It's me, Engineer Goofy. <laughs> Whoa, welcome to Railroad. 
safety while wiping on the train. Oh, yep, you got your hopper friends here, that's right. Thank you, Joy's World, yep. yep. If you want to support the stream, you can, but it's always always appreciated, never expected. So we do have the, the PayPal, we get about 95% of that. And uh, there's also Patreon. And we post some videos on there too. So patreon.com slash resort TV one. Or just download the Patreon app. That's as little as $1 a month or um, there's the super chat. So, you, but, but like I said, any of that is voluntary and it's just uh, is kind of like icing on the cake. So we just appreciate you being here. Hi there, Engineer Goofy here. For your safety on board the train, please keep your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside your train car at all times. Be sure to stay in your seats and keep a watchful eye. Okay, thanks. Hola, pasajeros. Durante nuestro viaje en tren, para su seguridad, mantengan sus manos, brazos, pies y piernas dentro de I found you guys a couple years ago on 4th of July. That's awesome. Uh, Trixie, I'm glad you found us. Hey, Surf Bum, how are you? Yeah, it was a great a short wait, Kelly, for sure. All right. How many? One? Just one? We're going to row seven. Oh, row seven. I don't usually get the back car. That's kind of fun. That means we get to hear the, uh, the, the squid playing trumpet a little longer. I love the squid that plays muted trumpet. I mean, who doesn't love a squid that plays trumpet? Hey, Plymouth Rock. Now, old Mr. Young Dude says, that's why I use PayPal, because you get most of it. Yes. And just for reference, old Mr. Young Dude sent $100, which was so super generous. And we got, um, we got $97 of that. So yeah, so basically all but $3. So it's very, very good. Whereas on YouTube, if, if you send $100, we would get 70 of it. Uh, so it's a pretty big difference. So thank you, old Mr. Young Dude, so much. Uh, definitely um, PayPal's a little bit better for that kind of thing. It just doesn't flash up on the screen, which is fine either way. Either way, thank you so much, old Mr. Young Dude, and everybody for supporting the stream. Thanks, Jennifer. I love it. You gotta love a squid that plays trumpet. Uh, Tanita's getting rain. Playing squid is named Neil. Yeah, <laughs> enjoy, guys.
like when you're in school and the teacher is waiting for everybody to be quiet. <laughs> Apologies, I don't usually talk during rides, but I could not help it when Daisy was <laughs> quiet there. I was like, the teacher is the teacher waiting for the class. <laughs> anyway. All right, time for Coke, yeah. I may uh, may get my water in and uh, stuff, but yeah, we'll see, hold on. All right, tons of people watching, thanks for being here. It is time, time for a Coke, yes, for sure. Sorry, this is where this phone sometimes decides it won't let go of things. The old phone didn't have this problem, but the new phone will find a tower it likes and it'll just hold on to it. Even if it gets really weak, it won't grab the new tower. Well, hopefully they'll get it back. This is fun. So we should be good now. And yeah, we never used to have any lag on that ride, but it's just this new phone. But I take the good with the bad. Uh, I really appreciate David too, uh, DMB David, sending us the money to buy it for sure because it, it helps so much with the charging. That's the biggest thing. Is Rise still in Bima with Kylo? You know, it's kind of on and off, I think, from what I understand. <coughs> That's my favorite part. How many hidden Mickeys can you find? What would you call this style of music? It's almost like a game show type of thing. You think the music teacher should know, but I really don't. It's like game show, show tune, I don't know. Not really a show tune. 
I may not be a fan of the ride, but the busted screen as a door into the queue is very cool. And actually, it's cool that you come back out of it, too. Hey, Sunshine, how are you? Uh, if you hit the same park twice at the count of five, sure, I'd say so. Why not? Good to see you guys, Sunshine. Yeah, smooth jazz, bossa, a little bit of bossa, maybe. Vaudeville, hold music, I love it. Ambient amusement music. Elevator music, I love it. I think Bossa is probably the closest. But it's also got that organ in there, which is not always in Bossa. Boom. Oh, boom. Lounge Lizard, that's a good one too. Muzak. It's like a guilty pleasure, this kind of style of music. It's like, it is a guilty pleasure for me. I'm not that guilty though. Bum, 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 bum. But it is cool. They have literally a full-size theater, just like the one you came in and out of. So there's literally no way you'd ever know that you didn't just come directly out of the same room. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. But it's also got a game show feel to it too. I know. It reminds me of a simpler time. Les Baxter has some great songs like this. I gotta, I gotta write that down then. Yes, I'm sorry to hear about Tony Bennett. Interlude music. That's a good one, Paul. Is it Les Baxter? I gotta look that up now. All right, guys, we better go. 70s game show. Tell them what they have won. That's right. You heard it here first, Johnny. <laughs> anyway, it's so fun. I always stand in there if that song's going on. Okay, I am going to have to take a BRB and go take a little restroom break. So if you guys want to enjoy that music for a minute. It does sound like some of the Wii music too. The Wii Shop Channel music is so good. It's very similar style to that, actually. So, <laughs> I was about to turn down the sun. I was like, wait, well, yeah, I can't turn down the actual sun. I was like, man, it's bright. <laughs> All right, so yeah, I'm gonna, Jenna's not ready yet, I don't think, so I'm gonna take a real quick restroom break and then we'll go explore Galaxy's Edge. So, stay tuned for some awesome BRB. You can enjoy the great movie ride BRB again. Look up ultra lounge songs, amazing compilations of this music. Awesome. I just, I love that. It's just so relaxing, you know? There we go. Let's see. Not sure where I saved that to. I saved it. I'm not sure where I saved it to. It'll probably end up on the channel somewhere. <laughs> All right. I'll be right back, guys. Uh, so Dad actually went home to uh, feed the dogs. So he will be back in a bit. But he'll meet me at Magic Kingdom. Because uh, he was going to take care of Chloe and Murray. All right. So, anyway... Uh, here, let me just, I'll just send you right over to the Hollywood Studios BRB. So I'll be right back.
Welcome back, guys. Your coach captain is saying some crazy stuff. I can imagine. <laughs> All right. We're back and better than ever. There we go. So, thanks for being here. We're going to head to Galaxy's Edge. 
I got to uh, wash my face a little bit so I wasn't getting wasn't getting everything in my eyes. Wonder Years, narrated by John T Don Cheadle. That's so cool. All right, I'll have to check that out. Always love the reboots of the old series. So I always worry a little bit about um, what's the next original idea, right? I love that there's, you know, I love their sitcoms, sitcoms on. I hope that they can do more sitcoms because I miss sitcoms. And I, Wonder Years is one for sure, but it's kind of more of a drama type thing. Sometimes it's a sitcom depending on how they do it. But anyway, I miss sitcoms. All right. We were watching Family Matters, Full House, and all that stuff the other night, and it's just, you know, I just miss those kind of shows. What did I get for lunch? Oh, we got a burger. <laughs> Pretty predictable. My dad and I did. Yep. Is there a general hospital sign? Oh, yeah, there was one back there. I missed it, I guess. Like, I saw it, but I didn't show it. I didn't show it. All right. Oh, what? Okay. Oh, there we go. I was like, what's happening with the gimbal right now? It is not happy. Hold on, guys. Just a second. Gimbal not happy. Oh, I see what's going on. Okay. All right, we're good. Sorry, guys. I went for a ride. Full House Family Matters. Boy Me uh, Corey Meets... Or not Corey Meets World. Boy Meets World. <laughs> I said Corey Meets World. That's a different channel. Yeah, exactly. All that stuff is so good. All right. Give me just a second. Perfect. All right, and we're back. And there we go. Yeah, it's fine. It's just this phone doesn't allow me to doesn't allow me to uh, put the gimbal on a very good balance, so it gets very angry if I mess around with it too much. <sighs> hey, Princess Kristen, happy Sunday! I've been binging the office all weekend. Nice. Yeah, you know, and that's why it's so um, just. I met a hopper just uh, right before I came back from break. Um, you know, and that's just, they were like, oh, you know, a lot of people say, we watch you every Friday. And it's just so nice, like, you know, that you know, at least for some people, we've become a little bit of a Friday night tradition for people. And, you know, even if it's a couple thousand people or, you know, if it's 179,000 people, I don't think it's everybody, obviously, but it's a lot of people. And I appreciate that. The gimbal's still on Tower Terry. Tower Terry. Rich, I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Especially, you know, I get breaks every once in a while. So it's nice. It's easier to go longer when you get a few breaks. So Jenna's taking her break now, and, and then we'll be together here in a little bit. Let's see if we've hit our, see if we've hit 179 yet. Uh, we are 16 away from 179K, 16. So if you're new, please subscribe. Now, I'm not asking anybody to subscribe with a, uh, with an additional account or anything. I only want, you know, I want, uh, I want real subscriptions. So, you know, obviously if, you have multiple people in your family and they all want to subscribe, that's fine, they don't have to. But uh, I definitely want the subscriptions to be real. But if you're on here and you haven't subscribed yet, it's free. And uh, yeah, nothing can stop us now. There's Goofy. You're the new TGIF. Thanks, Jonathan. My, my daughter's moving down two weeks to be the Disney College program for five months. Yeah, Josie, I hope we find her as well. Resort TV on a pizza is the best kind of Friday. I love that. We used to do TGIF and pizza. There's Goofy. I don't know if Jacob's still in here, but he wanted to see the characters. So there's one. I don't want to get any closer because we've got families that waited in line to meet him. I don't want to get in the way of that, but that's pretty cool. I watch you guys like I used to watch a TV show, the new TGIF. That's awesome, Wendy. That's what I was kind of thinking. And I was like, man, that's... It's so great. We're not as funny, but <laughs> we tried. I am down to my last bottle of water, so I'll refill before I get to uh, get to magic. Oh, thanks, Kelly. So here, let me check. Uh, by the way, speaking of people being generous, we, we did get another PayPal while I was on Runaway Railway. Hoping my order shipped. I, I ordered another retro laptop because it was ten dollars, and it worked. Like, couldn't pass it up. It's ten dollars and a working working retro laptop. I'm gonna have to stop doing that because. Uh, you know, eventually I'm going to run out of room, but I love it. All right, so uh, Cynthia. Cynthia sent $10 on PayPal and says, enjoying the stream. Thank you. Thank you so much, Cynthia. We appreciate that very, very much. So everybody thanks Cynthia on the stream. We appreciate her very much. It does not look very long for this ride. 
I don't really want to take too long to do it, but it's pretty awesome. 45. Oh, it's tempting, it's tempting, it's tempting, it's tempting. Oh, it's so tempting. It's so tempting. Or I could just walk around here. I don't know. Uh, okay, so. Let's see. That's fine. I will eat before I leave. Rise is only 45 and I'm trying to decide whether to ride or not. Only problem is I don't want to mess everything up. I know it's so tempting, but if it actually is 45, I don't know. I guess maybe Jenna could take it for a little bit while I'm in line, but I don't know. I'm also down for a stroll too. What do you guys want to do? It doesn't look like 45. Maybe I'll just do it. I don't know. Yeah, we could do Lightning McQueen. I really like this ride. I really like this ride. I, I kind of want to do it. I kind of want to do it. My feet are walking back that direction. Not sure what's happening right now. I'm not sure what's happening. Oh yeah, I'd probably push part two back to about eight o'clock. I want this one to be longer uh, so that it gets more more views and stuff on it. All right. Go ahead, you're fine. <laughs> you're good. It is outside, but I don't know, we'll see. Okay, period. Do you want to take it for a bit while I'm in line? Or I can keep it. Oh, I like Rise more. Eh, this is longer than I thought, for sure. This might... Ugh. I have what you say, I have all day, but I know, but it goes fast, man. It goes real fast. YouTubers don't get to skip the line pass. Nope, we sure don't. One time, one time, they gave us a, a few fast passes, but no. Uh, YouTubers don't get, no, we don't get any anything like that. Every once in a while, they invite us to a media event, but no. it if you want to eat now. I mean, it's moving. Backside of water. Yeah, Dad, Dad uh, went back home for a little bit. He'll be back. Thirty-five. Okay, I don't think it's gonna be that long. I probably will send you to Jennifer a bit. Uh, you know, just so uh, you can say hi to her. So I know the queue is cool, but you know what? Uh, we'll see some of it. They should have a line just for the YouTubers. No, I don't want to be. I don't know. You guys know our mom and dad pretty much. I, I grew up, you know. I grew up to know that, you know, we ain't special. <laughs> but, uh, no, I want everybody to have the same experience, so I'm good with waiting. And it's our, you know, it's always our, our choice if we want to wait or not, just like everybody else. So a lot of people, I think, uh, when somebody somebody asked me the other day, sent me a message and said, hey, are you guys going to the Halloween party on August 18th? And I said, no, we're not because we're going on the 11th. And they said, oh, I thought... 
that um, YouTubers get free tickets to the Halloween parties. I was like, no, we really don't. Every once in a while, some people do. We've never gotten one, and that's fine. We're happy to pay for it. So, yeah, we pay for all of our own stuff, just like everybody else. I wish. <laughs> you know? But actually, actually, I don't wish. I'm glad that we have what we have. Thanks, Oak, Oak, Oak Forest boys. And, you know, and it's fine, like I said. Now, we also have, oh, wow, only two more. Two more to 179K. Let me see if I can pull it up here real quick. Two more. Go subscribe. Two more. Glad to hear many use Disney and Disney uses them. Yeah, no, we're, we have a good relationship with them, though. Our people, our Disney people always say, tell the truth. You know, just follow the rules and tell the truth. That's all they ask from us. So, hey, Jen, how are you? Go Bills, Buffalo friends, nice. Two more, two more. But yeah, we'll go say hi to Jenna for a minute. Because, you know, let's be honest, this part of the queue is not that interesting, but I'll come on before the pre show for sure. Now, you guys might be able to see it when it, when it turns over to 179. We only need two more. Let me see. Oh, we got it. That was easy. We got it. Yay. Thanks, everybody. Awesome. Everything is awesome. <laughs> we got it. Lester's Possum Park, $5. Thank you for the sun and fun. Hope you get to 180K soon. Thanks, Lester. Yeah, I always like to tell people that, that you know we don't get the special treatment that I think a lot of people think that we do. And that's fine. Like I said, we're happy to, happy to just enjoy the park. So. All right, everybody. Mom and Dad have done a great job creating, um, you, Jenna, Mom and Dad have done a great job creating your brand of YouTube channel. Thank you. I appreciate that. Well, I'm very, we're very proud of, you know, what we built, but we're also very humbled by it. It's pretty crazy. Thanks, everybody. Thanks for the congrats. We did it. Been with you since 11K, so happy to see all of your amazing growth at the channel. Thanks, Nemo. And thank you for all the support. Yes. Yeah, so we're in Rise right now. We're in the big, the big room. So that's fun. Also, I love uh, I love that name, Lester's Possum Park. I love it. That's awesome. Yeah, Jenna's gonna take it for a little bit after a few minutes. A total no rush. I'm good. Gonna be back from last night. Um, let's see what. What we on with tonight, I'll donate when I get paid. Oh no, uh, Daryl, please don't worry about that. Just enjoy. But uh, we are heading to Magic Kingdom here in just a minute with Jenna, so that'll be our fourth park. So it'll be Park Hopping Achievement Unlocked. So when you go back to Jenna, um, make sure and tell her Park Hopping Achievement Unlocked, all four parks hopped. And then I'm going to meet Jenna later at Magic. Oh wow, we got a ton more subscribers. 179,032 right now. Very cool. Well, Halloween Horror Nights is about to um, announce the rest of the uh, houses. That's cool. Awesome. You guys see it. Hey, Our Theme Life, how are you? <laughs> Good to see you guys. All day, four parks. Yes. Hope you guys are doing well. I keep up with you guys on Facebook a little bit, but hope you're doing very well. Good to see you. All the whole family. It's been fun to go to all four parks. It has been. And, and next time we do this, We'll try and show some transportation. Um, I do know that's something people like to see, but today we're just trying something different. So, all good. Well, we hear you, and I understand why you want to see the transportation. Because it's like being here, so I get it. Um, Sarah, well-deserved. Your streams are high quality, and you have so much respect for others. Thank you so much for all the joy and adventure you bring to our family. Thanks, Sarah. 
Hey, cool cap. Part of me was like, do I want to do it? Do I not want to do it? Well, I'm glad I did it. All right. Are you a rebel or first of all? I'm totally a rebel. I'm a rebel. I'm one of those does not follow directions. All right, so guys, Jenna, we have a special treat. A special treat when you get to magic. Jenna's going to show the flag retreat ceremony. So everybody, um, definitely tune in and stay tuned for the flag retreat ceremony at Magic Kingdom. We can salute and support our armed forces and our country. So we appreciate everybody who's watching from, um, from overseas as well. We get to help celebrate uh, our country as well. Thanks, we still enjoy watching the streams when we can and thankful we can stay connected. Yeah, for sure, guys, for sure. Mike and Jane, so good to see you guys. And Dil Dylan's probably a big boy now. I don't remember how much older he was than Liam, but um, but yeah, I know he was a little older than Liam. That's pretty cool. But I bet they'd have fun together now that Liam's seven. So yeah, flag retreat. So I definitely tell Jenna when you get, when Jenna comes on, definitely tell her congrats on 179K. And also tell her um, happy four happy uh, four park, happy hopping. All right, guys, we're gonna send it over to Jenna. Here we go. Enjoy the hop. Sending you over to Jenna. All right. So head over to Magic Kingdom in three, two, and one. Welcome to Magic Kingdom. You haven't been here yet today, but welcome back to my phone. How is it going? And uh, the flag retreat is at five o'clock, so we have about five more minutes. And I thought, hey, why not go up on top here and see it from up above? I haven't done this. I don't think I've done this since 2020, um, or no, 2019, right before MK shut down. So I am excited to show you. I sure, I'm sure Josh has done it. I just haven't yet from up here. Wait, we got 179K? Oh, we did it! Yay! Thanks, everybody! Oh my goodness, that's amazing! Thank you so much for subscribing and sharing us out. So, guys, that is awesome. What a way to celebrate, right? An all-day stream here at the Magic Kingdom. Oh, it's the train. Thanks, everybody! Yay! Hey, our theme life. How's it going? Haven't seen you guys in a while. Oh, for sure, Myers and the Mouse. We love catching this when we can. And it was perfect timing today. Hi, Joel. Hi, Sarah. Thank you so much. Hi, Victoria. I'm excited for all HHN. Yes, so excited. But yay, on 179K, guys. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. We're getting close to uh, 180 and eventually 200K. Oh my goodness, can't, cannot believe it. I know, squirrel. <laughs> You never know, right? The train, you have to see the train. All right, so yeah, only a few more minutes. We'll do the uh, flag retreat while Josh is waiting for Rise of Resistance. And then I'll flip you back to Josh. Hi, X, how are you? Thank you, Duncan. Yes, this is our fourth park of the day. Woo, woo, yay. <laughs> Hello from Ireland. Hi, Frankie. Hi, Natisha. Thank you, Kathleen. Oh, thank you, our Midwest life. Hi, Ginger. Yeah, hopefully no squirrels in Carousel of Progress. That's right. <laughs> Hi, Mike. Oh, I'll, I'll check for it, Scott. Hi, Kristen. Please shout out my son, Lincoln. Hi, Lincoln. All right, so let me look and see if I can find Scott's super chat. Yes, it's right here, Scott Bradley, $1.99. Um, seems like only five minutes ago was 178k i know right scott because it was right <laughs> thank you scott and thank you for uh, letting us know about that sometimes we miss them so we appreciate it thank you thank you yes natisha mom and i got our starbucks on the way um and it was not busy at epcot so 
We waited maybe 10-ish minutes, 10, 15, by the time we ordered and picked up our drink. So yeah. it was awesome. Yeah. We've been watching the stream most of the day and just wanted to let you know you're doing a great job. Aw, thanks, Caitlin. Hi, Jay Booker. Natisha says hi, Mom. Hi. Please join us in Times Square in just a few minutes for our flag retreat ceremony. Once again, please join us in just a few minutes in Times Square for our flag retreat ceremony. Thank you. Hi, mansion lover. Hey, Tiki Man fan. I know, right? Four parks. Phew. <laughs> I do have my 10,000 steps already. I have 11, almost 12,000. Hi, JC. Hi, Gary. Josh is um, over at Hollywood right now, but we'll be sending it back to him in a moment. Hi, Amy loves Disney. Hey, Cricket Girl. Cricket Girl says, so glad you're getting some clouds. Friday was brutal. It was brutal it out early I bet yeah oh you're welcome thank you Alice I know I can't believe it we did it 179k oh my goodness so awesome and yeah flag retreat in two minutes park Harper, park hopper say happy belated birthday to mom Aww, thank you <laughs> love your streams do you guys ever get bored by going to Disney or is it just a home away from home it's home away from home yeah. um, but you know sometimes we're we like to switch it up and that's when I go to Universal and SeaWorld and um, that kind of thing, but no, we love Disney, so. Yeah. Uh, trivia, the only real US flag at MK is the big one on the pole in front of us. The flags on top of the buildings on Main Street have minor alter alterations so they can stay flying. That's so true, Christopher, I did know that. Okay, I think they're about to start. Enjoy the flag retreat. Now, our next 
glad they do this still. Like Josh said in the chat, Walt loved this ceremony. So good. And thank you to everyone that is serving or has served. Thank you. Thank you. Amazing. So good. So good. All right. What a great view too. So let's see here. All right. We're still going. Look at them. Here, I'll zoom in again. All right, guys, I'm going to unzoom. Bam. Ooh, I wonder if the weather is coming at us. Is it coming at us? It did. I'm not going to complain about that, but hopefully it's not going to rain. I know. Check, check your phone, Mom. Yeah. All right. The train did say hi. Yeah. train's like, okay, now I'm here. Focus on me. <laughs> so Mom's going to check on the weather here because if nothing else we'll just kind of hang out here if it's going to pour I know it's so good Carol hi Somersetters you're so welcome Mandy and Keith thanks for being here your nephew is serving in the army that's amazing uh, let's see might be on Wi-Fi nope you're good sometimes it kicks it back on and proud Navy wife my husband is still serving oh that's awesome Natisha Thank you to your husband. Hi, Kawhi Kitty. It's possible after six. Okay. So we've got some time before six. No, dad was not in the service. No. Okay, so Josh said he is ready to take it back whenever. Um, he is going to be riding Rise of Resistance. So you don't want to go anywhere. Now, does anybody know when... So there should be a cavalcade coming. Or do they do that still? Cavalcades? I think they have a few of them. Let me check my app. Yes, Disney Adventure Cavalcade. Oh, 
Cavalcade is at 510, so maybe if Josh is not too close, we'll see. Cavalcade, how do you spell that? <laughs> Got it. Except for it's not wanting to. Our, our service is no bueno. It's doing okay on the phone. I know. Here we go. Josh is answering now. Um, I am going to go. Let's go this way, actually. So I don't know if we'll have time for the cavalcade, guys. If we don't, we'll send it to J Josh um, for Rise of Resistance. You don't want to miss that. But um, if we have to, we'll switch it to him quickly. So that won't be hard. It's super easy peasy. But if we have time to wait on the cavalcade, we'll see. Hi, Lily's life. Welcome back. Nanny Pooh Bear. Hello, hello. So we'll just kind of chill and see see if we can see that cavalcade. If not, no big deal. We've seen it before. Guys, in like a week or two, we're gonna have like pumpkins here, and scarecrows, and they're gonna have pumpkins over there, pumpkins up on the buildings. It's gonna be crazy, but I'm excited. Oh, no worries. Oh, that's awesome. I'm from the UK. I'm from the UK. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, of course. Do you want to say, we're live. Do you want to say hi on the stream? You don't have to. I would love to. Yeah, what's your name? Hi, I'm Natalie. Hi, Tim. Oh, <laughs> nice to meet you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Can I get a picture? Yeah, of course. Thank you so much. Yeah. Are you having a good time? Oh, my gosh, yeah. Yeah, good. Ooh, oh, yeah. Is it there? There you go. Thank awesome. You so Thank much. you for watching. Thank Honestly. you. I hope you have so much fun. Keep up the good work. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Everybody's looking at the radar. It's no, it's no workies. That's okay. So they're going to probably start decorating pretty soon. The first Halloween party is August 11th, I believe. Um, so yeah, they're probably going to be starting here soon ish. I would say first of August. I know, I wish we had a winky Mickey like they do at Disneyland. Okay, Josh said they stopped moving. Well, let's head up towards the castle because we can catch it up there quicker than it comes down Main Street so we could catch it as it's coming down um, from Frontierland. So it starts there at 510. Hey, Maleficent's little beastie, how's it going? Welcome in, everybody. So Magic Kingdom's a little bit busier than Epcot was. Epcot was amazing. We enjoyed it a lot. There was not a lot of crowd there. Ah, uh, Amy, I'm still thinking about my costumes. I've got options that I have in my closet. I have something that I maybe want to buy, but I'm trying to say, no, you've got costumes already. So I don't know, I don't know, my brain's all over. So we'll see. <laughs> Hello, Paul. This is number four. Number four, we went to four parks, guys, woohoo! And we had 179K. And I didn't even know it until I went live right here at Magic Kingdom. So it was perfect. So awesome. All, all you guys were telling me. So that was amazing. Amazing. Yes, Chloe needs her Halloween costume too. So, yeah, it looks like it's going to storm. The, the temperature is amazing though. It um, kind of feels like fall right now. And I love it. <laughs> I'm here for it. Oh, and guys, guess what? So... Um, when mom and I were leaving Epcot, we went into the pen trading store, of course, before we headed out. We had to see what pens they had. And I don't know if you remember, but I was looking for, or I really was, when, when we were at Epcot, I wanted the first visit stitch pen. And it's on a lanyard that you buy with a set of four pens for 40 bucks. And I'm like, well, I don't really need all those pens. I just want stitching. Guess what I found on the pen board? At Epcot, in the pen shop. I found that pen. Oh my goodness, it was so exciting. Made my day. It is a perfect day for a stream, yes. So I was so excited. 
I got the stitchy pin. Oh no, sorry Sherry, I hope you get some rain soon. So everybody's waiting on the cavalcade. At least that's what I'm guessing is happening. I know, I couldn't believe it. I did, I got it. I'll have to show you guys whenever um, I can get out of my bag here later. This is my bag. Sorry. Well, see, I told you to leave it, and look, there you got it. Much cheaper. <laughs> it was a lot cheaper. Yes, Kelly. I'm assuming that's Kelly. <laughs> I was so excited. Okay. Let's go up here, Mom, and I think we'll be able to catch it. Coming around. I know. I was so excited. I knew you, I had to tell you guys. Yep, here it comes. Move over a little bit quicker. You're weird. Sorry, sorry. Sorry. Oh, they do it again. All right, Mom. Yep, you can go right there. I'm all good. All right, guys, here we go. Oh, Josh, I already talked about behind the ride. But we can talk about them again if you like. Behind the ride, guys. Go check them out. If you want to learn more about how your favorite rides right here at Walt Disney World were created, go check out Behind the Ride by David Mumpower. You can get the ebook or the hardcover copy. Hi, Mr. Terry. Small, how are you? All right. Here it comes. Enjoy, everybody.
gonna get there. All right, let me check with Josh. Well, I'm glad that worked out here, Mom. Let's go this way. Don't they have Don? I don't know. What's your dad's name? His name is John. John. Hi, John. Oh, that's awesome. Later, oh, very cool. Yeah, we nice to meet you. Thank you so much. You're, are you in the DCP? Yeah. Cool. That's awesome. Very okay. cool. Have a good day. Bye. That's awesome. Got to see your daughter. That's so cool. Aw, oh, me too, Tom. Hi, JJ, Mickey. Hi, Bonnie. Hi, Kim. Okay, so Josh is live, so we're going to send you back over to Josh, everybody. So enjoy Rise of Resistance, and then Mom and I will bring you back to Magic Kingdom here pretty soon. So don't go anywhere. everybody hi right, everybody we are just about there we just have to go around that corner right there and then we'll be there so it stopped for a little bit so that allowed Jenna to show you an awesome view of the flag ceremony and an awesome view of the um, Disney Adventure Friends cavalcade hey Ron how are you JJ Mickey's here welcome everybody up up collector thanks for being here guys I jumped to 3,900 people in the chat. Subscribe if you're new. And let's go save the galaxy. So the Love Resort TV on. Y'all have a great time. Thanks, Jim. Appreciate it. Hi, Bonnie. Hi, Alyssa. My old Starfighter uniform there. Liam and I met uh, BB-8 the other day, and uh, um, the cast member BB-8 said, uh, asked Liam if he was uh, an X-Wing pilot. And he said... Um, no, but he said he didn't know how to use the force, and they were like, oh, you must be very powerful, so that was fun. Yeah, hi, Lily's Life. Happy song, JJ, Mickey, Natisha. Yep, so we're ready. Once we start moving again, we'll be there. Thanks, Kim Stallworthy, appreciate you. Appreciate you very much. Aw, oh, thanks, Jennifer, this has been fun. I don't know why we haven't done this sooner, but, you know, it was just kind of an idea we had. And it's nice because, like I said, we each get a break sometimes, so. Then we're in Rise. Kelly, I hope you get to, too. And we'll see which mode Kylo's in here in just a bit. DJ Stingy. I have seen the lightsaber, lightsaber thing. I haven't done it myself. It's been most off. This has been the most awesome stream. We'd love to see all four parks more often. Thank you, Wonderland Alice. Hey, Rosalie. The funny thing was, when Jen and I did this back in 2018... Uh, was the last time we did this over five years ago or around not quite five years ago I guess it was November 2018 um, we didn't think it was super popular um, just because it was so long ago not a lot of people were watching streams but now it's been uh, much more popular and just crazy we're excited if you want to buy a hopper t-shirt yeah I needed a new park uh, resort hopper t-shirt and I had to buy one uh, through our shop so yeah we don't get free shirts either. Either, Hey, Myers. Thank you, Gabrielle. Appreciate it. Yeah, get the like button and thanks for, hit, and thanks for helping get us to uh, 179K, everybody. Appreciate it. Every time that somebody streams this, makes me want to have a Star Wars marathon. I love that. 
Yeah, it's also so fun to see four parks in a day. I could have waited, I guess, a little bit, but it's all right. It's all good. So who else loves this ride as much as I do? ACH. Hey Brad, Antonio, Donna, sorry if I didn't say your name guys, and again I said hi to Cam a second ago. Um, yeah, so glad to be here. We're almost at 40 minutes, okay. So that's about right then. Yeah, they've, they've really been, oh here we go. They've really been stopping us quite a bit, but you know, they gotta get the lightning lane in because they've paid, so I get that. We moved quite a bit there for a while. We didn't move very far that time. Okay. Never ridden it. We absolutely love the literal park hopping between streams. I think this is the first time we've seen a full stream using, uh, utilizing the technology. You guys are good at it. The timing is great. Thanks, our theme life. It's not easy for sure to get the timing right, but we've uh, been doing it for a little bit, so we've had some practice. The hardest one was in during the fireworks, but that worked out better than I thought, actually. Funny thing was the first four park stream we ever did was in parks. We did four different streams in one day. So back in 2017, we did our first four park stream. Somebody else may have done it first, I have no idea, but our first four park stream was in 2017 in October, I believe. And um, we just did four different streams in each park. But that was when you could park off anytime. Josh, when you cut away to Jenna while you're in line, it's like a fast pass for your viewers, yeah, for sure. Hey, Mr. Kerry Small. Sorry, there's not a lot to see in here. This, I'm gonna head right over to Magic Kingdom, grab a bite to eat, maybe, and head to Magic. Oh, that's awesome, Critter Keeper. Sounds like fun. Here we go. So the wait time was pretty close then. Thanks, Mr. Carey Small. I feel like they should have a checkerboard up there or something. be a ton of fun to fly over to California to check in with Brit at Disneyland. Yeah, so actually, we did a six-park stream back in uh, 2019. That was fun. And yeah, the picture-in-picture, picture, I'm still working on that. that. I know some people have done that. They have a different, different setup than we do. So we might be able to do it sometime. It's so much fun. Love how interactive the cast members are. I wrote it the other night, and a little girl jumped out at the end shouting, We win! Oh, that's cool. Yeah, the entire queue is amazing, Manny Pooh Bear. It's fun. I love all the little, uh, you know, like odds and ends over there, all the different uniforms and stuff. Oh, well, it's taking a while, but this was worth it. Thanks for such a great stream. Thanks, Dest88. Appreciate it. Hello, Stefan. Bonjour, Victoria. Got lots of emails from Hopper today. Oh, telling me about weather apps and tech stuff and all kinds of things. And by the way, check out Jenna's new channel, Adventures of Jenna and Dale. And check out my new channel, Retro TV One Tech. Check them out, guys. We have lots of fun. All the fun. Yeah, this ride is worth a wait for sure, Brad.
Standing on their little numbers in here. BB8. Liam got to meet him the other day. BB8. Prep the ready room for recruits. story in this. It's very good storytelling by Disney. And when I said when this ride opened, it really gave me hope for new attractions. You can just tell they really a lot of love that went into this. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
realized that right when I got off I was like oh we're gonna be right in front of the uh, first order agent there it's pretty cool most impressive room on property yep it sure is oh we're still kind of in it so that's kind of cool those stormtroopers everyone if you really stand there long enough which I do get to stand there 10 minutes one time they do move every once in a while so that's kind of cool like one of them just turned his head so that's super awesome yeah it's just really really well done so it looks like they're they're doing odd numbers this way, I guess. I'm not sure. I had the mutants scroll down this ride. It looks cool. I'm a huge Star Wars fan. I have got to see the first. Yeah, for sure. If you haven't seen it, I get that if you don't want to watch it, that's totally understandable. It is really, really well done. I don't know, yeah. I really think it's cool. 5X, yeah, but 
not everybody likes it. That's totally understandable. Not everybody is going to like everything, but I, I think it's personally one of the best things Disney's ever done. Any word on what's going on with the Galactic? Uh, I haven't heard what they're going to do with it, but I mean, I know it's definitely shutting down. Here we go. Yeah, they do. Yep, the Stormtroopers do move. In fact, I think they pretty much all of them do at some point. My mouth hung open when I saw the troopers. Yeah, I mean, I'm telling you, the first time I went in there, it's like kind of an emotional experience. It's so, so good. For sure. So Sherry, she actually, I know you can go down both sides, but she actually sent us this direction. She told us to go right. She asked how many, and she said go right. So yeah, for whatever reason, that's what they're doing. Means we just have to wait longer, I guess. That's all right. I'm sure there's a reason. I guess if you're an odd number, you have to, you have to wait a little longer. <laughs> yeah, that room, yes, is really good, too. There's just so many great effects in here. I do wish the cannons still moved. That was a really cool effect too. But, you know. It was pretty, that's pretty technically challenging. Imagine the ship was Invader's Command. Yeah, I will say that. It would have been cooler if they'd had the, the older characters in here. I know what they were trying to do, the synergy and everything with the new stuff, but honestly, um, I think people would have really identified more with the classic characters. That's, the old, that's my only gripe. And Dan, I'm headed, I, I'm at Walt Disney World, if you mean when I'm headed to Magic Kingdom, um, just right after this ride. Yeah, Palo's Adventures is one of my favorite rides too, besides People Mover. <laughs> I appreciate they've made adjustments like the cannons to keep the right operational longer. That's true. You know, it's just, it was like a little bit too ambitious, and I get that. I have heard from a cast member that they actually plan to eventually fix that. This ride is more of an experience. It really is. It really is. John Williams wrote and performed the music for the ride. Yes, a lot of it he did. Not all of it, but a lot of it. Uh, one. Hey, just Kyle. The cannons do go boom, boom. They just don't go forward and backwards anymore. So it might lag just a little bit when we get to the add-at room, but it usually comes back pretty quick. Yep, it's an experience, Angela, for sure. Their, their data ports here don't look like Ethernet <laughs> for the tech talk. Now these troopers move too. Star Wars Yeti. Yeah, true, Jason. But, you know, I, I agree with what was said earlier. Like, if it keeps the ride open more, which it has been, you know, well, I'll just be quiet until I'm off. But, you know, I think that's a good thing. Our favorite ride in all of Disney, hey, Bob and Winston. Yeah, Park Hoppers. You guys did a whole day, all day stream here. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Good to see everybody in here. Thanks for, for being supportive. <laughs> That's cool. He's playing. He's playing the part. I didn't bring my Astromex Joy to connect to the data ports, I did not. <laughs> so many, how do you know which one to plug into? They don't have Wi-Fi here, I guess. <laughs> Guys, look down at your feet. <laughs> oh, we got them. Memorize these colors. If you are having trouble identifying these colors, I will identify them for you now. But pay attention because I'm only saying this one time. This is blue. 
That is red. This is silver. And of course, orange. Oh good, now we know what the colors are, that's good. That's really helpful. If you have any bags, backpacks, fanny packs, or anything of the sort, take them off, hold them out in front of you. When these cell doors open, you will proceed all the way in and stand on the colors that I've assigned to you. Is that Does anyone have anything they would like to add? <laughs> oh, oh, he said he wished he could say the same. <laughs> I was like, what's he going to say to them? And he had a good response. <laughs> oh. She said, I'm not good at math. That's what I could tell. <laughs> that was good. All right, blue, blue. I don't know my colors. All right. Leave us. Yes, General. Enemies of the First Order, we will soon snuff out your meager resistance. You chose the wrong side, and now you will pay. The resistance prisoners. You have what I want. You know the location of the secret base, and I will take it from you. We are needed on the bridge. Keep the prisoners here. I will return to finish this personally. Does 
did not look good. Try to find another way down to the escape pods. The resistance will attempt to rescue the prisoners. They have neither the resources nor the courage to engage us. You underestimate their conviction. Raise the shields! Shields? I see no evidence. Now! Down the alarm! All personnel to their stations! Sir, the prisoners have escaped. How brave. But ultimately hopeless. There's no way to run. came in a little off target. Ground crews will meet you outside the wreck. All right, nice job, recruits. Not what you sign on for, but hey, your resistance now. I think I have that authority. Right, Beck? Where's the lieutenant? I need eyes on Beck. Line right up. there. Stand for his car, people. More escape pods down in sector four. Verification pending from key command personnel. Where's the lieutenant? Wreckage? I got a bad feeling about this. No, he came down at the wreckage site. That doesn't sound good. He was the backbone of this operation. If anything happened to him, it's fine. Scanners last held him in sector four. Should have waited for him. Sir, you had no choice. We had to get those data tapes off the ship. We never leave anyone behind. So this is the two resistance command. Rescue teams are approaching all surrounding sectors. Okay, and hurry. He's right there. I appreciate mm -hmm. that. Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, we always support the cause. That's right. You guys remember Tower of Terror Q, Nathaniel Horton. Nathaniel? That's me. Oh, cool. Yes. Awesome. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you, too. <laughs> I'll keep an eye on your live stream and your schedule. I yeah. could, at some point, if I'm off, yeah. meet up with you guys, get you guys in. Uh, okay. Some Perfect. Yeah, I'll talk to you guys. Thank sure. you so much. Yes, have a great rest of your day. You, too. Good luck with the four parts. So. Oh, appreciate it. Yep. Thank you. That's very nice. 
Yeah, so the, the, the audio didn't line up at the end of that one a little bit, but that's the first time I've ever seen that happen. Honestly, that ride is so complicated. Like, things are, are not, you know, it, it's just amazing it works as well as it does, honestly. Like, the fact that you you have a trackless vehicle that goes into an elevator that locks on that drops, like, several feet. What does it drop, like, 20 feet or something? Like, I don't know. It's just, it's a, it is a work of art, like Brad said earlier. It's a technical work of art. It's a great ride. And, yeah, it would be cool if the cannons worked, but, man. I think that was the biggest thing, was getting all that to line up and sync. Was, uh, if, if the ride, especially I think the biggest thing was if the ride had any downtime or anything like that, it, it definitely made it difficult. So anyway, uh, like I said, great ride. I know we had a tiny little bit of lag before the ad at room, but yeah, it's great. I'm gonna send it to Jenna here in just a second. So yeah, uh, connection inside the resistance. That's right, we do, we do. It's like I said, I don't wanna get any, he was very nice. I don't wanna get like special favors or anything, but I mean, you know, I guess it would be great to ride it again. So, all right, we're gonna we're gonna see this X-wing here, and we will say, um, oh, you know what? I can go show you. Let me let me go show you the Falcon. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. Is he okay? All right. Sorry. The little kid ran right into me. I felt bad, but that, and mom got him and he was all right. All right. So here, let's go say hi to the Falcon. And then we'll we'll do it. All right, here we go. One of the most sophisticated rides ever built. It really, really is. It's so amazing. All right, let's go. Let's go say hi to Falcon, and then we'll send it to Jenna. I'm going to show the Falcon and then send it to you. We are almost there. Yeah, poor kiddo. He just like ran, got out away from his mom, and I didn't see him because he was he was just turning the corner. So, but he's all right. That's why I always tried to hold on to Liam though in the park, so I didn't let him run like that. Okay, so <laughs> he was all right though. He didn't even cry, so I'm sure he's okay. But yeah, especially when Liam was little, I always kept a good hold on him because you know, you you can't see sometimes when they run and they go so fast, you can't see them. Oh, Mando must be. I, I don't think Mando and, and Grogu are out tonight because it is a little bit rainy. But I don't know. I could be wrong. You know, you never know. Jenna's gonna get ready, and here we go. All right. Still about 3,700 strong. Appreciate all of you being here. All right, so as we say hello to the fastest hunk of junk in the galaxy. That's right, what a piece of junk, yeah, exactly. <laughs> She's the fastest one in the galaxy. All right, so. Cool. So here we go. Uh, Emily, five dollars. Hello from Oklahoma. We'll be. We'll, we're hoping to be able to go back to Disney World in the next few years. Have fun. Oh, thanks, Emily. Thanks for the super chat. Appreciate it. All right, we will be right back. Oh, you said he was trying to get back to his his sister, mom, or something. Ah, well, that's. I feel bad, but like I said I, I I couldn't even avoid him. He was going so fast. Uh, but anyway, he's all right. All right. So thanks, everybody. So we'll see you over at Magic Kingdom. All right, send you to Magic Kingdom in three, two, and one. Let's see as many as 
Welcome back to Magic Kingdom. Hello, hello. All right, let's head to the People Mover. It wasn't working earlier, but it's working now. So let's go. People Mover time. Welcome back, guys. Thank you, thank you. Uh, let's see. Hi. 40 minutes for Buzz Lightyear. That's not too bad. Hello, guys. Welcome back. Hope you had fun on Rise of Resistance with Josh gonna go get some dinner now and then come over here and meet us and then mom and I will get dinner and uh, we'll enjoy the night together finally all together it is supposed to rain here so hopefully if it starts well hopefully it doesn't rain but if it does start to rain um, we'll probably after people move her we'll probably go ride um, carousel of progress because you know that's a good place to go when it rains but we'll see we'll see how it goes right, welcome back guys Thanks for being here. Here we go. Hope you're having fun, fun, fun. We're having a fun day today. Hope you guys are enjoying it as well. Dad says, I'll get dessert. Yes, come have some dessert. Maybe we can get some uh, coconut dual whip, Dad. Does that sound good? Or whatever. There's lots of yummies here. Lots of yummy yummies. I was wondering if you could do Tiki Room at some point. Um, let me ask Josh about that. I don't know if he'll want to do that on an all-day stream because sometimes it, yeah, I don't know. So we'll ask Josh. So maybe, but we're not sure. If... Ooh, to the laugh floor. We could do the laugh floor. It's just if it's pouring, it's easier to get just across to Carousel because it's right there than to laugh floor, which is down that way. So we'll see. We shall see. Dad, did you see? We probably didn't, but because I just saw it. So Disneyland is getting a new popcorn bucket, and um, it is a train with Mickey, and it has a whistle. But Dad, they're only getting a Disneyland. Uh, Disney Parks posted it on their uh, Instagram, so hopefully we'll get them here in Walt Disney World too. But uh, yeah, if you guys follow uh, Disney Parks on Instagram, you'll get to go see that rain popcorn bucket and it looks so amazing. I've been watching Josh in your channel uh, near the beginning. I don't remember you being there until a little later. Do you remember when you joined Resort TV 1? Um, Chris, I joined it in 2017, I believe. So a long time ago. A long time ago. I'm pretty sure when Josh started doing live streams. That's when I came. Hey, Park Hoppers. Hey. Oh, hi. How's it going? Do you want to say hi? Okay. Hello. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> Good to see you. Bye. Hello. I know, right? No rain, even though I'm starting to Oh, well, we're about on the people mover, so it's all good. Enjoying the four parks in one day. So much fun. Thank you. You're welcome, Kiki Mouse. Yeah, Dad. Dad needs that popcorn bucket, 100%. But the problem is, to go to Disneyland to get it. So you want to go to Disneyland? Oh, hi! <laughs> punch, hello! <laughs> That's right, punch the like button. Pop that like button, is what we like to say. Hello, everybody! Isn't it cool? It's so amazing. Oh, yeah, the one, the, the uh, spaceships that are up there, what is it called? Astro Orbiter? I get sick on that one, too. A little nauseous. Okay, we're walking up the ramp. Ramp is no worky. Feel the burn up the ramp. Oh no, sorry, Brad. <laughs> could be, Duncan. I could have Brick at us one, yes, for dad. Yep, that might be a thing we'll have to do. There's also a Baymax zipper that I want so bad, so. We shall see. Hi, Courtney Ring Runners. Thank you so much. So glad you're enjoying the stream today. Yep, there is some rain heading our way. 
Hey, Lisa. Or Alyssa, I'm sorry. I had heard that, Danny. That's right, feel the calves. Yes, Josh, we're going on your favorite ride. Go enjoy some dinner while you're watching. Hi, Tammy, how are you? Welcome in. Don't worry, guys, we'll be going on this again when Josh gets here. Always got to do at least two people move a ride. One during the day, one at night. Hi, Doug. Stay clear uh, James, James, James A999, saying hello and thank you for the live stream from the entire Ashbury clan in Kissimmee. Thanks. Uh, is it Ashbury? Sorry. Thank you guys so much for that. So sweet. Um, and there was another super chat while we were switching. Did Josh get that one? He probably did. From Emily, $5. Hello from Oklahoma. Hoping to be able to go back to Disney World in the next few years. Have fun. Thanks, Emily. Thank you, Emily. Okay. Thank you. All right, guys. This is going to be fun and relaxing. Hopefully not a monsoon. For your safety, remain seated at all times. Usually on all day streams, we ride this several times. So I'm sure we'll be at least on here twice. If not more. And please supervise younger beings. Stay clear. That's right, Jamie. Hi, Isabel. Have you bought tickets for any Disney Halloween parties? We have, Nick. We're definitely going on the first uh, the first Halloween party. I think this will be there. Uh, Julie will be here till the park closes, which is 10, and probably even after that. So I would say probably 11, but I'm not sure. So stay tuned. It'll be a good, 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 good stream. All right. Enjoy the ride, guys. Here we go. This is the TTA Blue Line nonstop service around Tomorrowland. Greetings, intergalactic travelers. Welcome aboard the People Mover, presented by Enterprise. I'm Orak Fadif, your guide aboard this highway in the sky, the absolute best way to see tomorrow. And my stars, is there ever lots to see? From spacecraft to monster labs, there's really nothing great right today in Tomorrowland. For your safety, if you have wings, jetpacks, or gravity polarizers, please do not take flight while on board. The next station is Tomorrowland Urban Planning and Star Trade. Transfer to Green and Red Lines. Don't worry, your express train keeps on rolling through the future, right by two of my favorite spots. Disney's amazing dream for a community of tomorrow. Did you know Progress City inspired Epcot? And a lot of the visionary ideas throughout Walt Disney World. Look, there's even a tiny people mover. I wonder if that means there's a tiny Orax. On your right is Star Tracks, home to the greatest goods in the galaxy. Except actual stars. Those are the ones. Now approaching Tomorrowland Speedway and Tron Light Cycle Run. I love a good circuit. And these are two of the best tracks of the cosmos for a bit of light, speedy competition.
Attention all people who were passengers, please remain seated with your hands on our feet and right inside the vehicle and stay at the back of the way to the first. Hands on our feet and remain seated. give you a Tron update. Um, it's done and it's amazing. Alright guys, enjoy. It's all your fault, Kelly. Just kidding. <laughs> oh. Attention travelers. Your journey has been temporarily delayed. For your safety, please remain seated. Thank you. Attention all visitors from Galaxy M31. Please keep forward-facing tentacles clear of oncoming vehicles. Thank you. Next to each other. It's funny. Oh, thanks, Honora. Please remain seated with your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the vehicle and feel the Mm, Kelly. Too funny. I know me too, Matt. Well, they started, but we're not moving. <laughs> Hopefully, if we cross our fingers. Yeah. <laughs> Brad. All right, guys. Enjoy the ride. Here we go. Oh, the lights are on. Ooh. This is Star Wars 75. Oh, it's for the people. Or as the locals call it, yeah. Space <laughs> Our high speed rocket port to distant deep space destinations. Oh wait, the lights are on in Space Mountain too. Ooh, go people mover, go, faster. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is exciting. Wow. So cool. Let relaxation wash over you at the most refreshing retreat in the galaxy. The Coral Moons of Pisces 7. You H2 owe it to yourself. Book today. Alright, keep going, people mover. A little bit faster, we gotta see the rest of it. <laughs> go, go, go. Okay, that was cool. Thank you, Mr. Moss.
Morrow. Mr. Tom Morrow. Please contact Mr. Johnson in the control tower to confirm your flight to the moon. Thank you. Carousel of Progress. As usual, we'll keep moving ahead, and so does the carousel. Like progress itself, this theater never stops, inspiring new generations to dream of a great, big, beautiful tomorrow.
walk over and uh, check out Tron. We can't ride it, but we can just go over there and check it out. Do you guys want to do that? Instead of going to see Carousel Progress? Not sure. I might fall asleep if I go in Carousel Progress right now. But I'll go if you guys want to go. If it's pouring. It's a great place for car uh, great time for Carousel. Let's see. Hi, Poppy. Chloe, uh, Chloe and Marie are doing good. Thank you for asking. Huh. Yeah, just sprinkles. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right, let's go. Um, we'll go into the Star Trader shop and then we'll go over to Tron and check it out. I haven't been over in that area in a while, so let's do it. Yeah, I think that was a typo, 100%. <laughs> I knew what she meant. <laughs> I know, the weekends always go so fast. It's not fair, right? Sean will keep you dry too. Also, X totally understands you guys can't do TT. Oh, thanks, Brittany. Thanks, X. Coffee time, I know. We had coffee on the way here from Epcot. So I, I'm definitely more awake than, than I would have been. Those are so cute. But, uh, yeah. Had it, me too, Mini Bell. I've had it twice today, too. Mom and I had it this morning and then this afternoon. Starbucks. Squirrel cell, yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, guys. Well, make sure you are bopping the like button. How many likes do we have now? got 3,700 people in the chat. We so appreciate you guys being here and all the new subscribers. Thank you so, so much. Amazing. You guys are so amazing. I still think Dale needs this shirt. Alright, let's check out these, these pins. Let me see if I can find the one. Oh, so mom found this one and this one. Now she needs Goofy and Mickey. And you'll have a whole set. See what else you can find. Oh, that's all they have. Okay. Of the lanyards, anyway. Doo, doo, doo. Oh, the Aristocat one's cute. I also love the balloon. 2.7 likes. Okay, thank you. So, guys, if you've not bopped the like button, please go ahead and bop it. Helps YouTube know you're enjoying the stream and pushes it out to more people. So, we'll get more hoppers, more resort hopper families. Aw, thanks, Donna. You're so sweet. Donna Hall says, Jenna and Mom are amazing. Aww, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> oh, wow, look at this ring for um, phone ring you put on the back of your phone. Oh. It's cute. This one's cute, too, but um, guess the price. I have no idea. She has no idea. <laughs> it's more than you would think. Wow. <laughs> $50. I don't think so. How much is Mickey? $14.99. That's better. Yes, all right, who needs a Kevin lounge fly? Because I do. <laughs> <laughs> it is cute. I did not get the Walt and Mickey pen, no, but I did get my stitchy pen. Um, I bought the one that I was want that I wanted, and then I got the one on the pin board that I was wanting from that pack. So, oh yeah, and they have a pin board in here. Let's go. Excited. Oh, there it is. I see it. Good morning. Hi. Hi. Rearranging. I like it. <laughs> Sorry. No, you're totally fine. Oh, is that Mochi the cat? Yeah. From Baymax. So cute. Okay, wait. What's this one? Is it a car? Oh, it's Tomater, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, cute. Cute, cute. You're an organizer. We I tell. love that. <laughs> Why not? Exactly. <laughs> Cool, cool. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. Worries, you, you too. too. <laughs> yeah, okay, Ivone, we need it. We need the Kevin Lounge fly. Oh, and the rose gold one and the black Minnie Mouse one. <laughs> <laughs> My daughter has a Kevin Lounge fly. Oh, Tigger Tail John. Well, we need it. We need it. I know, $50 for the pop socket. Crazy. You put 
20 more dollars in there and you'll get a lounge fly. <laughs> okay, hiking elevated. All of them, that's right, all of them. I dressed for Halloween once as a Disney World tourist. Oh, I love that, Kathleen, that's amazing. We'll see, Mom, um, which pin? Oh yeah, like I gotta show you guys this. Mom got this pin today, how stinking cute. <laughs> and this one. Yeah. Now it's cute too. I don't know who doesn't love Kevin, right? Kevin is, oh, we missed Tron, it's this way. I went the wrong way. <laughs> we forgot. So that's only 15, but I'm afraid if it starts pouring like it did. Josh and I got soaked. It was at Chris, I think it was a Christmas party. Yeah, oh my goodness, that was awful. I, me too, classy Disney mom. Hi, Daniel. They love your pins, Mom. <laughs> Do they have a pin board in the Tron shop? Does anybody know? Let me know. Okay. Let's go this way to the Tron, Tron, Tron. We don't, we're not gonna be able to ride it, but we can at least check it out. It's so cool. And we'll be underneath so we won't get wet. I sent a pic of a very unusual pin, Jenna Messenger. Also a pic of Stitch we found on our travels through the woods. Oh, cool, Alrighty. Can't wait to see it. I'll check it out when I, Josh gets here. Okay, all right, thanks my ears and the mouse. I'll check it out. Thanks, Jonathan. Yeah, we can go in anyway. Might as well. Get us out of the rain. It's just sprinkling, it could be worse. Knock on wood, yep. <laughs> Ah, oh, the trees, aren't they cool? Tomorrowland palm trees. Oh no, sorry Daniel. Oh, that popcorn smells so buttery. Now I want popcorn. Look at all the cast members out here, they have their uh, bubble wands. Mom is doing very good at pen collecting. Yeah, she's loving it too. Right, Mom? Yeah. She loves it. Jennifer Halloween dresses Stitch, carry Chloe, and say she's an angel plushie. Oh my goodness. I love this idea, Corey. I doubt they'll let me in with her, but you know. I would love that. All right, let's go into Tomorrowland Launch Depot. The rain's getting a little bit heavier. So good timing. Pin board in here? Not in here. Not in here. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. All right. So no pin board in here, but that's all right. You can still look around. It's a cool shirt. Is that new? Hi, Tony. Yes. I. I was. So my dad has not seen the popcorn bucket yet, but he. Um, oh my word! Look at this. But I told him about it. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Ah, oh, no, sad. No, no pin board. They have Baby Yoda, though. So, I think we're going to have to get Dad one of those. <laughs> I know what other job lets you use a bubble wand. Just Disney. Let's go over here and see what kind of merch we can find. The little baby rocket. I just want to rub his belly. Good job, little rocket. I'll rub your belly. Oh, it's okay. No worries. We wanted to come in here anyhow. All right, Kelly and Dale need this. <laughs> so it's kind of like the Velocicoaster, um, or the Velociraptor um, mask that Kelly has, and you open your mouth and it moves with you, with your mouth. <laughs> Isn't that fun? There's there you go. And then you can get all the Groots. I love teenager Groot with his phone there. <laughs> I know an adventure, the ad oh, adventurous yes. Groot. Yes. <laughs> A blur of bite and bark. <laughs> I've not seen this. Fifty four ninety nine. That's a heavy sweatshirt. So that'd be nice and warm. Yeah. Ooh. Butter toffee peanuts. That sounds delish. 
We need to sell more chips at Disney because I, I like want chips every once in a while. <laughs> like salt. I think I need salt. This is so Heat changing artwork. Oh, fun. Hi, Tara. My mom and dad, uh, Louie and Joe, or Lois, is it Lois and Joe? Enjoying your live feed. They enjoy your channel a great deal. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Here is uh, baby Ewok here. And then we've got big old baby Yoda. So cute. Oh, is it lagging? All right, hang on. I'll fix it. Dale and I need this. Yes, you do. Dale and I are real good at the mask thing. And that one opens its mouth when you open yours. He says, I am root in several ways. Okay. That's going to have to be something. Something you guys need. I agree. I agree with this. Anybody else getting any lag? Right? We need more chips at Disney. They used to sell these um, cheddar puffs. And they were gluten free. And I loved them. And then, so for some reason, they quit selling them. I got them every time. No lag? Okay. Oh, 100% we'll be here for fireworks, guys. All day stream. All clear. All right, thanks, everybody. It's the backpack here. z buck -buck. Let's see if it's raining anymore. This is the one from opening day. Okay. Let's go see. Go see if it's raining. Yeah. Not too bad. We'll make it up to the Tron, it won't be too bad. Jenna, are you and Josh doing um, a duet on Corey's Magical Night of Hope? You mentioned something on Thursday. Josh and I are doing a duet? I don't know. If we are, I wasn't informed. <laughs> I mean, that, I, that would be fun. We'll have to see. Bop the like button, yes guys, bop the like button. Hey Marcos from Mexico City. Okay, thanks everybody. All good. There's a stitch cupcake. No, I need it. Oh, there goes a train. I need we need to come sometime, mom, and ride this again. I miss it. I haven't ridden it in a while. Yeah. Hi, I can elevate it going great. Love those screams. 2.8 likes, everybody. We can get to 3K. Hopefully, we can get to 3K before. So, we have to end this stream um, probably around 8 ish. And um, we'll start another stream for fireworks because you can only do 12 hour streams. So, hopefully, we can get to 3,000 likes before we end the stream, guys. So, bop, bop, bop away. Bop the like. I know, Honora. Music is so amazing. <laughs> it's your favorite ride, that's right, Donna. the music too. Oh, it's so awesome. So amazing. Oh, that's cute, Sherry. That was me probably. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> mm. 
Sherry said somebody sent her a video of uh, a toddler crying dramatically over Lilo and Stitch. I said, yeah, that was probably me. <laughs> I was so excited. Just kidding. Thank you so much, Northwest Man, for liking and subscribing. Welcome to the Resort Hopper family. Here they went. Let's go this way. Actually, wait. I want to go this way and see the launch. It's raining, but it's not bad. Yeah, it's a little bit rainy. Could be worse though. Here they come. Yes, Allie and Myers and the Mouse. I said the same thing. This is like Avengers music right here. I think that's why I love it here so much. Because I love Avengers Campus. I want to go back. Hi, Goofy Grandpa. I was watching... Um, our vlog from when we first went to Disneyland uh, last year with our friends Myers and the Mouse Tail and I. And um, it was the first time we ever got to go to Avengers Campus and we were geeking out. It, you guys, if you haven't seen that video of our first day at Disneyland, if one of the Moppers wants to post it, it's from last year. Um, I think it has 17,000 views on it. So super awesome. But go check it out. <laughs> Go check it out. Go watch it again if you already watched it. Avengers Campus is amazing. Nope, we're not riding it today. Not today, guys. We're getting all the views. Aw, sorry, Natisha. Okay, Myers and Mouse, I love it. It's slow, yeah, it, it's awesome. And it was funny because we were walking in and we had a park hopper. And we weren't planning to go to Avengers Campus, but we were like, oh, we might as well we have a park hopper. And all I remember saying is Mama, uh, Ivone and I were like, wait, we don't have the right outfit on. We can't go to Avengers Campus. But then we're like, ah, let's just go. <laughs> Needed our Avengers outfits. All the shapes, yeah, the shapes do kind of remind you of Space Shipper a little bit. I agree. right here so you can get a picture as if the drawn is coming by. Hey happy mile style. Marvel's amazing. Guess it was a huge deal. Wrong dress code. Dale and I just rolled our eyes and we still had to go to Starbucks first didn't we? <laughs> yes Starbucks is a must. <laughs> I love that on the video. We're like, the boys are like, what are we doing? We're sitting here waiting on the girls. They're at Starbucks. <laughs> Not waiting for a ride. We're waiting for them at Starbucks. <laughs> so fun. So we stayed um, at the, if you watch, if you watch the vlogs, we show it to you, but we're at the, um, we were at the Anaheim Hotel. Nothing fancy, but yeah. it worked. Yeah. You know, place to sleep, shower, get ready. We were at the parks all day, so. Yeah, exactly. And it wasn't far from the parks, so it was easy to walk. Here, I'm gonna go over here. Behind the, behind the photo pass, so we'll get a 
a good view. So true, Myers in the mouse. Oh my goodness. No, today the weather has been awesome. We picked a good day. We were gonna go live on Saturday all day, um, but we wanted to celebrate Mom's birthday since Friday um, was her real birthday, and we were, you know, live for Friday Night Live. So we, we were like, well, let's do Sunday, and it worked perfectly. Today has not been hot. Today has been a little warm, but nothing like Friday and Saturday. No, it's not a Hilton. It's just the Anaheim Hotel. Hi, Ivy, Rebecca. We'll wait for this one to go by and then we'll we'll go see what else we can do. I'm not sure. Comes. Oh my goodness. Well, we kind of saw it with arms in the way. <laughs> we'll wait for one more. It's fine. He was excited. This is better. Yes, we're doing fireworks, 100%. <laughs> That's true, Anthony. Drive by screaming. nothing fancy so if you're used to a fancy hotel you're not gonna like it uh, but we're you know we're not fancy so so for us it was fine um, again the bet it was a place to sleep and shower it was clean um, it was walking distance to the parks super close so for us it was great oh that's awesome Tim um you never know you never know it could be hot it could be cold it could be both. It could be hot in the, um, cold in the morning and at night, hot in the afternoon. So we just say keep checking and uh, bring all the layers and all the clothes. That's right, a basic hotel won't break the bank and, and it's right next to, to Disneyland. So for us, it was perfect. But for others, they wouldn't like it because it's not fancy. <laughs> I scream on some of the roller coasters, especially if it's the first time of me, for me riding it. This one I smile now. Love this ride. Zoom into the canopy. Oh yeah. Well the lights aren't on right now, but it's beautiful. Thanks, Julia. Congrats on 179k. I still can't believe we hit that today. Amazing. That's right, we barely were at the hotel. We were at Disneyland from park open to park close. And Disneyland stays open pretty much every night until 11 or 12, unlike Disney World. So we were legit at Disneyland from open to close every day. <laughs> oh, you're so welcome for the stream. Okay, guys, we're getting close to 3K likes. Keep bopping. Disneyland is totally different than Disney World, yeah, with the hotel situation. Walt Disney World, I recommend staying at one of their uh, resorts if you can. Um, they do have cheaper ones, you know, more affordable, I guess I should say, where Disneyland, all of theirs are very expensive. Um, but the Good Neighbor ones are perfect at Disneyland. Oh, Honora, so sad. I'm so sorry about that. I did 17 hours at Disneyland. Holy moly. Sounds fun, though. Oh, Grand Streeters, I bet that is pretty cool. Alright, Mom, what would you like for dinner? We could, talk, we could probably start mobile ordering. Well, I was thinking maybe pizza. Something different. So, Pinocchio's maybe? I don't know, Stacey. I'm not sure why they closed so early here. We don't know. Especially like during the summer when it's usually a busy time to come. You would think they'd be at least open till 11, but oh 
lot. I don't know. Did you have pizza for dinner? That's awesome. Uh, t is it um, Mila? Hello, first time catching a live stream that isn't on replay. Hello and welcome in. So glad you're able to catch us live. Yeah, for sure, great, Gabriel. Hi, Becky. So, let's pull over and we'll go ahead and put our mobile order in. So when Josh comes, we'll be able to hit it. Right. Um, let's see. All meat. We're here because Josh isn't here yet. <laughs> no. All right, so now just hit that button beside, and we'll wait. As soon as Josh gets here, we'll hit the prepare my order. Let's go look at the. Oh my word! Look at this cast member and all the bubbles. He made a bubble mountain on his hand. <laughs> it's too funny. Oh my goodness, he's having too much fun. <laughs> Too much fun. <laughs> Look at that bubbles. <laughs> bubbles everywhere. So I'm always looking, guys, to see if they have any waffle pins. Um, I have them, so I don't need them. Any more of them, but I'm just checking. Every time. Nope, but they do have munchlings. Anybody needs munchlings? And I've gotten so many of these on the pin boards. I just got Minnie Mouse today. I haven't even bought a pack. All right. Well, let's just walk this way towards uh, Fantasyland. We haven't been there yet. Universal close too early sometimes around eight or nine. Yeah, I know. I don't know why they close so early too. Um, city walks usually open till what? One a.m., twelve a.m. Say walk this way. <laughs> There is a tiny little pond, yep, right here. <laughs> uh, Jenna, you get the gold star, you said it right. It's like Tamika, but the I instead of the K. Awesome, I'm so glad I got it right. I'm never good at that, actually, so I'm very shocked. I'm usually pretty bad, so I apologize. <laughs> now I probably won't say it again right, but... Oh my goodness, Roger Dodger. With a twenty dollar super not twenty, I'm sorry, Roger Dodger twenty with a fifty dollar super chat says, uh, "Keep up the great work. Can't wait for the fireworks." Oh my goodness, Roger, that is so sweet of you. I'm gonna selfie. Thank you so much, Roger Dodger. I love your name too. Uh, but that is very sweet, very kind, very much appreciated. Thank you so much. Thank you. That's hard to do while you're walking. Um. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> here we go. Thank you, Roger. So very kind. The beauty of Disneyland is that it sits in the middle of a city. You could buy a condominium five-minute walk. That's, yeah, that is amazing, John. Crazy, because Disney World, you can't, you know, you can buy stuff behind the castle, and that's probably the closest you'll be. Um, and they have some pretty pretty close houses back there. But um, Disneyland, you wouldn't be able to walk, though. Disneyland, yeah, you could probably live somewhere and just walk, which is pretty cool. Thanks so much. So glad you like the ears. I have my four park ears on today. Hi, T Town Mary Ellen. Oh, yay, you're going to start pin trading. I love it. I love so many people have started it. Start a pin trading, Mom, because we, uh, we've been talking about it. Got my ears um, right here, I think, at Magic Kingdom. I think they still have them. They had them at Epcot, too, I believe. 
Hi, Paul. How's it going? Hi, Hotbox Mike. Hello, hello. We're doing good so far. Josh is on his way over. This will be his third park hop. Um, and as soon as he comes, we're going to switch you guys over to him. And Mom and I are going to go eat some dinner. And then we'll get back together, all of us, and uh, enjoy some fireworks. Honora says we'll be doing pen trading when we bring the grandkids in November. Awesome. We have some oldies. Tell me when you're going to be pen trading. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to follow you with my pens behind you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> totally kidding. All right. So... Mom, is it your very merry on birthday? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you want to see my ears again? Sure. Here we go. Hang on. Bam. So they're the four parts. Two on this side, two on this side, and then if you flip them to the other side, it's gold. Um, and then there is a gold bow, but it's detachable, so I took it off. And it goes great with my gold lettering tank top today. That was perfect. And bam. Hello, Mr. Mad Hatter. Don't Today, spill. you know, is my own birthday. It's your own birthday? No, it's mom's own birthday. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, another ride I miss. I was when I, we were watching when I was watching my uh, our vlog from Disneyland. Is the Alice ride at Disneyland? It's so amazing. Such an amazing ride. Uh, Dad's fine. Yep, he just went home to uh, take care of Marie, and he'll be back here at Magic Kingdom with us later. So no worries, he's all good. Whoa, when do you see this clear? What is happening? I love it. Thank you, Honora. You're so sweet. 40 minutes for Pooh Bear. Doesn't look like 40, but there's probably... Oh, there's a lot of lightning lanes, actually. Disneyland does not have Fort Wilderness, no. No, they don't. Ooh, you know what I want now that we're over here? It's the Jenna and Ivone ice cream special. Vanilla soft serve with strawberries. Delish. Oh boy, oh man, I'm gonna get ran over every side I go. I just said it wasn't busy and then it got busy. Um, so Murray is a Maltese. Chloe is um, a Havanese. So they're actually different breeds. They look a lot alike though. Hello, MN, how are you? Okay, so I do know there's a pin board in the um, shop over here by PhilharMagic, so we'll go over there and see if we can find a pin. Yeah. Thanks, Mike. Dad? Oh, his Mickey backpack? I think he got it here at Disney. Pretty sure. I don't think they have them anymore, though. That's the thing. Like, you get you get things and they, you know, they quit. They get new styles and new new backpacks and things, so. But I'm pretty sure. Uh, Cordy, Josh's dog, was a um, Silky Maltese mix. Silky Terrier and Maltese mix. Was that pop socket made of real gold? I know, right? Happy Mile style. Thank you. That's too funny. Um, I said we're coming down to celebrate my retirement at my wife Beverly's birthday in November. You said your birthday was in November also. Wife would like to know what day. Um, my birthday is November 27. I was born on Thanksgiving. It doesn't always fall on Thanksgiving, but yeah. Hi, Princess Kristen. Thank you, Bespoke Magic. Cute ears, fashion tank top, and braids. Yes, exactly. Thank you so much, Bespoke Magic. You're so sweet. Oh, let's see if they have my ears in here. There should just be a blue tag. Okay, but no, you're here. Uh, mm, 
No, nope, I don't see them. Doesn't mean that they don't have them, they just don't have them in this shop. I have these though. Or oh, are these to Tron? They gave me Tron vibes. Bluetooth light up ears. I've not seen any. They love your new lounge fly, mom. It's pretty amazing. She got it for her birthday. So these are brand new, the Ursula ears. Aren't those cool? And the Foolish Mortal Halloween ears, and they glow in the dark. Wife is on the seventh. Oh, cool, yeah, hope we can see you guys too. And look, the eyes are even behind. <laughs> so funny. Exactly, ooh, what's this? 35 block pieces. Puzzle block calendar, oh, that's fun. I love that. How much is it? 30 bucks. That's not bad. Not at all. Considering. I kind of want it. I'm not going to lie. That's awesome. Let's go see if... Oh, they do have a pin board. Yay. Hi. Can we see your pin board, please? Thank you. All right. What do we have? Oh, he's cute. Little Eeyore. I saw him today already. Oh, yeah. Happy trading, that's fun. Yeah, that is. I think I'm all good. I'm good. You're good. All right. Thank yes, you so much. Nice. Thanks, you too. Let's see what kind of pens they have over here. Okay, let's see. I kind of want some more of the hundred ones. I want Mickey and Minnie. I've got Stitch, and I love him. Of course, right? Living my best life. All right, I think I'm getting something. Oh, look at this one. I don't know if I've seen this one. Oh, Aladdin and Abu. Cute? Oh, we didn't get dad his uh, dwarfs. Oh, that. I'm not grumpy. Oh, sorry. I'm just surrounded by people who are too happy. <laughs> That's funny. Grumpy, grumpy. Uh oh, they're letting out. It's gonna be crazy. It's time to go. Abort. <laughs> Abort mission. Everybody get out. Oh, but I love this. Hang on, I gotta show this. How cute is this? It's like a Peter Pan sweater. Yep, time to go. Oh, Dad just got here. Cool. And I think Josh is almost here. Let me check. Getting all these messages. Uh, sure. All right. Well, Josh is not here yet. Almost. I guess let's go take a, a look at the castle because, you know, who doesn't like to look at the castle? So we will be switching to the other stream um, around 8 o'clock. So just stay tuned, guys. Um, Josh is gonna take take the stream soon, so mom and I can go eat the Small World Puzzle uh, calendar. It was twenty nine ninety nine, so not bad. Love the backside of Castle. So close to three k, guys. Hi, bop the like button. Hi, how are you? Oh, thank you. Do you want to say hi? Oh wow, a long time. I long love time. that. Happy birthday, Ava. Do you guys want to say hi on the stream? Sure. Yeah? So we've got Ava. I see that from her name tag. And uh -huh. how old are you, Ava? Ten. Ten. Awesome. Happy birthday. And what's your name? Rowan. What is it? Rowan. Rowan? Rowan. Rowan, thank you. So nice to meet you. And Megan. Megan. I'm David. And David. Nice to meet you guys. And where are you from? We're from Franklin, Tennessee, right outside. Okay. Nashville. Nice. Okay, very cool. Well, we love Nashville. It's beautiful. Yeah. That's awesome. Are you having a good time? Yeah. Good. Very good. Oh, that'll be fun. That's awesome. Cool. So much fun. You're going to love it. There's a lot of good food and a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah. Of course. Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> All right, so we might as well put the castle behind us, right? <laughs> All right, here we go. Sure. Yeah, why not? <laughs> awesome. Here we go. Very nice. Well, thank you for watching for so long. We appreciate it. We do. And have fun tomorrow and the rest of your trip. Yeah. See you later. Enjoy your night, guys. Thank you. Bye. Careful. Don't back up, Mom. That's awesome. Oh, no, you blinked. Don't blink. <laughs> you can't. No, I'm literally, Mom and I are known for blinking in all the pictures. So, you yeah, know. Oh, look. Right. We can walk through the castle. Let's do it. We hardly ever get to go through the castle. So, guys, pop the like button. Because we want to try to get to 3K before, 3,000 likes, before we end this stream and switch it to our, our next stream. Because again, we have to switch it before 12 hours because YouTube won't go past the 12 hour mark on a stream. Happy Sunday, J Dog. You're so welcome. Rebecca and I say hi. Hi, guys. Hope you're having a good Sunday today. Did we do it? We did it. 3,000 likes. Thanks, everybody. Oh, my goodness. Amazing. You guys are awesome. Hoppers rock. I could try pulling the sword out of the stone. I could. Yeah, we just walked through the castle. You can't do this very often. I mean, you can sometimes, but sometimes it's closed for shows and things. Oh, I've not been back here when they put the water back. Actually, yes, I have. I just forgot. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> it's not hard to forget, yeah. We sure can, Joey's World, and our awesome moppers as well. Hoppers and moppers rock. They did. They put the water back in, right? <laughs> did you guys not notice that either, Myers and the Mouse? Oh, well, thank you, Natisha says my house is amazing. Yeah. Everybody wave to Dale and Chloe. They're up there somewhere. <laughs> So we visited um, all the, well, Mom and I, okay, so Josh started the stream in Animal Kingdom, and then Mom and I, uh, he bopped it over to us at Epcot, and then we bopped it back and forth for a little while, and then Josh went to Hollywood, and he streamed over there for a little bit, bopped it back to us here at Magic, and now Josh is heading to Magic, so. Between the two of us, we've been to all four parks. Yep. <laughs> or between the three, four of us, I guess, yes. Mom and Dad, and well. Josh and all of us. Yeah. All the people, even you guys. <laughs> Joey's World said, yes, Myers and the Mouse, it's called rain. <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys are hilarious. Too funny. Okay, well, Mom and I are going to have a late dinner, but it's all good. It's all good. Oh, hi. <laughs> no, nope, you did not take over my castle. It's mine. <laughs> No worries, no worries. We had a cookie. <laughs> Mom said snacks. We had a cookie, but it was delicious. It was. Delish. That's Chloe's doggy door. There's Murray's over there. Yeah, Murray's is over there. And then this, um, if you see this wire right here, that's what Dale swings down to go get my Starbucks every morning. Yeah, right. <laughs> Bam! Right down to Main Street. <laughs> Did you hear that, Dale? <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, too funny. That's where he gets my Starbucks. You would think they delivered if I lived in a castle, but it's all good. We have a Starbucks line right there. <laughs> I know, it's not too busy. It's pretty amazing. I'm sure it'll get busier as fireworks come, but, but you know, won't be too bad. Go say hi to Walt and Mickey, and then we'll probably bop you guys to Josh's phone. You'll probably take a monorail or a boat ride over with him. And Mom and I will get some dinner. Hey, 
So we got mom a uh, mystery pack pin set for her birthday too with, with the backpack. And one of them was Walt and Mickey, the partner statue. Super cool. Yeah. Hey, Moon Princess. Welcome in, everybody. So we will be live until way after close. Close is at 10, so we will be here until after that. There he is. Turn up the sun or turn down the sun? I don't know. It's kind of a weird lighting right now. Um, we're gonna go get some pizza. Right. Yep, dad is on his way too. Actually, I think he's almost here. I think he's gonna beat Josh. He's gonna meet Josh. Well, let's um, let's pop this way towards our food. <laughs> Not sure what Josh has planned, but I'm sure he'll go on a ride. Oh, hi! Thank you. <laughs> My name's Joe, but I watch all stuff all the time. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Yeah. Hope you guys are having fun. Yes. Awesome. Yes. Have a good night. Thank you. You can picture Dale swooping. Swooping into the castle window, superhero pose and coffee in hand. <laughs> I love it, Chantel. Mm. <laughs> All right, yes, it can take a while from another park to get to MK. So true. Um, Dan, Dan S, 1999, get an orange Joel Whip at Sunshine Tree Terrace. Hi, how are you? We're good. Oh, that's so cool. Hi, do you want to say hi on the? Yeah, we're live right now. Hello. And what are your names? I'm Louise. Louise. My name's Samantha. Samantha. And what's yours? Bennett. Ben she said it like <laughs> <laughs> I think it's ben Bennett. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. Well, so nice to see you. Nice We're to see fun you. Day. We are. Are you guys having fun? Yes. Good. Where are you uh, from? We're from Ohio. Ohio. So not too far. We lived in Indiana. Oh, really? Yeah, we grew up there. Yep. yep. Been here for a while, but you know, that's where we were born and raised. Yeah. So. yeah. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. At least it's not. Yes, yes, today. and Josh is on his way now. Oh, so, fun. so yeah, we'll all be together for fireworks. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we, we're going to the dessert party for the fireworks. Oh, I'm so oh, jealous. Yeah. You're going to love it. Yeah. Yeah. You are, well, thanks for stopping. Of there. course. Enjoy all those sweets, okay? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so, Dan, Dan Sorrow, 1999, get an orange Dual Whip at Sunshine Tree Terrace on us. If you like them, it's our favorite. Thank you, Dan. I've had them before. They are very good. Very, very good. Thank you so much, Dan. Appreciate that. And a lot of awesome hoppers that we're meeting. <laughs> so we're gonna go up the side ramp over here, head to our pizza, it's pizza time. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Should have asked who we were or whatever so we could see when we went by. <laughs> Myers, <laughs> Myers and the mouse. Oh my goodness, that's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, I know. I should have asked who he was. What's your name? <laughs> Ooh, you know what I might want later is a Nutella waffle. Mmm, those are delish. Delish. She's snorting right now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, hi, Reb Dib. How are you? Thank you so much. Uh, we're going to Pinocchio's. Pinocchio's has pizza. It's flatbread actually, but it's delish. Usually. Usually delish. Hello, reviews. Okay, let's see how many steps I have now. Um, 15,000. Favorite Disney park? Um, you know, like between Walt Disney World, Disneyland, and like overseas Disney? Or you mean at Disney World? What's my favorite park? Um, if you mean Disney World, it's right here, Magic Kingdom. Yeah. Can't go wrong with this, except for getting to it. That's one thing I yes, do not like as a pass holder. Living here, it's the hardest park to get to, but it is my favorite. 
I love them all really, but just can't beat Magic Kingdom. Man, it smells good. The food smell coming out of my cat, my house right now. The mice are high, hard at work. <laughs> oh no, Kevin, you felt like a thief. Oh no. <laughs> That's funny. That's my house. I wish there was a big tube that you could put merch in and send it to your couch. I know, right? <laughs> Wouldn't that be great? Actually, it'd probably be too dangerous because sometimes you don't buy stuff because you're like, oh, I don't want to, I don't want to hold that. And then later you're like, I'm glad I didn't spend the money. Yes, Jenna is correct, and that's why we make reservations for breakfast at Contemporary, so it's easy to get the parks. Yes, that is a good way to do that. Jenna, are we BBQ on the back side of Castle next week? Yeah, let's let's barbecue exactly right behind my house, um, and then we can uh, hang out, uh, you know, in our lounge and wait for the fireworks. Sounds good to me. I love it. Yep, six and a half miles, exactly. All right, well, let's go find a seat and let's just put the here button because it's probably going to take a minute to get our food. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't look that busy, really, but... I'm hungry. Don't worry, guys. We're going to switch you to Josh here soon. And if we don't eat soon, uh, we're going to be cutting it close to getting ready for fireworks. So. Oh, yeah. You can sit right there. Yep, that's fine, Mom. So we won't have it long. Josh will take it here shortly. It really does. <laughs> Not gonna lie about that. This is where we're gonna eat. We actually might move inside once Josh takes it. That's true. It's gonna be nice and air conditioned in there. Yeah. Jenna, is it typical for adults to wear costumes at Mickey? It's not so scary. We're coming for the first time. Yes, Danielle, 100%. Um, don't hit it yet, I guess. Okay. Let's wait a little bit, just in case. Make sure. Make sure Josh is almost here. Yeah. Um, yes, adults dress up for Mickey's Not So Scary. Thousand, thousand percent. Oh, it's fun. It's amazing. Yeah. It's like you're a kid fun. again. And yeah. then if you, um, <laughs> if you do the costumes, oh, <laughs> you are totally fine. Yeah. I'm so sorry. No, 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 no. no, no please. Walk the castle and then there's just a random girl in it. Totally fine. No, no, no please do your fine. job. No worries. Thank yes. you. <laughs> um, but yeah, and it's fun to do like themed costumes as a family or as a couple or as a friend group. Like Myers and the Mouse and Dale and I were Avengers last year. That was yeah. super fun. I was Wanda, Dale was Vision, Kelly was uh, Captain America, and um, Ivone was um, Miss, Mrs. Mar no, not Mrs. Marvel. Captain Marvel. I'm like, I know it was a Marvel. <laughs> yeah. It was fun. Oh, good. Josh is ready. All right, guys. We are going to send you to Josh so Mom and I can eat. Go ahead and push the button, Mom. All right. And um, you're going to get to ride the monorail with Josh. And then we'll see you as soon as we're done eating. So we'll see you guys soon. Enjoy the monorail ride and the trip back into Magic Kingdom. Welcome in, guys. Getting ready to get on the monorail, somebody said. They wanted to see some transportation, so here you go. Transportation, our wish is your command. Uh, or, wait, your wish is our command. There you go. <laughs> I said it backwards. Uh, Mike, 13999, my wife Christy and I are watching you from Crystal Lake. Thank you, have a, have a great pizza. Oh, awesome, Mike, thank you. Sorry, uh, we just already switched away from Jenna and Mom, but they are gonna have a great pizza. And uh, yeah, Crystal Lake, very cool. Welcome in, guys. Monorail P2. Last time, this one was really cold air conditioning. I hope it's the same. I hadn't felt air conditioning that cold since, uh, I don't know, a long time ago. Super cool.
So I hope you guys are ready for some fun. A little monorail fun. Why not? Mom, yeah, 3,500 flatbreads, yeah, for sure. <clears throat> and also, um, I may go ride Pirates of the Caribbean. Let's see. Oh. Alright, we're not riding this one. That's alright, we'll ride the next one. No, they're just, um, they're just testing the monorails. This one is not ready for, uh, looks like it's ready to go though. This one's not ready to load yet. We have monorail coral over there on the other side. On the resort side. Yeah, I was going to take the, um, the boat, but it looked like it was, it just finished loading when I got there. And I thought, well, maybe this would be quicker, but all good. Yeah, we'll ride pirates when we get over there. Yeah, Timothy, I don't know. Actually, I, I think there's a lot of benefits to the monorail still, though. Because, uh, I mean, the Skyliner tech has been around for a long time, too, as long as there's been cable cars. So I would say they're probably both going to be around for a while. Because this one, uh, you know, this one, the monorail will operate in windy conditions too because it's more stable on the track. So. So this is the Transportation and Ticket Center. Yep, they, they're right. Laughing Place is still playing, you're right. So that's the Epcot line. There's three lines out of the TTC here. We call it TTC Transportation and Ticket Center. This is the main Magic Kingdom parking if you're not aware of how that works if you've never been here before. That line goes to Epcot a couple miles away. This is the express monorail line, which goes directly to Magic Kingdom. And that is the resort monorail line, which goes to the resorts. <clears throat> if you only take one mode of transportation from this point on, what would it be? Uh, monorail, for sure. Yeah, if I only had one, monorail, 100%. Also, the monorail has air conditioning when it works. <laughs> it's like Uncle Orville, <laughs> when it works. <laughs> We also have television when it works. <laughs> All right, we should be having a monorail here in just a second. Thanks for being here, everybody. Hit the like and enjoy. Oh, it does sound like the kids' good night, doesn't it? Yep. This is just the symphonic version of When You Wish Upon a Star. It's from the official album. It's a good one, though. It is basically the same music they use in Kiss Goodnight. They just modify it a little bit towards the end. Yep, good catch.
Actually, this isn't from the album. Is this only Kiss Goodnight? You guys might be right. Well, okay, then it changes. The Kiss Goodnight arrangement's really cool. Sean says, I know you're going to switch the stream late, but you could do it now with no interruptions to what we say. Yeah, for sure. No, it's uh, very few, but we'll, 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 uh, we'll fix it at about uh, 8 o'clock because I, I went live at 8.30. So as long as I don't go over 12 hours, I'm fine. And, and I, like to, I like to have one stream longer because it, it just kind of helps it with the views. Like if one stream, the, the, the main stream gets a ton of views, it really helps quite a bit. Here it comes. Uh, no, Matthew, the parks are not as quiet as what the news is suggesting. It's just a, they need some more news to cover, I guess. They are a tiny bit slower, but it's not a huge difference. What you notice more is on the streets, <clears throat> the wait times are just the same, pretty much. Little, like a little less, but also, next week, uh, and actually the last week of July and the first week of August are always really slow. Especially the first week of August, because a lot of people start heading back to school. Um, especially those on the year-round school, and then the other part is, um, <laughs> then the I think I think they know us. <laughs> and the other part is um, where they, um, their people wait for their vacations for the parties, so they don't they don't come to Disney until the parties are. But yeah, good question. All right, here we go. Uh, all right. Please hold on to the handrail as they clear the door. They'll be closing in a moment. Thank you. Thank you. Please continue moving across the car. Please offer available seating to those needing special assistance. If you're standing, please hold on to the handrail and stay clear. Yeah, it is a lot of uh, a lot of hot weather, but today was nice. I mean, it's rain, but nice, uh, nice and cool for sure. Nice and cool. Oh good, we got a loudspeaker on this one. Enjoy guys. further traffic clearance. Please remember to stay clear of all automatic doors. If you're standing, please continue to hold on to the silver hand rings. Thank you. Whoa. 
Welcome aboard the Walt Disney World Express Monorail, your highway in the sky to the Magic Kingdom. For those of you standing, please hold on to the handrails throughout our journey and stay clear of the doors. For the comfort of others, no smoking, please. We are now circling the Disney Creek in seven seats to do it. Bay Lake Tower at Disney's Contemporary Resort, a part of Disney Vacation Club. Remember to collect your belongings and take young children by the hand. As you exit, please remember to collect your belongings and take young children by the hand. As you exit, please lower your head and watch your step. Thank you. When boarding, please move all the way across your car to make room for everyone. Only offer a baby seat. All right. Awesome. Well, here we are. Welcome in, everybody.
Well, almost welcome into the Magic Kingdom. I, I don't know why I like taking the stairs. It's just a little less crowded. It's like Tower Chair. Take the stairs. I love that monorail ride. I hope you enjoyed. You could hear a lot of the narration. Usually it's been, lately it's been so quiet you can't hear it. But uh, on that monorail it was turned up. So welcome. We're going to do our, at least my final park hop of the day. Jenna has been here for a little bit. So yeah, we've already completed four parks, but this will technically be my third park today. And you can do four parks in one day. It's just, we thought it would be cool to do it this way to show, uh, you know, several things at a time and not have as much uh, downtime between as you would on a normal four park stream. The transportation is, is fun for some as well though. So I thought, well, let's just show the monorail. That worked out well. And then Jenna needed to eat because it was getting super late. The, the timing made it a little late with me doing, doing rise. I thought, you know, probably shouldn't have done rise, but it was fun. So I'm glad. And yeah, I knew you guys would enjoy it. And Jenna and mom were troopers and they held the stream until I got done with dinner and got over. And I feel great. Third park. Here we go. Almost 3,800 people as we come into Magic Kingdom. And now you feel like you got to come too. So it's a little bit more park hopping this time. Okay, guys. Josh, this has been absolutely terrific here at Marketing Genius, oh my goodness. Well, thank you very much. That's definitely not ever been something I've thought about, but I guess, you know, you do think about marketing your streams a little bit and thumbnails and stuff, but yeah, I don't know. I haven't really ever thought of it quite that way, so that's pretty cool, thank you. Here we go. <laughs> What's for dinner? Uh, I had chicken strips this time. So yeah, cool stuff. There we go. All right, check my finger on here. And we're green. Thank you. I wish we could ride the train, but it is all closed up for the night. Yep, they're having pizza. I had uh, chicken strips. All right. The lights were on inside Space Mountain. Nice. I always love that, Duncan. We had them. Uh, we had that last week when I was at. Uh, had that last week when I was doing my uh, like nine-hour stream here at Magic Kingdom. I did it. No, it wasn't all day really, but I did a long stream. All right, we're back. I'm sorry, how long was it lagging? I forgot, there is a dead spot right here for AT&T. And I needed to switch to T-Mobile and I forgot. So we are all back and better than ever. Sorry about that. We'll do another little lap around here. How, yeah, how long did it lag for, guys? It's not that humid, no, it's great. Let me check my let me check my wait times out for for uh for pirates. Stalled right as we went under. It's fine. Okay, so it wasn't that long then. I gotta remember that. Uh, it's 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 just it's gotta be a oh see my yeah see my iPhone is on AT and T too. Does not work at all. So uh, one thing you'll notice, um. Roy and Minnie are not here anymore because they've gotten them ready for the uh, Halloween party decorations to be here. You see Roy and Minnie are over here. 40 seconds, okay. Well, thank you guys for being patient while I came back. Uh, I totally forgot that always lags there, so that's okay. Yeah, so there's Roy and Minnie. They are moved in time for the Halloween party, which is crazy. It's only July 23rd, but they, you know, Disney, they do a good job getting ready for stuff. All right. So welcome back everybody. Go ahead and hit the live button. Make sure you're live. Sometimes YouTube, when it lags, it'll put you behind. So if you want to make sure you're live, just uh, all you have to do is close the stream and reopen it or tap on the, tap anywhere on the picture. And uh, then when you see the word live, just make sure it's red. Create an automation to give yourself a message when you get to that area and remind you to switch. Oh yeah. Hi. Hey, how are you? It's Katie Oh, nice to meet you. Yeah, my husband. We wanted to see here. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. So it's funny, I, you guys are from Jasper, right? Yeah. So I heard um, 
I heard the, the baseball player from Jasper got inducted into the Hall of Fame today, my dad was saying. Yeah, Scott, Scott Rowland. Yeah. Scott Rowland. Yeah, I couldn't remember his name, but yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's the one. You guys want to say hi on the stream? Sure. So Katie, and what was your name? I'm sorry. Doug. Doug. Emma and Aiden, very yeah. cool. Well, it's nice to meet you guys. I want to say hi to my brother Neil and uh, Joyce and Joey. They can watch it. They can watch it. Checking us out. So. Oh, awesome. That's very cool. You guys having a good trip so far? Yeah, it's our last night, so we're just kind of soaking it all in. Oh, yeah, yep. Take it slow, take soak it in. One last time for, for a little while. Oh, yeah. Yeah, when we got annual passes, we'd come a couple times a year and we would come even, say our plane was in the afternoon, we'd come for a couple hours in the morning just to see the castle one That's more time. <laughs> So. Yeah, in October, but we, had, we have to go find a phone case. I lost my phone on this small roll. Oh, your, oh, wow. Your whole phone? Yeah, the whole thing. It went from the exit. There's like a tiny strip. Yeah. Oh, so you, but you did get it phone replaced. Just I got needed. a new phone, but we did find the old one. It still works. So. Wow. I know. Yeah, no, they're, they're pretty waterproof now. So. Yeah. So yeah, that's, really that's pretty cool. Yeah. That's very cool. You know, it's been great, but we've been, you know, we've been switching back and forth. And so, um. Yeah, you're good. Um, yeah, we've been switching back and forth, so it's given us a little bit of a break. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> yeah. But we won't keep you. We just have to say hey. Well, it's great to meet you guys. They've been in the chat a lot. It's so usually under your name, right? Yeah. Yeah. We like to watch because the kids will watch, and then she pretends she's on the roller coasters or whatever you're riding. That's awesome. Do you put your hands up? Yeah, we around the Oh, that's so much fun. Yeah, Liam's like that too. He loves the roller coasters. He doesn't like any scary movies. If it's anything at all scary, he's 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 like, nope, I'm out. But any roller coaster, he's good. He'll ride it. <laughs> yeah. You guys have a good night. Absolutely. It's nice to meet you guys again and enjoy the rest of your night here tonight. Oh, for sure. Absolutely. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> what, what was that? You wanted to say cheese? Okay, say cheese. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys so yeah 20 minutes till part two switch so i'll tell you what i might do well let's just walk around here a little bit take in the ambiance a little bit at magic kingdom and then i'll switch the stream here in a little bit the cool thing is i've got the stream we finally figured out this stream to stream hopping i've got the stream set up so that uh it will automatically redirect you over to the new stream so uh most of the time if you've got auto redirect set up if not Moppers will post the link to the new stream several times, and uh, we'll go from there. If you're wondering why do we have to do this, YouTube has a limit of 12 hours on a stream, and so uh, after 12 hours, nothing you do after 12 hours is saved. So we could totally keep going, but everything after 12 hours would be deleted, so you wouldn't see any on the replay. You wouldn't see any anything that happened then. And of course, we don't want to do that. We actually had our very first all-day stream. We didn't know that, and uh, we only went like, I don't know, half an hour over or something and it uh it cut that part out but still was uh kind of crazy so now we know yeah it was nice to meet them hey how's it going jim sorry i saw you say hi right as a uh, hopper uh, from jasper was saying hi so hello jim and steph nice nice to see you thanks for being here hope you're doing well oh my shirt yeah yeah yeah. i did i changed because i changed shirts at each park guys i changed shirts at each park here check this out ready Magic Kingdom shirt. <laughs> so there you go. So I've got my chains to shirt every time. This is my uh, this is my 50th anniversary Magic Kingdom shirt. So yeah, so I'm super excited to. Uh, I don't know. It's just something fun I tried. So I actually had the Animal Kingdom shirt on earlier. I only showed it like once or twice. I never. You guys know I never selfie mode. So, um, but anyway, yeah, Magic Kingdom shirt. It's one of my favorite shirts. I really almost like just kept it as a souvenir. But you know what? Shirts are made to be worn. So. Yes, it's not in perfect condition anymore, but you know, it's got great memories in it, so I love it. But anyway, that's my shirt. I change for every park. I don't usually do stuff like that, but hey, I, the idea hit me and it was fun. Oh, Tim check. <laughs> Tim check one, two, one, two. Tim check one, Tim check two. All right. Everybody's getting ready for fireworks already. It really has been a wonderful day for a stream. Like, I mean, it's a tiny bit sticky now, but honestly, because of the rain, the thing is, because the rain has kept it and clouds have kept it cool for so long, it's actually, hi, how are you? Good. Oh, thank you, I appreciate it. Aw. 
cool. Did you guys want to say hi on the stream? No, that's okay. We'll okay. Take a picture uh, absolutely. <laughs> okay. You want to take a picture here? Take a picture. Yeah, however you want to do it, it's fine. Yeah, thanks. Awesome. Thanks so much. Nice to meet you guys. Take care. Yeah. I've always seen your sister and your mom and dad. Oh, okay. <laughs> but I've never seen so. Well, there you go. <laughs> what was your name? Suzanne. Nice to meet you, Suzanne, and family. Yeah, <laughs> nice to meet both of you. Thanks. Awesome. Have fun, guys. So yeah, the, the rain and the clouds have really kept it uh, cool today. It was a huge blessing. So I, I was kind of thinking, I saw a rain chance today. I thought, you know, that might actually be a good thing. Because, uh, yeah, the, you know, sticky rain is not great, but when it keeps the temperatures down, it feels so wonderful. It almost feels like if it wasn't humid, it would feel a little bit fall-like. What's the temp right now? Uh, it says 86. It feels more like 82. What is a tiny bit sticky for Florida? I don't know, like... 70% humidity probably. A uh, beautiful castle. Here, let's go over and get a side view of the castle. We'll probably go to Pirates. What's Pirates wait time right now? Hold on. We got, okay, it's 10 minutes. Yeah, so Pirates is a walk on. <sighs> so I'd like to, so we'll start the next stream with the Pirates ride. I think that'll be a great way to start the next stream, won't it? So yeah, anyway. <laughs> Let's get a castle side view, though. I love this castle side view. It's the best. Uh, Dad's coming in just a bit. He likes to take breaks during the day. He doesn't like to go. Even, even you know, and it has nothing to do with him getting older. He, even when he was, you know, like, younger when we were kids, he, he loved to take breaks in the afternoon. So, yep, he, you know, it's good. He just likes to take it easy and pace himself, and I think that's good. I was the one a lot of times that, you know, I'm sure you're all super surprised by this, but I was the one a lot of times when we did family vacations that I would go into the parks. Everybody else would say, we're taking a break. And I would go back into the park by myself or stay in the parks. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even leave to go back to the hotel when we were not living here. I would just chill here in the park. And that's when I learned that, you know, it's not too bad being here by yourself. 80 degrees is not autumn. Like, no, you're right. You're right. I know. Well, considering it was a hundred and something yesterday, you know, <laughs> Compared to that, <laughs> that's my that's my point of reference is that it was a hundred and something earlier, or not earlier yesterday, like heat index of a hundred. So yeah. Uh, let's see what David say. Oh, he's here. Um, oh really? You went to Disneyland? Didn't care for? I love Disneyland. It's been tough for is today. Lots of work and really wanted to watch the stream. Oh, so sorry, David. Well is the good news is you guys can watch the replay anytime. I know it's not quite the same, but you're a trooper and, and good job getting your work done. As a teacher, I understand how important that is and uh, I'm, sure you're, I'm sure your mom and dad were super helpful and supportive getting all that done. It's great to have, great to have supportive parents when you're getting your schoolwork done, that is for sure. We went from open to park closed back in the 80s. Nice. Such a shock. Yeah, it is. <laughs> How many steps have I taken? I have no idea. It probably won't show the steps that I've taken. Um, I don't know. It probably won't show the steps because I haven't, uh, I don't move my arms as much, but it's right now it says, let me see, hold on. Uh, 18,661 right now is what it says. I don't know. So yeah, I'm not sure. It says I've climbed stairs. I guess maybe the monorail ramps count as stairs. I didn't really, I don't think I climbed any stairs. Well, I guess I climbed a few here and there, but not enough to be a whole flight. All right, guys. Love doing the parks from rope drop to close, but getting older, it's tough, especially when we go in June. Thanks for the awesome stream, Josh, Jenna, Mom, and Dad, for sure. It's our pleasure. <clears throat> so I'm going to walk leisurely down to Pirates. I'm going to switch the stream. We'll go from there. Actually, you know what I'll do? I don't know if Jenna wants to be here. Let me ask Jenna if she wants to be there when we switch the stream. She might. Or if she wants me to just go ahead and do it. I'll ask her. Do you want to be with me when I switch the stream, period? We need to switch it around 8. Or I can just do it. All right. Beautiful, beautiful night.
one of the nice things too about doing this is uh, okay so she's almost done so I'll walk up well I'll walk up by Jenna then okay I'm gonna come that direction can I go up that way yeah, I can let's walk through the castle and we'll go ride pirates That colleague put the phone on a shaker table and said he'd take 850,000 steps. You walked 200 miles today. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, I wonder how many miles it did actually say. Yeah, I don't swing my arm enough when I'm when I have my phone because I'm always trying to stay st stable for the phone um, or for the uh, for the stream to be sturdy. There you go. That's a uh, friendship fair show times. If anybody's curious about that, I mean, I know it's in the app, but there you go. Kind of cool. Yeah, check and make sure you're subscribed. That's right, guys. Beautiful view, huh? So the new, yeah, I didn't even notice the new banners. Yep, you're right. You guys are more observant than I am. Okay, it's closed. All right, I'll just go around. Okay. This is definitely helping. That's awesome, David. Okay, period. I will head towards Fantasyland. Or I can just end it if you don't want to rush. It's totally fine. Yeah, it's got to be over 10 miles. Oh, for sure, for sure. It's been over 10 miles, for sure. You know, because that doesn't... It, well, it does count some of the parking lot time that I've done, but I just hadn't really... Uh, you know, I don't know if I had... Like I said, if I had shaken my arm enough, because you basically have to be... You basically have to be waving your arm back and forth like this while you're walking. So, yeah, to make it work. <clears throat> I'm sure nobody's minding the castle views right now. So amazing how many people have just continued to watch all day. Uh, let me know if you've been watching since the very beginning. If not, no worries. It's not to you know it's not to make anybody feel bad, but just you know if you have, that's cool. After day is could create a quadra quadratic equation and graph to tell you about the cookies and cokes needed for an all-day stream. That's amazing, David. I don't know that I could do that right now. I know the word quadratic, you know, but I don't remember how to do one. <laughs> I had to study a lot of that when I was taking my GRE for graduate school. But then, <laughs> yeah, then I, yeah, I had forgotten it again. Then I found out that I didn't even have to take the GRE because I had gotten a high GPA for my undergrad. <laughs> so, fun times. <clears throat> All right, I have been, lots of people. Okay, let's see who, who else. Who said yes? Oops. Sorry. All right. Hello. All right. Yeah, we love pirates, Kelly. All right. So Minnie Mouse fan has uh, Plymouth Rock says we ha uh, screenshot. Kelly says we have Shelby in and out. Eli, Chris, nine thirty. Keith, that would be me. Indiana's getting rain. Disney Daydreamer. Quadratic equations. That makes my head hurt. Yeah, for sure. For sure, for sure. Tickle tail, Tigger Tail John, thank you so much. Good, glad that you guys have been watching too. I don't think I can go this way. I think they're only letting people out of the area. They're getting ready for fireworks. Lots of people all the way around. Grand Streeters, Caitlin. From Phoenix, nice. Okay, here we'll get a shot of the castle before we go back around. Been here since AK, nice. Oak Forest, hey Peach. Julie, Joey's World, nice. Let's go around here, we'll find Jenna. I've been here all day, thank you. Hey Amy, hello Jennifer. The whole day has been better watching the stream. Awesome, Corey, Matt, Kelly, Jossa family, Gia. Yeah, it's been a long day. Stepped away for a moment or two. Blue Polo. Since the beginning, did go to Disney Springs. Hey, that's cool. 
you could wear the tracker on your ankle. Yes, Ashley, that's probably a good point. Yes. Yeah, on my ankle, that would probably give a better accurate total because it would move. It would have to move every time I walk. Stream has been much needed. Had an overwhelming emotional weekend after losing my Nana. Oh, I'm so sorry, Marcella. Oh wow, you you were her and the your grandfather took you on your first Disney trip. Wow. Sorry to hear that. Molly's been watching since 8:30 or 7:30 Central. Uh, Chris. Wonderland Alice, Manila J, Mer, uh, Lisa, Li uh, Liza Mancini, Dini Bowers, 999. Hello from Utah. I want to thank you for all your help planning our October trip to celebrate our 50th wedding anniversary. We feel a lot better about the trip. Bless your heart and thank you. Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad you feel a lot better about it, Dinia. Very cool. I remember you saying that earlier that you guys were coming. Well, I know you're going to have a great time. <clears throat> Gigi's been here all day. Favorite shot. Jen's been here all day. Cool. Just got home from eight days, 84 miles. Wow. G Duke, that's amazing. Michelle all day, Disney Pixie all day, Connie, Keith. Uh, let's see, of course, boys, yep. Hey, Brad. Oh, qu uh, quadratic equations, yeah, for sure. All day, Chad, Heidi, Luna, Matthew, old Mr. Young Dude, very cool. Yeah, you guys said you were gonna be in and out getting work done and stuff, that's good, very good. Okay. I had a break to go on my Pilates class, that's okay. We've had it playing in the background, which sounds down for almost all day. This view has me and Steph for last and just too long. Yeah, Jim, you guys for sure. But I understand it's hard sometimes. Micros only doze off a few times. Hey, that's all good. Hope you had a relaxing Sunday. Well, let us do the walking for you. Hey, Victor, my third high of the day. Uh, watching on TV and interacting on the phone. Awesome, Victor. Hey, Amy, Mary. Awesome. Nora, just started watching this morning, Mark. Becky and Justine. Sharmona. There's uh, Dad had, had the volume changed. Turned up when changing my oil. Oh, very cool. When you told that the lady screaming is okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, she was okay. Classy Disney mom's been off watching since this morning. Very nice. Yeah. Awesome, guys. Started at 3 p.m. UK time. We've had the stream on since 8.30 this morning. Very cool. All right. I believe you had a few people subscribe to Patreon today if you want to take a look before the end of the day. Thank you, Allie, for sure. I didn't see any yet, but sometimes it's a little bit delayed. All right, guys, I got to catch back up. <clears throat> oh, I almost got them all. Aiden, Ben, all day. Brian, favorite part of the day so far? Oh, gee, I don't know. Pretty good. And pretty good day. Blips a lag? All right, here, hold on. Are we better now? Cleaning the barn today. Know where I did? Yali Mom. We got up this AM, went to San Diego Zoo. Nice. All right, cool. Darth Mommy, all day. Keith, Ragnar. Been here since the beginning. We'll stay until you sign off later. Another great stream. Thank you, Ragnar. Appreciate it. Hey, Melissa. Hey, Steve. <clears throat> are the blips gone? I can see clearly now the blips are gone. I can see all obstacles in my way. All right. Washington from Wisconsin. Very cool. On and off all day since 8 a.m. Pacific. Awesome. Let me check my email real quick and see if we got any uh, new Patreons. <clears throat> Let's see. I don't, oh, I, I do see, <clears throat> I see one so far. Uh, sometimes they're a little late coming in, but Dan, Dan just became a very generous Pat Patreon member. Dan, he's in the chat. I'll just say his whole name because his name's in the same as in the chat. Dan Sorrow became a Patreon member. Thank you so much, Dan, for being a new Patreon member. Very much appreciate if you guys want to join Patreon to support us that way. <clears throat> we get 90-something percent of that, too. So <clears throat> all your support is very much appreciated. And we will try and post more on there. Um, but it's just uh, it's been very busy. So, but yeah, we'll post more on there soon. So yeah, Jenna's going to come meet me. We're going to end the stream. And then we will... I'll switch to the new stream. So, yeah. Then we'll go do Pirates. Awesome. That's awesome, Rosalie. All right. I thought I heard Jenna say some, my name. All right. Look how beautiful that is. Hey, we can't go up to the castle to selfie, but we can get close enough. They've got to get it cleared out, so I get that. We watched them from 8.30 to 10.30, church back at noon. Very cool. 
Mom's birthday gift was a uh, was an awesome lounge fly bag that she's been wanting, and we all went in together on it. And then a couple other things, some pins and stuff that Jenna got. <laughs> so very cool. There she is. All right, guys. So we're gonna wrap this stream up and start the next one, and we're good. Hello, How's welcome. It going? I to the like stream. I've seen you all day, but I haven't. I have not seen you all day. <laughs> <coughs> I'm almost done, not quite. That's fine. I thought we can end the stream and start it together, and then I'll go back. Sounds good. My other phone's about to die. So, Moppers, yeah, I know. Moppers, uh, please post the link to the new stream. It should automatically take you, but if it doesn't, you can also just go back to our channel page and it should come up. Where are we going? Uh, I was going to go by the castle, but I think uh, we can just get as close as we can here. Yeah, maybe we can just get kind of like over here. Okay, that's fine. Maybe, maybe. I don't want to get too far away from where you're at, though. Well, here, we can go right here. You can see it. Yeah, right here. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, here we go. So, guys, well, don't go anywhere. We're coming back. Well, we'll go somewhere. Go to the second stream. Yes, go there. <laughs> don't stay here. Yeah. But, yeah, it's been a perfect day for stream. It's been perfect weather. It's Everything awesome. awesome. Yeah, it turned out great. So, sorry it was late with you guys eating because I, I did the rise, but everybody enjoyed it. So, and you guys... You, you guys did the, uh, what do you call it, the, the flag retreat? That was amazing. And then the cavalcade, yeah. it all like worked out. That worked out awesome. so perfect. Yeah. I was about to go on Pirates, so I was like, eh, let's save that for the second stream. Yeah. That's how I'll start the second stream. I was going to say, you go ahead on that, and we'll meet you right after. Very good. So we got all the sponsors? Yep, one time. Yeah. <laughs> yep, one time. Okay. we'll do them again in the next one. Yeah, we'll do them again in the next one. Check out all the awesome sponsors, guys. Let's go selfie it up. And here we go. No, I don't have pizza in my yeah, there we go. Castle right there. Perfect. <laughs> no pizza. Okay. All right. So yeah, I got my, I got my uh, Magic Kingdom shirt, shirt on. I did. I did it. <laughs> I love it. That's awesome. So yeah, part one. I know. Three, two, one. That's right. <laughs> so, yeah, it should take you over there automatically. Wait like, I don't know, wait like a minute. And if it doesn't take you over, then uh, go ahead and just, you know, close out and then open the new stream. All right. That's right. <laughs> yeah, just like push and then push and then push the other one. There you go. Right. Just like that. Just like that. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you in a bit. See you soon on the next stream. That's right. So for now, have a great, big, beautiful tomorrow. Bye.